Hello, everybody, my loves. I have good news and bad news. The good news is we're going to do a really long stream tonight. The bad news is I'm most likely going to take tomorrow off because I have a lot of things that need to be finished. And I have so many meetings I need to take. So I'm just going to take tomorrow off and take a ton of meetings and work on a lot of stuff. How are you all doing? I have some stories to tell you. My friend canceled on me tonight, it, it, this morning. My God. Okay, give me a few minutes, my loves, and we're going to get started, all right? Long stream ahead. Full wind, full speed ahead. I want to try to do a boss in Terraria today.
Hello, my loves. Hello, hello, hello. Are you ready? It's a big day. It's a big, big day. It's an exciting and big day. It's a big day of video games, of Terraria. Maybe I can fight a boss. Dun, dun, dun. Hold on. Sorry, I'm actually answering a bunch of messages about work. Oh. Mm. Okay. You know when you first start answering about work and then everybody replies to you and you're like, oh god. Oh god, they're actually all here. Uh. Okay. All right, whether they are here or not, they can wait 12 hours for me to reply because I am here for you, my love. Hello, good morning, good afternoon. It's a big day with big moves, big money moves, big Terraria money moves. How is everybody today? How is everybody today? It is Matarakan. Hello, Phantom. Are you having a good day? Are you having a good night? I swear I thought today was Thursday, you guys. I thought today was Thursday. I thought we were almost at the weekend. Oh my goodness. I thought you said big boobs? Big boobs? <laughs> there was a Nicki Minaj meme that I think went viral during the um, COVID. She went, big boobs? child anyway because <laughs> she was i think i think it was her right and she was on um on on tiktok live i think or instagram lives and she was like what are you guys talking about is that morning voice no i've been awake for a little bit it's just i haven't talked much today so my voice isn't fully warmed up i have a little bit of yapping to do and then we're gonna be playing terraria as for my yapping my friend canceled on me this morning. Um, you know, I'm a bit sad. I was looking forward to seeing her, but also I would so much rather my friend, if she's not feeling well, to hang out with me. If she is not feeling 100% there, I don't want to make, you know, make her come out and then sit and be miserable and think I cannot wait to be done with Matara so I can go home so it's fine she did message me this morning at 8 in the morning and she said oh I can't believe the weather's not good and then after she messaged me again she said look I'm really not feeling going in the snow I have a headache I'm tired I'm lazy I'm just not there I said that's fine don't worry about it don't worry about it and it's good. I always tell my friends, you can cancel anytime, but please try to do it before I travel. Once I start traveling, that's when I get a little annoyed, right? If 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 we confirm plans all day and then you cancel maybe 30 minutes before the plans while I'm I changed, I'm in the bus, I'm in the train, I'm in the Uber. That that's when I'm 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 like, please you know, d try to cancel anytime before I get to traveling. Thank you so much for the two months, my dear. Thank you, Gingy. I appreciate it, darling. And again, I think when, when you become older, I would much rather spend quality time with my friend where we're both excited to spend time together. And if for whatever reason, my friend is not feeling up to it, it just, it does kind of suck because it's been a while since I saw her and I probably won't see her for a little while. Unless, because now she's going on a trip soon, and then I have my, once my April project launches, I'm going to be busy. <laughs> Did I get to sleep more? A little bit. I woke up early, and I took the morning to myself. It's been a while since I cleaned my room. 
I did a little bit of spring cleaning in my clothes. I did skincare. Honestly, just I did skincare. I did my nails. I did all that stuff. And tomorrow, I do have sad news for you. I'm taking tomorrow off just because I need to take so many meetings. And I worry that if I take a lot of meetings in my day and I'm talking and then I stream, it's I'm going to be exhausted. But Friday, I'm going to be doing a long stream. I'm going to be going live at 3 p.m. and we're going to be signing posters. We're going to be signing posters. We're going to be yapping. It's going to be fun. I'm excited for us. Thank you, Napalm, and thank you, Braze, for subscribing. I really appreciate it. Does doing all that stuff make you feel like more of a person? I, how do I say this? I find it fairly easy to neglect myself. Alex, thank you so much for the five months. I feel especially with, I don't know if anybody else is like this. Because of the internet and because of the video games and because you're always kind of connected and you're getting all the time this dopamine and this excitement. And I'm very extroverted, so I actually get even more energized while I'm talking to people in Discord or yapping or anything or watching streams. And I find it very easy to neglect myself. And one of the reasons I moved back with, with my family is because I remember when I first debuted in Vishojo at one point, I didn't wash my hair for three weeks. I showered, but... I was just never going outside. So at some point, I didn't wash my hair. That being said, um, I don't have very greasy hair. And because my hair is dyed, so it's dry, it, it gets kind of greasy incredibly slowly. So it looked fine if somebody would see me, but I secretly didn't wash my hair for three weeks. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I do find it very easy to neglect self-care. And uh, I'm trying to get better at that. I'm trying to get better at even, you know, I get out of the shower to lotion my body, lotion my skin, get get another manicure, uh, do my skincare. I have so much skincare. I have so much stuff. So I just did that this morning and it took a while and it felt good. How about everybody else? Did you have a good time? Hi, Leche. How are you? I'm going to be playing Terraria today. I want to try and fight a boss. So you guys might have to guide me into how to make the boss spawn because I haven't gotten the boss to spawn. I don't know how. Yoga, you know what I've noticed? This has kind of been my rule of thumb for when I feel down. I have noticed this and maybe I am not, I am wrong here, but I have noticed if I feel sad, inside the house going outside the house will make me happier even if it's just going for a 20 minute walk to the store to buy a chocolate bar and then go back easy okay that's number one number two if i'm feeling sad outside of the house then i try to cancel whatever i have going on and go back home as soon as possible <laughs> i'll try to go back home as soon as possible i don't know what it is but changing environments makes me happy if i'm unhappy outside go the heck inside if i'm unhappy inside go the heck outside it really makes a difference Ooh, leche that sounds fun when in doubt ask the guide i will be asking you all for for help no worries that sounds fun frank it what is the series on is it on amazon are they doing an x-men tv show are they bringing my boy gambit in it Yeah, Avi, because I only played Terraria one time before and I remember a boss spawned early for my friend and I and now there's no boss spawning. You're going to a con next weekend. Are you going to PAX East? If you do, please drink an overpriced Hilton Lobby drink in my health and dedicate it to me, please. It's Disney Plus. But is it a new show or is it just a rerun of the of the older one? Hi, Niwa and hi, Zero. Hello, my loves.
Frosty, thank you for the prime, my dear. It's a continuation of the 90s cartoon. Cool. That's a pretty cool premise. Instead of a, instead of a reboot, they're just continuing what everybody knows. I like it. I like it. I like it. They did X-Men 97 so dirty. You're planning on going to ScottyCon. Who is Scotty and why does he have a convention? Scotty doesn't know. ScottyCon, student-run anime and games convention at Carnegie Mellon University. Cool. Welcome to our fourth year of ScottyCon. We hope you enjoy CMU's one and only and therefore best anime and video game convention. Cute. Uh, Oh, they do have a VTuber guest. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Cute. I want to have a chill Terraria stream and just kind of yap a little bit. Like I said, I, I think today when I when I took the time for self-care, I realized I've been I've been a little bit neglectful of my health. And uh Tomorrow, because of that, I'm I'm taking the day off. I have to do a lot of meetings. I need to set up a lot of things. I need to prepare a lot of things. And uh, I just know that my voice is going to hurt because I think I have three or four different meetings set up already for tomorrow. That plus streaming and then streaming the next day. It, it's. Yeah, so today just maybe a 10 hour stream. Terraria, we hang out, have a good time. Oh, wait, I have uh, six lenses. Maybe let's go back to the corrupted area. Maybe that could be fun. Mr. Sev, thank you so, so much for the tier two for six months. And thank you so much, Feet of Cheese, for the six months. No, I know, Lecherous. Everybody on Twitch is so understanding. And honestly... And honestly, um, okay, hold on. Doomer, I'm going to answer your question in just a moment. Let me just finish this train of thought because that's a good question. So I am aware that you are all going to be here even if I take time for myself. I'm also aware that I'm at a level of... It, it feels slimy to call it success, but I am aware that I'm at a level of popularity and success that... Uh, And sorry, I'm answering a DM from Joel. I'm at a level of popularity and success that I can afford to take time off and my channel won't die. In fact, I was actually looking at my stats the other day because I don't like to look at my stats daily, but I try to carve out time once a month. I should be doing it once a week, but I don't feel like it to kind of look at my stats to kind of know how things are going. And uh, I'm having better stats now after being away for a while than before. But the problem with stats is under these statistics, it's only numbers, right? It's only you have this amount of average viewers. Maybe I'm getting more raids. Maybe Henya is not streaming as much. Maybe it's just the games that I'm playing are popular, right? Right now, I was playing Supermarket Simulator, which was popular. Uh, Hell Divers is very popular for me. And, 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 you know, yesterday's stream too, Terraria was very good. So these numbers don't mean anything because maybe before my break, I just, there wasn't any great games that were engaging me in that same way. Doesn't really mean that much, but I am aware that I can take time off and I can take care of myself. I know. Have fun cooking. Uh, speaking about if VTubers existed when E3 existed. So the thing is, E3 only stopped existing a few years ago. VTubers definitely have existed. Uh, Kizuna AI has existed for quite a few years. And then, I don't know if you know about this, but some people like to talk about, oh, uh, Annoying Orange was the original YouTuber. Ba -ba 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 -ba. So it's up to you. I think VTubers have been around for a while but uh e e3 still had some anime stuff i remember square enix was doing a lot of things at e3 correlation versus causation mm. it's it's just i cannot look at my stats and just say oh 
I'm doing better because my numbers are higher. It doesn't mean anything. It, it just could be that I had a good week. I got good rates. Maybe, for example, Hanya's off for two weeks. You know, actually, what, what does matter on... <laughs> this is such a silly thing for viewership. Daylight savings time affects my viewership positively. So when I debuted, I started my stream one hour before Henya because of daylight savings time. When daylight savings time changed and Henya and I started at the same time, little dip in viewership. Now that we're back to daylight savings time and I'm back to streaming an hour before Henya. By the way, I never changed my streaming time. I kept my streaming time the same. Little bump in viewership. <laughs> Sometimes even daylight saving times affects viewership, right? It doesn't, what, am I going to now always put, no, just, just live your life. Streaming, content creation, YouTube, it's all about the long game. I'm telling you, I recently, um, on my VOD channel, one of my first Helldiver VODs is almost at 100k views. It randomly got picked up by the algorithm weeks after the video got posted. It's really about long-term stuff. Script, thank you so much for the five gifted. I love your name, Script Daddy. Is that is that because you write you write uh, internet internet? Uh, what are they called? Uh, you create programs, or do you just really love journaling? <laughs> Templar, thank you for the four months. It's a gift up. And Frosty, I feel like being when you stream long hours, people kind of kind of get to get to know your character and get to get to hang out. And yeah, I get it. Thank you. But first, a bit of yap. Have ghosts. We're probably going to talk for about an hour, just us. And then we're going to get into the game. I really like that. That's one of my favorite things about Twitch. Just while everybody's getting into the channel. Spiders. I'm so upset about yesterday. I was doing so good. I know I already had VIP in Krups, but I wanted to win another VIP. I'm very Stacy and very cornball. Thank you, Lustful. I think I just have a lot of confidence. But I also... You, do you guys remember that whole girl boss and girl failure? I'm a girl failure in a lot of ways, but I'm a girl boss in a lot of ways. And maybe one day as, as, as I keep opening up to you, maybe I'll open up about all my failed business ventures that I ever learned how to do and all that stuff. Thank you, Mental Path. I think consistency is a huge thing on Twitch and YouTube actually that gets rewarded. Which is why it's really hard if you are getting into Twitch and you're streaming part time. I notice sometimes people will say, oh, I want to start doing Twitch. I guess I'll stream once a week for three hours. Unfortunately, it's hard to build something that way. Am I just a regular girl? I am a bug from outer space who's inhabiting a regular girl. <laughs> I don't know if she's a girl. She's kind of a woman. <laughs> she's kind of old. She's definitely woman age, not girl age. Hope Decline, thank you so much. Thank you for the gift. We're not girl bossing. We're girl bugging. I like that. Always, always bugging the girls. That's what I do. Thank you, Voodoo. Thank you so much. Yeah, I think hitting your streaming stride is also really exciting. It's sometimes it's just exciting to stream. It's it's hard to explain when you're not a streamer, but some days you wake up and you just cannot wait to stream. Like today, I am genuinely so upset that I'm taking tomorrow off, but I understand that I need to take tomorrow off because I need, need, need to get work done. And if I have three to four meetings which are going to be an hour an hour and a half each on voice in discord and then stream i will have absolutely no more battery right imagine i'm like calcifer firing up Hal's moving castle i need to keep the flame alive and it's really fun when you have really good games when you have good synergy when you have good collabs thank you and uh 
I think this is another thing that's really exciting is first impressions, right? They're important, but there's been so many times when I thought streamers weren't for me and then I kept watching and eventually you just keep watching. And who knows, maybe in a month or two, maybe I'll play Metal Gear and I'll be doing Metal Gear four days out of the week and then you won't watch me for a month because maybe you don't really care about my playthrough of Metal Gear. And then... A month after that, I'll be building minis and drinking wine and you're going to be watching every day because that's suddenly the content that you really like. That's all right as well. Yep, the Momos, the Momos are running, are running in the basement and powering up my computer and powering up my whole castle. I like that. My little cave. Allô, show, comment ça va? Est-ce que tu vas aller, uh, est-ce que tu vas aller au truc en avril you know the thing I got invited but if I do go I might go a little incognito sorry for the secrecy you don't think so too many people hate you why would people hate you that's one thing that I always find a little you know I feel in small communities sometimes when you when you kind of like start talking to people and getting to know people there's a little bit of drama and I'm like how do you guys personally I don't really have time for it but in my defense I'm also streaming 12 hours a day <laughs> I'm sorry I'm sorry show that sucks Code Aurora, thank you for subscribing. I think that's the biggest thing I've learned as well, getting older, is the truth is important. And maybe I will speak the truth to my flesh mother. But sometimes, keeping the status quo is great. As much as I want to speak the truth sometimes, a lot of people here just want a place where they get rid of their worries, relax. And I also like that. That's initially why I turned to video games many, many years ago, why I turned to streaming, why I love streaming. Forget the world, stream, that's it. Lecherous, thank you for the gifted. Do I have any bug pets? No, because I don't have a permanent living place at the moment. I am a guest in, uh, in, in a house at the moment. This is also why I don't want to get cats or dogs or anything like that. I travel a lot and I'm a guest. I would eventually really, really, really love to have. Um, I know Thor has Pirate Software was talking about having hissing cockroaches. I look them up. They look incredible. I also want to grow my own mushrooms and things like that. But because I don't have my own permanent living situation, I feel not correct bringing in all my animals, all my things. But one day when I slow down a bit, I want to make sure I want to I want to have bugs because they're fairly easy to take care of a lot easier than a cat or a dog. Yeah, I'm going to be growing my own orcs. Hmm. Code, I didn't know about that. You know, growing mushrooms. Hell yeah, it's good. And I love eating mushrooms. Rose, thank you so much for subscribing, my love. Ooh, EMP fish. Those sound beautiful. Those sound great. I can see you having a ton of isopods. We'll get there. I just don't want to... Uh, I just don't want to rush it. Because right now, I don't have time to take care of anything. Matara's off-grid arc begins. I have talked about it a lot with my family. About potentially... The problem is where... Where we live right now, it's a little cold for that. And the only way you can kind of be a little bit more off the grid in Quebec or Ontario is by moving a little bit more up north. But then the winters get very harsh. You could still you could still grow things inside, like, for example, the mushrooms or you can make a greenhouse. But it's a lot of work and it's a lot of it's a lot. Um. I do think maybe we'd have to move somewhere warmer because already growing all your food for sustenance is so much easier when you're living in a slightly warmer environment. 
How does one grow a fungus? Pretty easy. All it requires is water and soil and darkness sometimes. And then the best part is they just keep growing and growing and regrowing. You're right. I could just eat the mold in the walls. You're right. What will be my dream place to live? I like warm climates. I love, I love Southern California. I really, really love, I think something like Thailand is a little too hot for me. But when I lived in California in Los Angeles 12 years ago, I think now, it was the perfect climate. It was amazing. Something like that. My aunt keeps bees and gets a jar of honey. Bees are, I know once you're a pro at beekeeping, it's, it seems very easy, but there's a lot to learn. And I'm not that passionate about bees, so it would take me a lot, but that sounds wonderful for your aunt. Burst, thank you for the six months, darling. Move down to Southeast US. It's kind of, it's not difficult to move to the United States, especially as a content creator. It's getting easier and easier, but there's a lot of stuff in the United States that as a Canadian, for example, I don't drive a car and I want to live in a place where I don't need to drive a car. Suddenly, a lot of US, USA closes up to me, right? It, it's, if I don't drive a car and I don't plan on driving a car, suddenly forget most places that are warm in the United States, which sucks because I know I love walkable communities. Oh. That sounds wonderful, Rosie. That actually sounds like a really fun course. Do I like horror games? No, I get scared very easy. My boss is being a giant stinky head. I'm sorry. Just breathe and imagine, imagine their demise. I'm sorry. That's always rough. Global warming will make everything warmer. That's not good, though. <laughs> That's not good. Yeah, I've, I've, uh, I've long explored, um, you know, you can get, for example, your roof. You can build your roof in a way that you get um, you get sun, a solar power. Already they do it a lot in Korea with even apartment buildings. There's technology in Korea that we haven't even started scratching the surface of in North America, which is wild to me. There's a lot, a lot of stuff that they're doing in, in Korea for solar energy that's so cool that I don't understand why we're not doing more of. But I think for, for a moment, it's something that I want to explore when I'm a little bit older, maybe not streaming as much. Oh yeah, solar energy has improved a ton. But it's still at a point where in Canada, for example, if you want to get a roof to do solar power, it's going to cost you a lot of money and it's not going to do that that much. Yeah, that's kind of the answer is because there's not enough money in it, right? Mm-hmm. I'm bitter that North America hasn't adopted bidets yet. I have the the cheap swipe bidet. Ludwig has the expensive bidet and the cheap one. I have the cheap swipe swipe one. But the problem is my previous apartment, um, it, the water would be lukewarm. But now the water is freezing cold. So <laughs> it's nice. It's good. It's clean. But, you know. Getting blasted by ice water is a little bit, uh, uh, <laughs> I had a lot of fun playing Death Must Die. We won a few rounds last night. And then, you know what I did off stream? I made the difficulty up to 20, 20 heat. I don't know what to call it because in Hades it's called heat. And now I died. I played a game. I played two games before stream started and I died. So I think I'm going to start with Terraria and then maybe. Yeah, it wakes you up a little too good. It's it's not it's not nice. 
It's not nice. You need mythic items? Yeah, I think I may have overshot it a bit. I made the bosses really strong. Now the bosses do like 60% more damage. They have 60% more health. They fire more projectiles. <laughs> so at first, I started beating the game consistently. And now, now we're back to... Now I made it hard enough where I'm actually back to... Okay, we gotta, we gotta slow down. We, we gotta cook. We gotta actually be careful here until we get better items and kind of get better strategies going. Thank you, Selvon, for finding us. Thank you for finding us and being here. I really appreciate it. Thank you for hanging out. Yeah, I was definitely getting cocky, I think, after, after we beat it a few times. I was getting cocky. You know? Getting a little bit cocky with it. Um, uh, hold on. Give me a moment. All right. Just checking. I just got like four pigs about something. So, um... Sorry, I got a lot of pings about something. Okay, we're good. I promise you, after April 1st, everything will be good. I just need to survive until April 1st. Greedy? Never. Book Club is still going. It's just going to take me a while to relaunch it back up again. We're going to relaunch it with Brutal Kooning, and then we're going to go straight into Assassinorum King Kingmaker. Don't worry, it's still on the table. It's just... I'm telling you, there's another thing that popped up, and just let me get to April 1st. Let me... Let me get through April 1st. That's it. That's it. Let me just... Oh... Oh, you might have to reread Brutal Kooning by, by the time that I launch Book Club. A lot of my bingo stuff. So I have this thing. A lot of my bingo sheet goals are almost completed. For example, in February, I was supposed to launch two songs. I have two songs almost completed. All the art is done. Just the videos waiting. But I got busy and then I went on a trip. Right? <laughs> Minis to paint. I'm 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 geared up. I'm so ready. Take it easier. I've been doing it. Offline collab, not yet. Horus Heresy books. The moment we're done with Assassinorum Kingmaker, they're coming. Oh my goodness, Ken. Thank you so much for the bits. What the heck? Thank you. Can I spend it? Can I... Can I spend it on minis? <laughs> Hello, I've come from YouTube. I, want, YouTube. I wanted to take a moment to give my thanks to you, your chat, and those that work with you on your channel for the enjoyable videos and fun times. Ken, you know what? You know what, nerd? You know what, nerd? Get loved. You're stuck here with us for at least three months. Connect your Discord to your Twitch. <gasps> Wait! The purchase could not be completed. There was an error during the order. Why can't I gift you a three-month subscription? Is my card blocked again? Did I accidentally get my card blocked again on... Oh, oh it's because you beat me to it, Leche. I was trying to gift him a three-month sub. Ah! <laughs> yeah. uh, for the enjoyable videos and fun time, I hope you for you to have more great times to come for you in your life and in all things you set out to achieve from your lips to god's ears thank you love see many clips with you or of you and they always give me a smile matara's chat you guys keep up the great work in supporting her sincerely thank you sorry for the interruption goodbye ken thank you so much please get your butt in the discord 
get to know everybody. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And the kind words and the kind everything. And Venom staying happy birthday, my love. I hope you have a beautiful day. I hope it is filled with adventure. I hope you visit some friends. I hope you eat good food. And I hope your birthday is a good one. Wasn't Geary an offline collab? Yeah, but she's not in the shoujo. Don't worry, my bingo list is gonna get is gonna get uh, is gonna get. There's gonna be a few a few things on the bingo on the bingo list that are gonna get uh, soon 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 soon. We're getting there. I'm telling you. I think I think I've been doing okay with expanding my friend circle slowly but surely. Not enough, I think, but we're expanding. We're doing our best. Oh God, Vanillas. Yesterday we had such a great collab. We were playing Helldivers. It was Bricky, me, Haruka, and Heavenly Father. The boys had a bromance that, listen, I knew they were going to hit it off. I did not think they were going to hit it off that well. I did not think so. I sped up Numi's friendship plan. We'll get there. I'm, I really feel like I befriend people much faster after I meet them in person. I'd like to believe that I'm a fairly good judge of character and it's a lot easier to judge character in person because I feel that when people are, I guess, deceitful or maybe toxic, you know, or maybe they lie or something, if they're just typing, it's hard to always tell Basically, if people are typing things to you, you need them to make mistakes a lot. You need them to promise something and then not deliver. And, you know, that's fine once, twice, three times. But then eventually, if they've promised you something five times and they're not delivering, then then you realize, okay. But in person, it's easier. Because, I don't know, I, I feel people just... I don't know. I think I think I'm pretty good with in person. So I, I, I get a better feel for people that way. And all, I got to be honest with you guys. I think it's also getting older. I'm less... As I'm getting older, I have a lot of friends that aren't streamers that I've been friends with before. So I already have friends in my life. And... Before making new friends, I want to make sure that my current friends feel appreciated, feel loved, feel taken care of, feel that I'm giving them enough time. And, and I, I do believe when I was younger, I rushed into friendships more. If my friends stopped maybe giving me the time or the attention, I would go into new friends and just instantly, instantly kind of, oh, okay, new friends. Yay, this is so much fun. But now that I've made enough new friends and I've been with enough new people, I I'm okay with taking it, taking it, um, we'll see, we'll see how it goes. Never meet Matara IRL to get exposed, exactly. Plus, if you meet me IRL, I have a higher chance of eating you or planting my eggs inside of you. You've got two friends and I struggle with that. With keeping up with them or with what? <laughs> I love how different the reactions are always to this. <laughs> I think a big change that happened after I know I, I learned this lesson a lot older than other people but um, one of my old co-workers she told me this and I really kept it to heart she said you're very nice and you give people a lot of chances but you should still be nice but be a little bit more guarded until people kind of show a bit more of themselves and then you can decide if this is the kind of person that you want to um, let into your life. 
And believe it or not, my flesh mother has been telling me this advice for many, many years now. And it only really started sinking after around COVID times when I thought, okay, just because somebody is nice to me or just because somebody seems nice to me, you kind of need a little bit of time to feel people out. Of course, people are nice to me when we're drinking or having fun or talking about something or collaborating, but not everybody wants to be my friend in the same way that I want to be their friend. Not everybody is happy for my successes in the way that I'm going to be happy for their successes. So I just kind of take a little bit more time with people and I warm up a little bit slower to them, which has been hard because I naturally want to jump into friendships. I want to jump into collaborations. So kind of forcing myself to take life a little bit slower. And guess what? It actually works. You know the worst part of it all? It works. Speaking of energy needing to match, I'm an organizer. If I need to organize something, I will DM you. I will organize it. I actually had a few friendships fall apart because I stopped inviting people out. I stopped making time. And I told myself, all right, well, we're friends. What if they invite me? And then they don't. <laughs> and then I realized, wait, we do have a friendship, but we have a friendship because I'm always the one putting in the work. So there's been a lot of that that happened around around quarantine time where I just kind of started looking at, at who's in my life, how people show up in my life. And it, it's, yeah. I think I'm a little bit older than a lot of other people on Twitch, so maybe that's why I seem so much more guarded. But I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. It's good. Thank you, Maita. I think I'm all right. Is the Discord welcoming? Kaltsu? Don't join. It'll suck you in. Every day, the Discord will demand a tribute of one happy birthday to zero every single day it's gonna consume your life you're gonna want to talk to momos all the time every day you're gonna wake up and check the discord and see what they're talking about you're gonna become like me you're gonna lurk in the discord while you're having meetings at work to see what they're talking about don't join don't do it don't do it it'll suck you in i personally don't think people hate me and i hate them if they don't contact me but I also just feel, oh, we're not, you know, we're not that close. And that's okay. I have very few people that I'm close with that I share very private things with. Because that's, okay, this has been one of the saddest things for me growing up. Is realizing that other people are not as happy for my happiness as I am. For example, my friend gets a really great sponsor or a really good job. I'm happy for them. But then maybe that person is only happy for me if they're doing better. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't know if this is pulling the curtain a bit much, but I had a lot of friendships that were kind of Twitch friendships. And, you know, you're kind of friends with people because you collaborate with them or you make content. And I was always the smaller creator. And... I was always so happy and I was always there. And then when I actually started becoming more popular, I've noticed a lot of people had a hard time with that. Where to me, I'm like, wow, you know, it, it's nice. Finally, it's my turn, right? Always the bridesmaid, never the bride. Now I'm the bride. But when those people were getting popular, when they were having success, I was always so happy for them and cheering them on. But then when it changed, it's it's just kind of realizing that not everybody is happy for your successes. And it's hard for me because I love sharing my successes with my pals. And I always feel that if your friend, here's an analogy. If your friend just started blowing up on YouTube, okay? First of all, you're happy for them, right? It's your friend. They worked hard. You love them. But second of all, from a business perspective, you are so well positioned to blow up as well because you're their friend. You're collabing with them. You're doing stuff. 
if your friend suddenly has a crazy hype trade on their stream and they make so much money, first of all, you're happy. Congratulations. They're amazing. You know the hard work they put in. They deserve that paycheck. But also, aren't you really well positioned to gain some people from their channel who might also be in your channel and tip you? Because you're always doing stuff with them. You're always kind of shown to their audience. So I never understood that. I think Twitch and YouTube is more than big enough as viewers, as, you know, money. There's enough of that for everybody. Yeah, aside from being friends, it's really good business. If your friend is blowing up instead of being envious, first of all, be happy it's your friend. Why are you envious? And second of all, it's really good. Exactly, Lecherous. And realistically, I love Mel. She works so hard. She deserves every penny. But also, I collab with Mel so much. People from Mel stream know me. We raid each other. It's such a big possibility that something like that happens here as well. Insecure people behave like that, which is a lot more people than you realize. So Onigiri can make you jealous. Is that what you got from this conversation? Is that what you got from this from this conversation? Yes, I am jealous of Onigiri's rice burning skills. <laughs> I am jealous of Onigiri's rice burning skills. Behemoth, thank you for the three months. I like I like that reference, 1010. I like it. Dowzel, thank you for the two months. Who is Jordan? It's Kylie's friend. Although I think they're not friends anymore because of... Okay, hear me out. This is some pop culture stuff. I know it because of TikTok. Because one of Kylie Jenner's half-sisters was dating this... Uh, not hockey, NBA guy, right? And then this friend Jordan, who's been friends with her family forever, allegedly kissed him or something. Allegedly. And then basically, right? If your half-sister's baby daddy... And then, and then your friend, Kiss, you got to pick sides. So something like that. Wasn't she having kids with Travis? Other sister. She has a few half sisters. It is. Isn't that tea? Isn't that a little bit of tea? Oh my goodness. <laughs> and that's a lot of drama. <laughs> How them fight to the death. Mm-hmm. 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 Battle Royale. Yeah, I've been, I've been kind of slow to making friends, but I'm happy with it. I think when you're younger, you rush into friendships and you kind of rush into making these like quick friends. And I guess the best way to put them is fair weather friends, right? When things are good, when you're happy, when things are great, they're your friends. They're friends because you drink together, you go out together, you collab together. But when it comes to talking about something real, talking about maybe darker times or not just butterflies and rainbows yeah I wished I rushed into I wish I rushed into friendships when I was young frankly it wasn't that bad rushing into friendships is not bad I think that it's a little bit different when it comes to twitch though because you also are working and if you think about it every twitch stream so my twitch stream is a little business, little momo corpo. So if I'm rushing into too many friendships, I'm also kind of opening up my business to scrutiny from friends or from other people. And I've worked hard on this. You've worked hard on this. We have a very nice community. We've worked hard to keep it clean. The mods do a good job. I want to be I want to be a little mindful. Oh yeah, Chibata, when you're younger, everybody's a friend, right? That's why there's a good, uh, there's, there's a good, um, words for that in Russian. There's satrudnik, which is like co-worker. Tavarish, which is a pal. Drug is a friend. It's very close. It's, oh, that's my friend. But a lot of people are tavarish. And you drink with tavarish, you go out with tavarish, you, you know, go to work. And then after you hang out, yeah. Hello, thank you for subscribing. Hi, Sparkling Pixie. How are you? I do overthinking, Leonardo, but I like overthinking. 
I, I know it seems like overthinking takes over my life in crippling ways, but I need you to understand, I love overthinking. I love just having the morning, going for a walk and thinking. I love it. I thought Tavarish is comrade, something like that. And Satrudnik, I think, is co-worker. Why does Matara seem like a Gemini? I'm an aquarium. I'm an aquarium. <laughs> so I guess it's in the same same category of signs, right? She's full of fish. Yep. Yep. Something like that. I'm a whole aquarium. I got I got a lot of aquariums. Happy to hear you and Numi became friends. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're friends is a big word. We've we've crossed the DMing each other part of it. I think I added her on Twitter. Oh, sorry, I think I added her on Discord, but we haven't actually talked yet. Before for now, we're like acquaintance you know we're, 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 we've slid in I added her on discord but I haven't kind of messaged her and continued that conversation and I think I'd have to meet her and maybe go for lunch or a drink but friends is friends is you know Camilla hello darling <laughs> Camilla we're talking about as you get older that you're kind of slower on making friends do you feel that way too on twitch where I, I, I always talk about it where I, I think a lot of people are acquaintances or co-workers and that's fine, right? There's this word in Russian about co-working. When you, when you work with someone and then you go for drinks and then you have a good time, but you're not necessarily friends. You don't call them in the middle of the night and say, can you bail me out of jail? I ate my third husband and the police is interrogating me because it's illegal to eat your husbands. Say that to all the husbands I've eaten. You know? I'm single because I've eaten all my ex-husbands. You know? <laughs> it's a lot easier to murder them and cannibalize their bodies than it is to get divorced. And then if you get divorced, you forever have to say you're divorced, right? Think about it. Think about it. If I get divorced with every single ex-husband, that's all. I'm I'm an ex, you know, ex-divorced so many times. But if I eat them, we're fine. Hey, husband, why tasty? I know it's only cannibalism if they're bugs, but I live inside a human woman. So if I cannibalize them as her, you know. I'm a widow. I mean, I'm not bragging about it or anything. You've been waiting for rice cooker for an hour and it wasn't even on. I'm so sorry. Yeah, if I take off my human skin suit, if I get out of my flesh Gundam and then eat my husband, then I guess it's not cannibalization. It's just murder. Is it even murder if it's dinner? Hear me out. Hear me out. When a lion kills a gazelle, are we calling it murder? No. It's just... <laughs> it's just dinner. <laughs> it's just dinner. So I <laughs> am just hungry. If husband, why dinner? If dinner, why husband, right? Girl dinner, girl dinner, girl dinner. Sorry, Camilla, this is just a regular Wednesday night discussion. This is just a regular Wednesday night discussion for us. You beat me to the girl dinner. I saw somebody else write it. I think it was Leche and I'm like, girl dinner. 
Meet, greet, deceit, defeat, eat. Oh, I like that. Girl dinner. Thank you, Adi, for the six months, my love. Am I going to eat leche? You don't eat milk, silly. You drink it. <laughs> flesh Gundam is not a word I expected to hear today. That's that's what she is. She's my Flesh Gundam. She's my Flesh Gundam. Am I going to eat Camilla, though? Maybe. Maybe. It depends. If she misbehaves or if she behaves real good. I don't know if it's a punishment or a reward for her. We're going to we're going to have to figure it out. Have I ever built a Gundam? No, but it is on the way. I have currently with me. I have hold on GF 13 05 ON SW Nobel Gundam. I finally have my Nobel Gundam. And then I also have this other queen of pop. Are you ready? Farcia. I have Farcia and I have Nobel. I have the absolute girly pops of Gundams. And I have the Hello Kitty um, which RX-78. So it's the Hello Kitty Gundam as well. I have all the pink, cute girls. I have all the Sailor Moons. I have everything. I have I have all of the cute ones. I have all the cute Gundam girls. Near Zia, far Zia, wherever you are, Zia, Mata will eat you eventually. I'm not that hungry nowadays. I didn't have dinner. Oh, I have those IKEA meatballs. You know the ones? They're so good. Farcia does look a lot like me. She looks good. Don't worry, everybody. I will only pretend that my Ikea meatballs are momos. Maybe no actual momos were harmed in the making of... of... Uh, hmm, of those meatballs. Strange. We'll get to all the other ones as well. I want to start slow. I, I do want to build a few. I also have a few of my uh, Warhammer builds I want to do. I'm going to get some Necrons, probably a Necron starter kit and go from there. Where does all the time go? Me playing Supermarket Simulator for 40 hours. <laughs> Me playing Terraria for the next 10 hours. I just don't have time. You know? When you allegedly ate your ex-husbands, did you take your time or eat them all in one sitting? Allegedly, it depends. Depends on my mood. It depends on like what kind of wine I had, you know? It depends. Sometimes you wanna sometimes you wanna take your time with it. It's a gift up. Mr. Bye, thank you for the gifted. Thank you, my dear. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You know what the worst it's part is, up. Leo? I played Helldivers for like eight hours and I wasn't even streaming it. I'm an embodiment of a red flag. You should wear pink colored glasses and then they're just flags. They're not even red anymore. Would you eat us live or not? Ooh, okay. There is something really tasty about, you know when it's, when you catch a fresh live fish and then you instantly make sashimi out of it, it just tastes fresh. It tastes so good. That is good. Then again, there's also something really, really nice about cutting a really nice piece of Momo, carving the butt cheek, and then smoking it, right? You cure it with some really good salt, and then you smoke it, and mmm. It really depends. Yeah, you smoke the Momo butt. Mmm. Mmm. Amazing, 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 amazing. Isn't our fur gross to eat? No, not at all. How's the Momo birthday cake doing? I still have some in the freezer. Hmm. 
If you want to bite the butt cheek, let me feel the bite. I want to feel the pain. What part of the MOBA would you start when eating one? I really like nibbling on the little the little ear. Usually an arm, right? Because you got two arms or a leg. A leg is also very nice. And a wing. A wing? You'd be surprised. The wings taste... Mm, the wings have a really nice consistency. They're nice and crunchy. Allegedly. Not that I not that I would be eating momos or anything. Allegedly. Allegedly. Maybe. A little meaty, a little crunchy, a little umami. The thing is, even though you're small, you are absolutely packed with muscle. So the big momo, like the one I'm holding, you're kind of like the uh, wagyu cattle. Where you, the big momo, wagyu cattle. The meat melts in your mouth. The small momo is actually muscle dense. So the small momo would taste closer to say like a uh, horse or uh, a deer. It's a lot more gamey, the small momo, because it's just packed, packed, packed with muscle. In that small little frame, tons of muscle. You ate a horse? Yeah. I've had I've had horse uh, jerky. I've had horse steak. I've had horse tartare. And not just in Japan. They have it in Canada a lot. Yeah. I've also eaten deer. Canada. Canada's a crazy... I have not eaten kangaroo yet. That That's on my list. I've eaten raw horse. Yeah, I've had horse tartare. And in Japan, they have like, I think it's horse yuko-e, I think it's called. Have I eaten deer skin? She won't be delicious. She won't be. She won't taste good. All she eats is like grape jelly. She won't taste good. Her diet is shit. Her diet is shit. <laughs> I don't think she even eats any fruit, so she won't even be sweet. She just has this fake jelly sugar all the time. You've eaten a capybara. What did it taste like? I have trouble knowing where the bit ends and the serious talk starts. What do you mean? This is all serious talk. What do you mean? <laughs> what bit? Yeah. There's no bit in Basing Say. I have tried fried alligator in Louisiana. But I don't think I've had crocodile because I know they're different. Okay, there's this thing with frying foods that at a certain point, everything tastes either like a white fish or chicken. I've had fried fugu. It tasted like chicken white chicken meat i have had fried alligator tastes like dark chicken meat it wasn't florida it was louisiana i don't think i've had oh no i've had a bison burger i have tried frog it also tastes like chicken it tastes like small chicken the little legs mm-hmm I've had swordfish. I've had the swordfish, like fillets, whatever they're called. The swordfish steak. Was it gator tail or rib? I don't know because it was just fried alligator. Crawfish was nice. I think I prefer shrimp shrimp. I think I prefer small shrimp the most. What are you on about? The bits are right here. Have I had long pig? Uh, allegedly, cannibalism is illegal, so no, I have definitely not partaken. Shrimp or ocean roaches, they're so good. I love them. I love them. I love them. When I was in Thailand, I ate so much shrimp. You thought long pig was dog? No, long pig is human. Allegedly. Also, you get a prion disease from cannibalism. If you avoid eating the brain, you have a 
it takes way longer to develop, but it takes about 10 to 15 years to develop in your body. But if you avoid the brain eating that, it it it, it might take like even longer to develop. Allegedly. Zedric, thank you for the six months. Yep, yeah, I've tried cow tongue. Mm -hmm. Okay, I actually forgot to eat today. And this talk of cannibalism is making me a little bit hungry. So... I'm going to grab some Ikea meatballs. They are not fried momos, I promise. I'm going to grab a few Ikea meatballs. And I will be right back. And then we're going to play some uh, Terraria. Oh my goodness. I've been live for one hour. What? I swear to God, time time is not real. How have I already been live for an hour? I feel like I just clicked go live and time sucked out. How? I just went live. What did we even talk about? How How did we get here? The yap is strong. All right. I will leave you all with my little cat face. Be right back. Hello? I'm back. I have some meatballs and I have two oranges. Oh. And then we're going to play Terraria. Okay? 
What did I miss? What did I miss? Pop out activity fee. Disappointed Demu, thank you for the five months. Smokey for the six months, thank you. And Zedric, thank you so much for the six months as well. No one say anything? Okay, no one say anything. They're Ikea meatballs. They're good. They're the vegetarian ones. I love the salmon ones more, but you know. Mm. I also got two oranges because right now they are delicious. Vegetarian meatballs, isn't that a crime? I guess they're vegetarian balls, aren't they? It is a crime. What is my take on the VTuber card game being made? So I have to be honest with you. I haven't seen anything about it or read anything about it, but sounds what sounds cool. Hell yeah. You turned 33 later this year. Any advice on not being old? We live longer than ever. We are living longer and longer than ever. Currently, you can live up to 100. You know, you're not old. You just you just do do the thing you're doing. Keep doing the thing you're doing. Also, consider to stop aging. If you feel old, just stop aging. Have you considered just stopping aging? Put your mind inside a computer. It's time. Forget space exploration. We're going into the internet. Upload yourself. Upload yourself. Also, I'm trying out the gamers, Gamer GG. I had the Brand Risk flavor today. But I think I drank it a little too quick. When I first drank it earlier today, I, I, I drank the whole... I didn't realize you all told me to not drink it very fast. I drank it so quick. And then I was feeling a little bit jittery, but I feel fine. And I haven't had a coffee today, so. We'll see. We'll see how I feel, but I feel fine. What is a J20, Abby? I've only had two flavors number. I had the Brand Risk one and I had the Gamer Fart 9000. I know the names are crazy. I like them both. They're good. And now I have a pineapple cocktail and misfit melon. Blood Rose, thank you for the prime, darling. I know, Telden. What am I even Wake living up. for? You know what's going to really balance me out? A nice glass of cognac. If there's one thing this house has a lot of is cognac. I love cognac. And every time I travel, I get a bottle of cognac for my family and me, and we have a lot of cognac in this house. That's what I should do. <laughs> Salty, thank you so much for the gifted. Why not brandy? I'll tell you this. A lot of brandy I don't like. That being said, really incredible brandy from a brand called Ararat. The problem is this brand is barely sold in Canada. If I travel and there's a possibility of buying a $50 bottle of Ararat or a um, $300 bottle of some, you know, Louis something cognac, always get Ararat. Always, 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 always. 
one one of the best brandies. It's so good. I've been trying to find the Ararat cherry. I have not been able to find it. When I go to the United States for a trip, I will try to find. It's really, really good. Do you consider making cognac by yourself? Legally speaking, if I made that kind of an alcohol, it would be called a brandy. It is only called cognac if it's from the cognac region in France. So, it's the same thing with champagne, right? It's only champagne if it's from the champagne region in France. Everything else is a sparkling wine or a Prosecco or a Cava or a whatever. DJ, thank you for the prime. And Mousy, thank you for subscribing, my love. Oh, yeah, I did not like Baiju. Actually, I love most alcohols and I do like alcohols that taste like flowers. For example, a lot of um, sake, a lot of sake tastes like flower juice to me. I did not like that Baiju at all. I drank Fugi uh, whiskey instead. I seriously recommend it. If anybody is really into whiskey or brandy or any of that stuff, scotch. If you're getting into cognacs and you find them expensive because they are, let's be honest. A lot of cognacs is a little bit of a prestige thing. Okay. Please, please, please look up a brand Ararat. It's from Turkey. It's amazing. It is such, so much cheaper and the quality is Really, really, really good. Just be careful. My only Ararat I didn't like. I once bought, I think, a 60 proof Ararat. I didn't really like it. Ooh, Hibiki is nice. It's really smooth to drink. I like it. Good whiskey. Oh, it's from Armenia? My bad. I thought Ararat was a mountain in Turkey. My bad. I'm so sorry. I thought Ararat was a mountain in Turkey. Oh, it's a volcano in Turkey. I'm so... Oh, it's near a quadri point between Turkey, Iran, Armenia, and the Nakhchivan exclave of Azerbaijan. My bad. It is Armenian. I apologize. I apologize. I apologize. I truly apologize. I like soju a lot. But soju is dangerous, especially if you get into those yogurt, soju, blueberry, soju. And be careful with soju. You will get a headache. You will get a headache. Because it does have a lot of sugar. <gasps> Crown Royal Peach, Crown Royal Vanilla, Crown Royal Maple, Crown Royal Apple. You don't even need to mix those. Just add a little bit. Add an ice cube. Oh. I agree. I don't like mixing my soju with anything, and I try not to drink more than a bottle and a half. I will get a headache. Okay. Let me finish this other orange and then wash my hands. Soju is a Korean alcohol. It's really good. But it is very sweet. And it, it's low alcohol percent. It's kind of like a wine. But because it's so sweet, you just drink a lot of it. Blood, thank you, darling. Don't worry. I have a lot of gray shame as well. And I will be starting to build and paint it this year. Lustful, try them yourselves. I just really like it. I think it tastes good. I think it's really good for the price. And it if you have people over... And you want to give them something good that's at a good price point, always add it up. But unfortunately, it's almost never sold in Canada. Mm. Do I think seltzers are worth it? I like them. I went through a really, really big white claw phase at first i hated white claw then i loved it my problem with white claw if i drink six white claws i don't feel drunk but i do have a headache the next day i think if you're in a pinch and you need white claw 
just get it, right? It is really good for your macros. It doesn't have a lot of calories, all that good stuff. But if you could also just find an alcohol store, buy a really small bottle of vodka and a soda water, boom, there's your seltzer, right? If you just get a Perrier water with lemon or lime or cherry or pineapple flavor or a bubbly pineapple and you get a little bottle of vodka, suddenly you're controlling how much you're making in the drink and you can calculate the calories. If you're really on that whole macro thing, you make it just as easy. I don't know why seltzers give me a headache the next day. That is crazy, Squeezely. It should be $30, $40 maximum. Um, When you go traveling, try to take a look at them at the airport. Oh my goodness, MAGA. 10 or so years ago, 15 maybe, Jagger bombs were everywhere. Think about it this way. Jersey Shore was on television. Gym tan laundry was everywhere. Jagger bombs! were everywhere. I never want to look at Jaeger ever again. I'd never want to. T-shirt time. I have to say, they taught a whole generation about self-care. Shinto, there's one thing I cannot believe that is the legitimate name of a drink. So there is a, I'm, I'm just going to talk about it. This is a real thing for Europeans. You might not be aware. There's a real drink in North America called the Irish car bomb. I think if I remember correctly, it's a shot of Bailey's, I think. And you, you throw it in a Guinness and you drink it quickly. It's very shocking because if you do not go to the UK and order that, um, Again, I, I know, you know, we don't really talk about politics or anything like that, but uh, I think there was a period called, was it like the struggles or something like that, where a little bit of political unrest and people were putting, the troubles, there we go. People were putting what you think in the cars and uh, it was just a very troubled time. So this is a legitimately popular drink in North America. A lot of Irish pubs anywhere, people will be doing shots of Irish car bomb. Please, please, please be very mindful if you travel abroad. Do not order it. It, you know, for a lot of people, it it is something that affected their families and things like that. I can't believe we, we named a drink like that in North America. What are we doing? What are we doing? It's, 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 it's crazy. It's crazy. It is really good, the drink. I do have to tell you, it is such a good drink. It tastes like chocolate milk, alcoholic chocolate milk. It's such a good, good, good drink. I super recommend it. I love picklebacks. Oh my goodness. Picklebacks is a shot of Jameson and then you shoot it with pickle juice. I love picklebacks. <laughs> I am a pickle woman through and through. I am a pickle woman through and through. I am a pickle woman through and through. I I love my pickle juice. Shot of Jameson followed up by a little bit of pickle juice. God so good all right let me wash my claws and then uh and then let's get into some terraria shall we i also brought a kombucha we're ready to game i want to go to the corruption area and see if we can get some more stuff done you're in the business of moonshine let's take him from the top she's got a body like an hourglass Yeah, you drink the pickle juice. That's what you do, Mega. You take a shot of Jameson and then you, you basically follow it up by like half a shot of pickle juice. That's what you do. Okay. 
hands washing because they're full of water. All right, everybody. I only washed my gaming set of hands. I didn't wash my other claws. My other claws remain unwashed. Uh, new to Terraria, classic, medium. Hehe. <laughs> Terraria. We are. Terraria experts. We are, we are on a cruise. Okay. Let's boot it up. Let's boot it up, my loves. Have a good uh, bedtime. Facade. I almost read your name as facade, and then I know everybody would have gotten upset. Oh, no Warhammer game? Not, uh, not today. I want to finish Mechanicus, and then we're going to be doing Bolt Gun. I think that's going to be my next one. Yeah, do not trust my English. I've never had a proper English education. I'm very self-thought in English. I love your pronunciations. Thanks. It's pronounced facade <laughs> Wait, is this the right game? Yeah, it is the right game. Okay, hold on. I never saw the loading screen, so I was like, wait a second. Terraria? Oh, should I do a solo game? Wait, where's my Terraria game? Hold on. Oh, I couldn't find it because it said dig, pee on, dig. Okay. Should I do a solo? Because I was playing with Quinn. I don't know, nerd. I don't know if I should keep advancing with Quinn, but at the same time, I feel like maybe starting a solo world could be... I know it's going to lose a little bit of progress from last time, but having my own solo world could be nice. You think I should continue the one with Quinn? I think, I think my solo world could be good, but then again, I did have the ghost. Thank you so much, uh, Kitsune, for the six months. Your inventory carries between worlds. Be careful of showing stuff. Wait. What can I show? Okay, Matara Khan, multiplayer. Oh, so if I do single player. Play. March 19th. Okay, so if I do single player, I can just play on. Oh, it's not showing the world selector. I could just play on the same world. Ah. Cool. Thank you, everybody. Well, then if I get to a point where I decide to make a new world, then I will. All right. Maybe let's get a little smaller. I feel I'm a little big. Oh, 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 oh. I feel I'm a little big. Me and my momos. Uh, where can I go? I guess I can hide here. 
Hmm. Okay. I'd make it a new world so when you play with Quinn again, he's not lost and left behind. That makes a lot of sense. You might be right. And you did say that I get to keep my inventory. Oh, oopsies. I do get to keep my inventory. So... If I get to keep my inventory... Then, uh... I can just go to the new world with all my stuff. And not really have to worry. Alright, let's do that. Let me bring my, my stuff in. Yeah. Okay. Let's do a new world then. And I'll bring some of my stuff. I'm Since I have two Abigail flowers, I can actually keep an Abigail flower for Quinn. Which is nice. I'll grab the lenses since I'm going to need them for the boss. I'll grab one of my rain hats. Um, I'll grab some of the potions because there's more potions in another place. Yeah, you guys are right. Thank you. Grab my worms. I'll keep everything here. I guess maybe the mushrooms. Sorry, Quinn. I left you another Abigail flower though. All right, let's do this. Save and exit. I'll do a single player world. Wait, I don't know if it's going to show anything because now, now you guys got me a little paranoid. Single player. Play. New world. How difficult is expert? How difficult is expert? And since I had corruption, should I do crimson? Very... Don't. All right, I'll do classic and then maybe crimson. Or corruption. Let's do it. I want to try. I want to see what it's like. Do I want to fight a worm or a brain? I like both. Both are delicious. All right, all right. I won't play expert until I've beaten the game. So same thing as before, going to make a little house in my... in my first... Wait, this tree is pink. Why is this tree pink? Huh? Why was that tree pink? I didn't say it's my first time. I said I'm a noob at the game. I have played very, very tiny, tiny, tiny amount. Bad seed reset. Wait, how do you know? There goes the Sakura tree. Uh-oh. Only one fake tree and I cut it? Are you kidding me? Are you for real? Are you for real? How do I just keep the pink tree otherwise? Or... Okay, you can plant it later. Okay. So I'm going to make a home here. I actually forget how big I'm supposed to make it, but I'm going to... I think this is like around where I... Wait. I can't believe it. Oh, see, now it's too... Made a mistake. I made a mistake. It's fine. Fine. I got a lot of these. We're good. Don't worry about it. Oh. Oh. oh, I haven't summoned Abigail, have I? There we go. Perfect. 
this is big enough. Oh, oopsies. <laughs> My building might be annoying to some. I know, I know. I'm sorry. Perfect. Beautiful. Amazing. Show stopping. Why are some of these floors lower than the others? What am I doing wrong? Use a hammer to adjust the landscape. Ah. I see. Look at my beautiful dirt. Beautiful, beautiful dirt. All right. So first order of business. Is that a... Oh, it's a dead worm. Oh, no, it's an alive worm. All right. I'm a pro now. Campfire. Right here. Uh, what else do we got? We got a campfire. We got a beautiful bamboo work desk. Ooh, it is pretty. No, we'll do... We'll do palm wood. Palm wood workbench. Beautiful. Don't mind if I do. We are going to do this chest because it is gorgeous. And we're almost out of palm wood. Not good. Not, not good. Oh, oopsies. It's fine. Beautiful, beautiful palm wood. I sure hope I find more palm wood sometime soon. <laughs> I sure hope I find more palm wood. I sure hope so. All right. A beautiful first day home. Beautiful. Sure, it's a little uneven. Some some might say it's a little uneven, but, you know, it's never bothered me before. I'm not here to judge. Absolutely, I'm not here to judge. The last thing I'm here to do. Beautiful. Beautiful chest. Now, let's take a look at this chest. First off, let's see what kind of items we got. Mm-hmm. Uh, close. In this chest, we are putting away our animals, our glow sticks, our bamboo, our dirt, our sand block, our amber, our copper. I guess for now, I can just put a few of these things away. Do, 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 do. I guess I'll keep the acorns. What is this? Vine rope. Yeah. I have my ugly little chests, but, you know, it's fine. Wait, what did I do that I can't... Huh? Did I? Is it because of this? Yeah, all right. See, I'm becoming an expert. I am starting to understand the game. I am starting to understand the game. Let's keep going a little bit and see what we can explore. Let's see what we can find before, before the end of the night. What's everyone's first order of business when you first log into this game? What's the first thing that you do and the first thing that you find? You need walls? I will make them in a moment, don't worry. All right, little cave. Good start. Break pots to get random stuff. Hell yeah. Oh, what is that? What? What? Huh? Did I just get 15 gold? All right, I can buy those portals now. Once these people move in, I can buy so many portals. What the heck? Big money, big payout, big corpa. Big money, big... I should have actually done the vines from up there as well. Okay, so how do I... Okay, climb the vine. If I put a porch. Okay. All right, all right, all right. This is an adventure and a half. Ooh. Would you look at that? My... Ay! Nobody saw that. Nobody saw that. Wait. All right. What is this? Oh, it's tin ore. 
A boulder is going to come and say hello. I have a little bit of armor. I think I should be a little bit fine against a boulder. Ooh, that looks rare. I have to say, this item that I found that lets me get vine ropes just by cutting them has been such a life changer. Such a game changer. Oh, I think this is my first time finding iron. She's going to die to a landslide, isn't she? I don't know. I'm still a sweet summer child. I'm a sweet summer child. I don't know. Yes, I'm making a new world because I decided that, um, we decided collectively that when, um, if I play with Quinn again, he's going to be confused, right? So it's better if I just, uh, if I just kind of do my own world. And I picked Crimson because the previous one had corruption. Nice. Feeling pretty good. Feeling pretty good, y'all. Sweet summer flesh Gundam pilot. That's me. Hui! I did it. Little cow web. Cobwebs. I used to call them cow webs. Oh, oopsies. Alright. It it's kind of straight. It's kind of straight. You know, it's kind of straight. Kind of works. Crimson has spiders. I think the scariest, scariest. So there's this game called um, Satisfactory. Oh, oopsies. And it has a um, arachnophobia mode, where the spiders are cats. Genuinely. The scariest thing I've ever seen in my life is the arachnophobia mode in Satisfactory. It is so much scarier when you're hearing the little meows and then they come at you from somewhere. They come at you from somewhere. It is terrifying. Absolutely terrifying. I, I do not recommend it. Is that a bug? Oh, it's a mouse. I caught Iron Mouse! Oh, little slime. Hello, Mr. Slime. Ow. Oh, oh, wait. This one's actually doing damage. Oh, oopsies. Oh. All right, you know what? Maybe it's good I didn't go on expert. Maybe it's good I didn't go on expert because I am just, I'm just exploring. I'm still not even. Oh. I wonder what's over there. Okay, another one. I gotta be careful. I would highly recommend finding a frost biome. ASAP. Oh my god, I got scared that the ghost was... Hold on. Oh, that red thing over there. That red thing over there. Looks a little suspicious. Oh, the noises it's making. Sound a little suspicious. What are those noises? What are those noises? What do they mean? Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, I see him. I see him. I see him. It's the bug. There he is. Oh, still got hurt, but. So is this a um? Has anybody here played Core Keeper? Is this like a flesh chest? Is this a flesh chest? Is that what it is? Hit it with a hammer? I don't have a hammer. It's a demonic altar. Ooh. You have to hit it with a hammer to open it? Well, then I guess I'll make a, make a hammer in a moment. Let him kill. Perfect. Abigail, you are the best. 
she really is my girl. All right. Let me open it with a hammer. I believe you all if you are trolling me. I guess I will find out. I guess I will find out. Oh, wait, what was that? Hold on, I missed it. I don't know what hit me for so much damage. Oh, it hurts you a couple times. Wait. This gotta be a troll. This gotta be a troll, you guys. How dare you? She's still going? I'm learning. You need a special hammer. Y'all should have told me that at the beginning. Oh, Mr. Jellyfish! Can I catch him or is this an enemy? Oh, it's an enemy. You have to hit it with a hammer? Is this not a hammer? It's alright, I'll come back with a better hammer. Does it mark on my map? Mm, it doesn't, but I will remember it's there. I was stream full of people to help me remember that it's there. There are some sneaky people in here who want to troll you. As they should. That is my rite of passage for playing this game for the first time. That is my rite of passage. It is only fair... That the people troll me, right? It is what I deserve. Yeah. It is what I deserve. Alright, let's keep going. Wait, did these reappear? I thought I already broke them before. Hmm... Thank you so much, Flagship. I appreciate it, darling. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So long and so short a time. Come on, where's the patch to fix time? We've been waiting for years. You know the craziest thing about it? At one point when I was, when I was streaming today, I looked at the time and said, wait a second, I've been live for an hour. It felt like we barely talked about anything. It felt like we barely talked about anything and we barely did anything. But it had already been an hour of me streaming. How? How was it already an hour? All we did was yap just a tiny little bit. It wasn't even a lot of yapping. It was just a little bit of yapping. And suddenly here we are. You know? How did the time go? Oh, oopsies. Buddy. Oh, wait. I didn't realize I was staring the other way. Sorry, I know I'm being such a noob. Alright, alright, wait. Oh. It's because sometimes I'm stuck on this. It's weird. The vines have a, a little bit of a strange strangeness to them. Oh. Alright. Okay, you're being a little sneaky there. The stars! How they shine for me. I'm trying to get a little bit of mana. Maybe I could be one of those... Oh, oopsies. I left my door open. Awkward. All right, let's make a really beautiful lamp. Let's make a gorgeous, beautiful lamp, shall we? Hmm. Thank you, Kara. Thank you for the six months, my dear. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. It's fun watching somebody for the first time. I'm glad. But I do agree. I think it's very, very fun watching people play things for the first time. It's fun to, to kind of see them discover things that you discovered and you go, Oh man, I remember when I discovered that. Remember when I saw that. I remember when, when I got into this. 
I want to try making some of the bamboo lamps and stuff. Bamboo candle. I wonder if the candelabra probably has to be placed on a table, huh? Oh, cute. Absolutely beautiful, gorgeous, stunning, one of a kind. Gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous, gorgeous. All right, I need a furnace. Um, I think I'm missing stone block for the furnace. Uh, if I remember correctly, it's like 20. Can I ask if you fought a boss? The first time I played, I fought a boss. I was playing with a friend. Um, but I haven't fought a boss yet. I'm not even, you know, not. I'm not even sure how to summon it. So today, hopefully, you'll all help me after I build out my little house with summoning. Let me get a little bit more stone. Because I'm definitely missing a little bit of stone. Definitely missing a little bit of stone. So let me get some of that. Get, let me get a little bit of stone. Ooh, now I'm scared of, of chopping the other trees. For anybody that doesn't know, I chopped a pink tree when I logged in and everybody made fun of me. Because apparently they're super rare. One of a- Oh, there's another pink tree! I'm not chopping this one. Ooh, and we found the sand biome. Nice. Already sand biome, good. It was also the same biome that was on my right last time. Ooh, big deep hole. They spawn randomly? Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Oh, am I? Yeah, I just did that. Whoopsies. I thought, I was like, wait, these acorns look a little weird. Oh, whoopsies. I thought, I thought those were some strange, oh, strange looking acorns. Awkward. Awkward, strange looking acorns. It's okay, I got this. Nice. I know, that ghost is so useful. I actually got two of them. I left the other one back in my other world. I love that other one back there. All right, nice. So we got a little sand biome. Oh, oopsies. I was looking too far ahead. What is this? Mm, I'm gonna need more lights as well. All right. You make a light now, or I could just go home and get my rocks and get my anvil and then keep going. I can actually already build my teleporter. Ooh, what if there's another sand biome that's further? Wouldn't it be nicer if I build a teleporter for a further sand biome? Think about it. I can buy, if you're wondering, I do have a lot of money. I got very lucky with my money. I found some portal that gave me like 15 gold just immediately for nothing. I don't know how rare they are, but here we are. It was such a good... How does that portal work? Is it just a random spawn in a... Hell yeah. I got money, money, money. Money, 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 money. Less than 10% chance? Nice. Oh, that's what it is. It was the pots. I see, I see, I see. Don't chop that tree, Mata. Don't do it. Don't chop it. All right, let's go back home. Build our walls. Let our people move in. Ooh, draconic. That sounds rare. I like that. Ah, it was fly away. It's time to get a store, and it's time to sell all my little critters. Somebody told me once that you can actually... Oh, what's this? Shackle. Ooh. 
that you can actually get a lot of critters and put them in cages and uh, have a little zoo. So that's exciting. All right, well, now that I got more palm tree, I could actually continue building up here. My God, I got so many fallen stars. Ooh, 180 mana. You can catch NPCs in the in the little boxes. Wait, ah, oh, there we go. Oh wait, I accidentally used up my palm tree. Whoopsies, sorry palm tree, didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's go get a little bit of stone. Go get a little bit of stone, because I'm missing stone from my furnace. Wow! What's this? Oh, another intrepid shackle. Hmm. Who's out here dropping these, huh? Is it the zombies? Who's out here dropping these? Where are the shackles? Oh. oh, how forward of you. It's a little forward. Jeez. Already? Jeez. Oh, oopsies. Sorry, vine ropes. I keep accidentally killing you. And then making more. And then killing you again. There we go. There's a lot of rock here. I'm going to mine it up. And I'm going to dig these vines for myself. Wow. Perfect. Beautiful. Beautiful. All this rock is my rock. I have decided. Actually, I should have just put the vines here. Would have been smarter. She stayed mostly above ground, but today, I will dig down. I will dig down today, I promise you. I will dig down. I will explore the depths. I'm telling you. Let me... Let me get my little hostel set up so that I can have my little traveling merchants live in it. I'll get a little bit more stone while I'm here. In Terraria, you can dig straight down. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to start in my little forest and just dig straight down. going to have a mine shaft. Dig as deep as you want. What could go wrong? I don't like the way you're saying that phrase. What does LFG mean? Looking for God? Oh, let's fucking go. I knew that. I know, I know. The traveling merchant doesn't move in. I, I truly did mean merchant. Hmm. Hello? Oh! Oh, it's a little house! For me. I could just live there. It's got a golden chest. Oh my god. There's jewels and gems. Trinkets and baubles. Glittering baubles. If you repair that, an embassy will move in. Hell yeah. Look inside. Oh, I will. I will. I just wanted to mine that tungsten while I'm here. Paid for in baubles. Trinkets and trinkets. Baubles and trinkets. 
paid for in baubles. What if I want to live there, huh? What if I want to live in that home? Screw that NPC. What if I want it to be my home? Hmm? What about what I want? It's always what they want. I want to be a cave person. I love making my home in the mines. It does seem really nice. All right, let me get some of this tungsten and then we... Thank you, Tit. I am hydrating. What about you? What's everyone drinking? I currently have kombucha, water. I did drink another one of those GGs this morning instead of my coffee. Oh, I love Dr. Pepper. What is boot bond? Never heard of that. Mountain Dew, Baja Blast Free. The way that you said that, it almost, I know it's not an advertiser, but it sounds like it, because you're like, I am having the refreshest cooling flavor of. I know, I know it's not meant like that, but it's funny. It kind of sounds like it. I don't know why. Every time I read the Mountain Dew flavors, it's a perfect advertisement. Just the way. Wait a second. Ooh. Silver coin, iron skin potion, another angry radar. Ooh, but this angry radar didn't give me more damage. This one does. Iron bar, Grenadi. Cool. Oh my god, I'm full. I'm almost full inventory. Damn it. Gotta go home. Alright. Let's go see what this little house. Sell the spare one. Yeah, I'm gonna sell them. Don't worry. I accidentally always have a full inventory. Accidentally always have a full inventory. You can keep spare trinkets in the vanity slot. Thank you. Another one? What's my... Oh, in the... Va no, I can't put it in for some reason. It doesn't fit anywhere. Oh, but then raincoat? Oh, I see, I see. No, it doesn't fit anywhere. Ooh. Ooh, it doesn't fit anywhere. I know last time people told me to collect the cobwebs. Spiders! All right. All right. Oh, angel statue, cloud in a bottle, bomb. Is this forever, the cloud in a bottle, the double jump? Interesting. It's forever? Wow. Oh, wait, I can put my, my equipment in another... Hold on. Oh, yeah, this does work. Thank you, everybody. I didn't realize I could do that. So I can basically now put my, my stuff in my other... Inventory. Thank you. That is really cool. Is, do I have any more items here that... I could uh, get rid of. Sorry, rabbit and scorpion. I I think you're getting, I think you're getting deleted. So I just drink the cloud bottle now, right? You guys aren't trolling me. Oh, I have to equip it. Nice. Cool. Oh oh no! Don't kill him. Let him go to the sun. Man, Abigail. Unlucky. It's okay, I already have a cloud statue. So, somebody told me to take the loom. But then others of you were telling me to repair this house. 
So if I take the loom, I won't repair the house, right? Do both? Okay. When y'all say repair the house, what do you... Oh, wait. Did I lose the loom because I had full inventory? It's just sitting there. I don't see it. Oh, it's on the 8. Thank you. You just gotta repair the wall. Make sure there's a chair and a table and a light source. Okay. Oh, did I accidentally drink my potions? I didn't do it on purpose. Okay. You press B. I didn't know B drinks the potion. No. Fuck. All right. Well, we're going to make a prettier porch than this. B drinks every buffing potion you have. I kept pressing B because build. Uh, Crub, how the heck are you doing tonight, Crub? How did you enjoy that raid yesterday, my dear? How did you enjoy that nice raid yesterday? Did you did you like it? I'm gonna give him a little cactus workbench. Wait. I'm gonna give him a little cactus workbench. Little cactus chairs. Then a little cactus lamp. Ooh. Little cactus lantern. Wow. Another little cactus lantern. Oh, god damn it. Where is it? We're styling now. Beautiful. Hello, Keith. How are you? And maybe a third one. It's because they're so cute. I know cactus doesn't grow very fast. Do, 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 do. But it's cute. Uh. Oh, so cute. I think this is it, right? It's repaired. Oh, the walls, huh? I'm not sure what material his walls were naturally, but I don't love it. So I am going to change his whole wall atmosphere. We're going to give him regular wooden walls. I know, I know, this might not be what he wanted, but I don't care. Thank you, Sunny, for the five months, my dear. I know he had a whole thing going on here, but, you know, his house sucked. If you dig out the candeliers, they will light up again. I'm actually going to dig these out for me. I'm going to keep them. I'm going to dig out those candeliers. For, I just need to. Where's the trash, by the way? I know previously there was a trash can and now I'm not seeing it because I want to trash like my goldfish and my rabbit, right? Hammer is there. So there's no way to just delete the hammer. Do I have to suffer through it? Oh, if I put another... Okay, okay, I get it. So that's how the trash works. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, well, definitely we're going to get rid of this chandelier. My God. We're fancy with it. I don't know what a blink root is, but I guess I'll keep it. No, I won't keep it. Screw the blink root. Bunny in the trash. There's a million other bunnies. This bunny wasn't good enough for us. All right, we're doing this. I can't wait to see who's going to move in here. Little guy. 
Crap, have you played this, by the way, before? Am I, like, the only adult who hasn't partaken in, in Terraria? Am I the one that's really missing out? You've never played it either. I actually haven't. Stream idea. Robert plays Terraria. Hmm? Hmm? Ooh. Robert plays Terraria. Cool. All right, let's keep going. So tomorrow, a little man will move in. And uh, I don't know if it's a little man or a little woman. Thank you, Starlet, for the for the raid. I appreciate it, right? Everybody, double check with me. Seems like I filled everything up, right? I love how the title is new to Terraria. Well, it is the truth. Just because people start asking, people will come into the stream and start saying things that I'm like, hey, 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 wait, 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 buddy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa there, buddy. I don't understand any of this. What does all of this mean? Oh. Oh, these are two little different houses? Doesn't look like two little different houses. But I guess if it is two different little houses... You make a little, another little chair and another little table. Really does not look like two different little houses, though. All right. So what biome would this be considered? Is this just underground cave biome? Surface. But it doesn't count as forest, does it? Surface forest. Oh, so it does count as forest. Mmm. I see, I see, I see. Six enemies nearby. Oh my. Okay. I can't wait to see what little man moves in. This is exciting. Little guy. Little guy moving in. Still can't believe I drank all those potions by accident. It's because I pressed B to build. In a lot of video games, to build is B. So I just press B to build. Because I'm silly like that. I guess I could use the planked wall here. Right? Probably need a potions chest. Hmm. What about the statues? Do they do anything or do they just look pretty? Change the keybind. It's kind of funny if I keep accidentally. Some statues can do things. Hmm. I see, I see, I see. That looks so pretty. You guys have to admit. That looks real nice. Very Castlevania. I'm so happy I stole his walls. Look how much nicer his walls are in here. I like that I took his walls. But now, unfortunately, it's going to be a little less pretty for a bit, just for the start. It's not, well, it's not my first time playing because I played yesterday. But, uh, yeah, not only do I live inside your walls, but I steal inside your walls, too. Remember that. Yeah, I'm going to keep pressing B by accident. That is definitely going to keep happening. Whoopsie poopsie. Whoopsie poopsie.
Iron anvil. I feel like before I had a lead anvil. Hmm. I don't know if iron is more better. More good. More strong, more better, more good. Let's take a look. Five defense? Whoa. I have two defense. Yes. Wow. All right, let's keep going. All right. Oh, that was wild. Five defense! Wow! All right, we can make a better helmet as well. Wow. Look at me go, y'all. We're defending. Yes, Martha. Metal is superior to wood. I didn't realize. I didn't realize. I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know. All right. Let's close this door for a little bit. Let's also make a... Uh, -a, -bit -a, -bit -a, -bit -a, -bit a I keep thinking this is a real table. Let's make a door. Let's make a quirky door, okay? Let's make a quirky door just for now. Just for now, let's make a little quirky door. And then we're going to have a guy live in there for a little bit. Just while we're looking for where else to put to put our little guys. Beautiful bug. Thank you. Thank you, my love. No, you're a beautiful bug. No, I'm a beautiful bug. Thank you. I appreciate it. Do I not have enough for the bamboo chair? Where's my bamboo chair? Oh, there it is. I didn't see it. My favorite part about being new is just building everything that doesn't fit together. Does this fit together? Nah. Does it matter to me? This room is missing a wall. Where? Where do you guys see this room missing a wall? Huh? Am I crazy? Oh, it's the background walls. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. So yes, I was crazy. All right. You're living here now. Enjoy your new home. So now what we're going to do here, right here is going to be our going downstairs place. So right here, we're going to go down. We're going to make a triple. We can actually make it bigger than triple. I'm just going to... Oh, the copy pasta. It's starting. Thank you, Zero. Zero's on it so fast. Love that for us. All right. So. Over here up top is going to be where the other people are going to live. And you guys told me that I probably shouldn't do more than three people, right? At the start. Because then some of the people hate each other. Hmm. Since some of the people hate each other. You can move them out. Oh, yeah. I just want to get those. Uh, I guess we can do two rooms here, right? Perfect. That's not how it works. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We're going to make it work, okay? All right. Which doors? I'm really liking the bamboo doors. But I'm also aware of how hard bamboo is to... Is to... I basically have to wait for it to grow. And that's going to take a long ass time. So. Hello, Edwin. I'm going to sell you all my spare animals. I got a lot. Perfect. So. I did have a lot of palm tree growing. 
But currently, on, I guess we'll just do regular wood for now. All right, all the pretty chandeliers are coming here, though. In my house is where the pretty chandeliers are. Ah. I guess we can go get some palm tree. It's so much cuter than the regular boring tree. It's so pretty. I know I'm wasting time, but beauty is important. What is life without beauty? I'm oh, sorry, I was looking away. Life without beauty is pain. This is also a different tree. Yeah, let's go cut some of the palm trees because they're so much prettier. It's going to give me a better quality of life. The seed palm tree is the same as normal tree. Thank you. You mean like all the seeds you're seeing planted over here, which is why I have so many trees? You mean those? Those ones? Is that what you mean, my love? Thank you. I have been doing that. Replant some trees. Yes, I I do that. <laughs> I do that. I yeah. That is that is that is what I do with my trees after I'm done chopping them. Thank you, my loves. Yeah. Yeah, I like chopping them all and then on the way back, planting them all. Like chopping them all and then on the way back, planting them all. If you dig up sands, you can plant palm trees in front of your house. No need because I already know about the teleporters and I have enough money to buy two teleporters. Believe it or not. Don't replant the trees. Ooh. Wait a second, the, the NPCs coming in is random. Because last time I got Caitlyn as like a 6th or a 5th NPC. The nurse. And now I got the nurse right away. Interesting. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Oh, oopsies. Mata! You're not planting as good as you should be. Ooh, wait. We're, this guy came from the cave. That means there's an underground cave, correct? Because this guy came from the cave yesterday. Or does he just live in the desert underground? Because he came from the living tree yesterday. There's an atline cave below. Okay, that's what it means. That's awesome. Now I know where to go. Unfortunately, I already have my gold mandible. My gold mandible sword. I already have one. Don't need another. We're good on that front. Yeah, I got two of them. One of them was godly and another one was another thing. But it wasn't godly, but it was good. And here... Oh, is that the rare one? Oh, I see why it's so rare. It jumps away fa far. Nice. This is some loading screen advice. Be careful of taking fall damage. You will die if you are killed. Do not die if you are killed. Oh, I can't hit him with the net. That would have been great. Does that mean the merchant came downstairs? Because I don't see the merchant here. And I'm guessing the nurse also moved into the underground. Because she's not here. She's not here, so she must be underground. Oh, the music is so good. Yeah, you only have one valid room. Perfect. So I'll make more rooms. I'm going to make a few more rooms here so that I can actually have somebody to sell items to in here. Because uh, I don't have anybody to sell items to. Oh, 
Oh, wait a second. Hold on. All right, I'm actually going to build these stairs nice and pretty, okay, everybody? Don't judge me. Damn it. All right, this might take a while. Uh. Uh. Don't worry about it. It just works. Oh, you're right. I need some headroom. Will the NPCs jump? Like this. Is this good enough for the NPCs or do I actually need to do something for them to walk into the door? Nope, they won't jump. So how the heck am I going to get them into their stupid house? They need stairs. Oh, they teleport into their room. So I don't really have to worry about like this, right? I can just like put a room here, put a room here, and I'm good. Okay. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Where's my chair? Perfect. It's fun to build. It is. It is very fun to build. I am enjoying it very, very much. I am enjoying it very, very much. All right, let's keep going. So over here, we're going to do three more rooms. And then if anybody moves in that doesn't like it here, we're going to send them to the desert. We're going to build the same thing in the desert and we're going to make a teleporter. You want to make fences for windows? They don't need windows. They don't even pay rent. Remember that. I don't need it to look pretty for them. These guys... I'm trying to be polite. Don't even pay rent. So, I I don't care about their living enjoyment. Right? Like, they don't even pay rent to me. So, why should I care? Yeah, they're freeloading off of me. Absolutely. Oh my god, that's so pretty! Uh, wow! Wow, look at that! Ugh! I'm really liking this palm wood. It really doesn't take much to make me happy, huh? <laughs> Writes down, don't have Matara as a landlord. I mean, let's try the palm wood wall. I just want to see. Ooh. Ooh. Terraria is fun. Have you played a lot of Terraria? I am, uh, as you can see, a little bit on that... On that noob. On that noob adventure. Wow. Stunning. In. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Look how beautiful this is. All right, everybody. Die trader. Die trader. The die trader likes the 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 the, the sand. Correct? Yep, it's him. 
Oh my god, look at his little scimitar. Ooh. So I'll wait to sell him my things when he's happier. All right, buddy. Hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. Am I cooking? Is this the peak of luxury? Okay, hear me out. In the forest, they are living in a palm tree habitat. Okay. In the desert, they are living in regular forest habitat. Huh? It just sucks that regular forest stuff is so boring that I don't even want to do it. You're evil? Why? It's fun, no? You could build houses out of gold bricks. We're not there yet. But we will get there. I could go to the jungle if I can find it. I think I'm going to first move him into the sand biome so I can at least teleport between sand and here. And I think I'm going to put his his um, house kind of at the edge of the sand biome. Like almost at the end of it. And then I'm going to go down and explore where the, um, where the mandible guy came from. I forget his name, but the one that I got the sword from. Alright, who do we got? We got the nurse. We got Edwin. Let's put Edwin in here. I don't know if he likes it here. And we're going to put Caitlyn in here. And then we're going to put Hano the die trader somewhere else. All right. This is looking good. This is looking nice. I like it. I guess let's go back and... Um, I picked Crimson because the la when I played yesterday, I got Corruption. So I picked Crimson today. Hano likes the desert. I'll move him. And then I'm going to buy the teleporters. So now I can teleport to a small chunk of place. Look at us. We're doing it. Crimson sucks. It's all right. We're going to have fun with it. We're going to have fun with it. Oh my god. Look how big that tree is. Sorry, I was looking at the tree. I forgot to look at the enemy. That's a big Momo. Abigail is a good Momo. Isn't she? Oh, I don't have any acorns. Oh, oopsies. Ow! Guys, please. There's a sky teleporter. Is that for a sky biome or just like another, another thing? Man, these guys are... It's fine. I have enough health. I'm just doing my thing. Letting Abigail do her thing. Can't live my life fearing these guys. I have enough health regen. I have enough health. We're fine. Wait. I'm doing two in one. I'm chopping the trees, but if the zombie dies, we're good. Perfect. Keep running. Yeah, we're going to go down here after with my vine. I know what some of you will say, Mata, just wait till morning. No! I will not. I will not. Okay. So I want to build my house on the edge of the desert. That way I save a little bit of trouble time with the teleporter, right? Like right here, I guess I build my house. Hmm. I can use the forest one in the sky. Ooh. Okay. Somebody did tell me not yesterday not to build my things too much on the edge. So it... I guess right here. Hmm. Two, three, four. Hit the zombie! Hurrah! Five, six, seven... Eight, nine, ten, twelve, no, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, 
15. I guess I'll do 20, because then I can put one guy downstairs and one guy up top. Perfect. All right. It's time. Is that really... This house seems so small, though. Is this really 20? Am I just bad at math? This is tiny. Nobody's gonna live here. You can turn sand into sandstone. Oh, I wonder how pretty that's gonna be. Do I have to cook it? Probably have to cook it. Hmm. I think bench. Well, we're gonna find out. We're about to find out, my love. Sandstone could be nice. Yeah, I thought here I could have several people live, but this, I guess this could just be like a, I can divide it in half. No, I'll get to make it longer because I like having an area for myself. And in my area for myself, I want to put like the furnace. Then again, maybe it makes sense to just teleport to the furnace back to your main house every time. Oh, ouch. They can break down doors. Yeah, somebody told me yesterday to put a little torch in front of my door, right? One torch a day keeps them away. All right. Hmm. I think I'm going to make it a little wider. Oops. Make this a little bit wider. Perfect. It's cuz I can put I can put the other room here. people to live in squalor either right like i want them to have a cute little apartment and then this will be my my teleport room my everything room nice perfect i kind of want to do this sandstone thing y'all are telling me about i kind of want to do the sandstone thing y'all are telling me about hmm All right, let's make some doors. Beautiful. Beautiful doors. Trinkets and baubles. Paid for in baubles. Boop. Now let's put a little, let's put a little light right there. A little light right here. Little light, light right there. Little light right here. Beautifully done. Oh, oopsies. Wrong. Okay. Um, where is this little sandstone you're telling me about? If it's not here, then I will cook it. <gasps> Ooh, that's so pretty. Palm wood candelabra. I like the hanging ones a lot. I loved the hanging ones quite a bit. Wow. Would you look at that? Look at it. Beautiful. I know. I know it's not very symmetrical. But I do not care. I think it's beautiful. I think it's very beautiful. Thank you, JSY. Not very, not at all. Listen. Symmetry is for nerds. I am not here for the symmetry. Thank you for the prime gold. I am here for the gameplay. Not the symmetry. Oh my god. These zombies are... Are quite quick, 
crazy today. These zombies are a little crazy today. Tonight. All right, let's, uh, what do we got? We got a table. Let's make four tables. All right, we need, uh, we need more wood before we continue anything. So let's, let's get rid of these guys. Plant a bit of acorns. Oh, not the right thing to plant. They're doing their best with that door. Good luck, you guys. Good luck. As a nerd, you enjoy symmetry. You will find no symmetry in this live stream, my love. I'm sorry. Have I been to space? Baby. I have a feeling you didn't read the title, did you? Be honest with me. Be honest with me. Did you read the title? I'm symmetrical. Actually, uh, I have my little tattoo under my eye. I'm asymmetrical. Oh, you meant in my lore. Yes, I come from outer space. I come from space, my dear. I thought you meant in the game, and I was thinking, buddy, I just started playing. You really think I'm out here going to space already? Nah. Not yet. Not in this game. We are a little bit away from space exploration. A little tiny bit away. But not too far. We're almost there. Ooh. All right. So now, it's time. It's time, my loves. I guess I can place the zombie banner somewhere. Um, para 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 We have two tape, three tables. Let's put the fourth table, and then we have to do three little chairs. Pop pop pop. And then we do two more little lights. Lights. There they are. And then I think I have a lot of walls for now, but we'll add more walls later. Beautiful. Am I a fan of men in black? Sure. Here come the men in black. Galaxy defenders. The good guys dressed in black, remember that. Just in case we come face to face and make contact. The title held by me, MIB. What you think you saw, didn't see. I think if I just made this a little smaller here, it would lead to me being able to make three rooms upstairs, right? She had more space. <laughs> I wish I, I wish I had like an, an extra toolbar where I can just put all my house things on it so that I wouldn't have to keep finding all my house things. Is there a way to do that? Now I'm not sure if this is a big enough house. Yeah, it is suitable. Nice. I think I'm going to just put the lamp a little bit differently. And now I'll be able to make more... Hmm. Because now I can do one, and then one, and then there's sort of a little bit. Yeah. Now it's going to be one, and it's going to be like here-ish? It's kind of symmetrical. Sort of. Okay. Perfect. Um... I guess I could also... Is there any reason to not dig in other biomes? Like, I guess I could just also dig down there after. Okay. Where were we? We continue. The building resumes. 
and so do the beatings until morale improves. I think I have to put this a little bit to the right. I think I made a little mistaki. Yeah, I think this is a little more to the right. Whoopsies! But I can't tell because I don't think I have enough. Like here? Is it? Hold on. And then if the door is here, I'm not sure. Yeah, I think I have to move it one to the right. All right. I could be wrong. And then I just adjust the lights. It is recommended to dig at the forest. Okay, okay, okay. But I like the idea of, being a ha of having a little digging spot everywhere. All right, so first things first, die merchant, you're moving. Where does Edwin like to move? Where does Edwin like to live, you guys? Any any ideas on what Edwin likes? I know I can talk to him. Forest. Okay, perfect. Other than the nurse, everybody else who's moved in is pretty much the same as the previous world. Right? Is this big enough? I think it's big enough. You never know. Yeah, so I've got to change the light over by one. Oh! Are you okay? Are you okay, buddy, with the balloon? Oh, I don't think he was okay. Are these apartments? Hello, Bricky. Yes, they are apartments. How was your your way to to the to the convention, to the place? To the good place. How are you today, Bricky? I am becoming a landlord. It is finally my time. I have decided it is my time to be a landlord. Finally. Unfortunately, these people don't want to pay me any money. That that's the sad part about it. But everything else is good. How are you, darling? Long I have landed. Shall partake in food and drink soon before going to bed. Oh, right. This is very late for you. I keep forgetting. Welcome to the East Coast. Um, If you go to bed in the East Coast at 9 p.m., you're basically going to bed back home at 6 p.m. Isn't that exciting? Basically speed running being an old man. Is Bricky going to PAX East? I think so. I think his... Uh, isn't his Twitter... For a second, when you asked that, I thought to myself, wait a second, am I revealing big industry secrets? But no, he wrote it on his Twitter. My love, you are what the people call a fake fan, aren't you? You don't even follow the Richard on Twitter? You don't have his notifications on, so you see every post? Unbelievable. Can everybody please put that little shaking my head emoji? You can make sandstone bricks in the furnace. Perfect. I'll make a furnace shortly. The sandstone bricks are going somewhere else. I don't even have Twitter. <laughs> I don't even like Bricky. <laughs> Why would I follow him on Twitter? Hate the guy. Oh, I forgot to put a door. You're very impressed by the size of my apartments. Thank you. Some people say, you know, they're on the smaller size, but I think my apartments, it's, it's about the motion of the ocean, you know? It's about how you rock the boat. It's about how you use the apartment space. You know? I just, it's, it's about how you use them. It's about how you furnish them. It's about how you deck. It's what's on the inside of the apartment that matters at the end of the day. My tenants should love the apart these apartments for who they are on the inside. All right, let's buy portals. Let's buy portals so I can now... I did all this, by the way. I need everybody to understand why I did this for min-maxing. Because in the future, I will fast teleport to my other base. Have I wasted time building these apartments? Yes, but these apartments are an investment for a future generation of folks who will one day 
be indentured to me. Why min max when you can max min? Exactly. Who is max? And why are we minimizing him? But yeah, please enjoy, enjoy PAX, uh, PAX East. It was at one point my first non-anime convention. Many, many years ago. I think I had just become a Twitch partner. It was, it was very, very, very many moons ago. I still remember seeing Twitch streamers in the wild and thinking, oh my god. Oh, what's that? Oh, hello. Angry dad. Oh, sorry. I did. I was looking at him. I wasn't even realizing he's damaging me. I was just so mesmerized by the little guy. All right. Let's get back to making walls and then we're going to buy things and then we're getting back into the mines, into the caves where the children are. I'm going to find the children in the caves. My God, what's with all these balloon slimes, huh? They're everywhere. Beautiful. Would you look at that, everybody? Beauty. All right, let's make a little furnace. Boop. Now I'm gonna have to straighten these. Oh, that's not gonna open the door for me. I'm gonna have to straighten those walls after, huh? gonna there we go by walls i meant floors they're very similar in fact some say they're they're the same thing sometimes a, a wall is just a um horizontal uh vertical floor shit i ruined my joke damn it <sighs> a blue kite Ooh. mudstone brick or sandstone brick okay let's see what they each look like I ruined my own joke. Guess it wasn't that good of a joke. It was that easy to ruin it. Damn it. Who called you? Oh, because I'm making bricks. I was like, nobody's called you. Wake up, the accident. Oh. This sucks. They're both ugly. They're ugly. This does not spark joy. They're ugly. It's been 10 years. Oh, so 10 years ago, you're telling me they were pretty? What, 10 years ago, they looked beautiful? You know what? Maybe they make good walls. Need more than one to see the pattern. All right, you're right. Okay, do not put words in my mouth. This isn't about Bricky. This is just about the inanimate object known as the brick. That has preceded Bricky in existence. Oh yeah, what are you going to eat tonight since you're in the East Coast? I know uh, it's really good. Well, okay, you're coming from California. I don't think I don't think I should be telling you that there's good seafood in uh, in Boston. But there's clam chowder and stuff. Bean, be nice. You can't be mean to Bricky in my channel unless you're a tier 3 subscriber. Because if you're just mean to Bricky and you're not a tier 3 subscriber in my channel, then you're just mean to Bricky and that makes you rude. But if you're a tier 3, I can kind of try to fight for you. I could be like, listen, Brick, you know, you know, it's not personal. I'm just, I'm just letting, I'm just letting the Oilers, you know, I'm just letting the Oilers do what they do. I'm sorry, between you and the Oilers, I got to pick my Momos. I got to pick my sweet Oilers. So do not. If you're mean to him in his channel, that's different. But in my channel, I feel like, you know, I don't want him to sue me for, bull for bullying. And, you know. Once once he knows how many subs I have, he might sue me for bullying just to get a little bit of a, of a penny. New goal for Friday is to get a Bricky autograph and maybe a photo. Aw, look at that. It's going to make him blush. You saw a goddamn comment earlier. Go on. What did it say? What is a Magikarp day? Like, did you did he used to play Pokemon? When you say in the Magikarp days. 
I saw a clip about your thoughts on the name Tara. I just wanted to say my last name is Lee. And I talked to my wife at her name and my son Brock. He would have been a broccoli. He would have been broccoli. It's not quite broccoli. But thank you, Coffee, for the bits. The video went up, by the way, when I was looking at everyone's Warhammer paints. And you're in it. Bricky is making a harem and the top response with more likes was that insinuates that he is in charge. <laughs> oh, I think I think it's nice to, um, you know, when you take your dog to the dog park, right? When you're walking your dog, you're the one in charge and you're walking your dog. That's how it is when we have the Vishojo collabs, right? I'm just walking Bricky to the collab. I tell him to sit. He does the tricks. He gets a treat. But then when he's at the dog park, it's like yesterday, him and, and Heavenly. They're just running around. They're like, rah, 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 rah. space balls. Space balls. Space balls. I love space balls. Do you love space balls? Space balls. That, um, that's when you kind of let them out in the park and they're just having a grand old time. Gotta let them have fun with it, right? Gotta let them have fun with it. Ooh, you know what could be pretty? The mudstone brick wall could be pretty, actually. You've never been so insulted in your life and you play League of Legends? Okay, let me take a look. Sorry, Bricky. I care about your feelings, but I really also care about things in my video game looking pretty. Oh, okay. Okay. Not loving the sand wall, but I could I could work with the mud brick wall. The mud, the mud wall could actually look really, really nice. I could see the mud wall looking really pretty. Mm -hmm. But look at my palm tree house. As a tier three and a fellow guard player in tabletop, he and I are used to getting hammered by other players. As long as you derive a little bit of pleasure from it, right? As long as there's a little bit of pleasure. Then you're fine. As long as, as long as you enjoy it. That's all that really matters. Alright, let's plant these acorns and uh, get the hell out of here. Get the hell out. Oh, sorry. I thought he was dead. Let's plant these acorns, get the hell out of here, and... Uh, actually, I'm gonna kill this tree. You play guard. You don't play to win. You play for the narrative. You play for the trauma, right? The trauma makes you funnier. I get that. I get that. Should I wait till morning till my people move in? Have a good one, Bricky. Enjoy PAX East. I hope you get a lot of, uh, I hope you get to meet a lot of fans. I hope everyone's nice and respectful. I know, uh, when you have a stream, you know, it'd be always scary to meet people, but hope you have a good time. And, uh, by the way, all I gotta say, everybody, Bricky DM'd me with an idea for a collab. And I'm genuinely upset I didn't think about that collab sooner. I am genuinely upset that I didn't that I didn't think of that sooner. So no spilling the beans. I'm gonna tell them. I'm gonna tell them right now of your idea that I'm telling you that you have to keep doing and you have to keep making. I'm gonna spill right now. My God. Why is it always nighttime? Why am I always outside in the nighttime with everything spawning? How did you know that it was him doing? No, I'm kidding. It, it has nothing. I, I won't say anything. I won't tell you anything. You won't know. You're just going to have to wait. You're just going to have to wait. I'm sorry. Sorry, everybody. It is what it is. I cannot spill the beans. Well, maybe. Maybe I can spill the beans. I don't know. If you ask really nicely, I can maybe spill the beans. Whoop. Wait. Oh, right. I forget I got double jump. Mata, don't. Don't spill the beans, Mata. Don't do it. Can you please tell us? No, it's not mine to tell. It's not my business to tell. It's his business to tell. Sorry, guys and gals. Sorry, my loves. 
But that was please. Listen, begging or showing me a gun will not change anything. Whether you beg or threaten, it will not influence the situation. No value. Boop. Thank you for the bits. Thank you for the bits, coffee. Spike Shackle plus 2% damage. Oh, yeah. It's better than my other Shackle. Pong, thank you so much for the six months. What if we bribe? It won't work. I won't tell you. But you can try. You know what? I think Mata's joking. I think we just haven't bribed her enough. You know what? I think, I think she's flu- I'm telling you, I will not tell you. What if we bribe her? You do it all the time. You bribe me all the time. And when have I ever- Wait. Stop. I'm actually offended. Wait, 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 wait. Cease. I'm genuinely offended right now. When I beg you to reveal- when I beg you all to reveal my secrets, what do you all say? Nope, nope, no spoilers. Nope, we don't want to know. Nope, 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 nope. We don't want to know. We don't want to know. We don't want to know. Don't tell us. Don't tell us. Don't tell us. So. When it's my secrets, you don't want to know. But when it's other people's secrets, you want to know? He's got better secrets? How dare you? That's really hurtful. Ah! How dare you? You don't really think he's got better secrets than me. Say you're lying. I... I can't believe you all. I can't believe you'd all much rather have him spill things than me. This is like... I hate that I do this. I, I just build it just a little too low. This is... Th these stairs are gonna be the bane of me. Of my existence. Oopsies. Can't believe you guys. I can't believe you guys. I'm genuinely shocked. Here, a small offering. No, it's it's no offerings right now will 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 make me. How do I say this? Child, thank you for the gifted. No amount of offerings will take away the fact that you don't care about my secrets. You care about other people's secrets more than you care about our secrets. My secrets are less important to you. Now that I know that, it, it, it will not go away. I know that now. I cannot believe this. Remember when I wanted to spill so many times and you all just kept being like, no, 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 we don't want to. And I was begging. I was saying, please, can I just, can I just spill one little thing? Can I just spill one little secret? And the amount of nopers, no elpers, no, and, and the shaking cat emoji. It's a gift sub. I can't believe this. Chandelira, thank you so much for the 20 gifted. Thank you so, so much for the 20 gifted. Dill and Ken, thank you so much for subscribing. Kate, thank you for the bits. Song, thank you for the bits. Still, I can't believe this! I thought you all would want to know my secrets. I thought you all would want... I thought I'd be your favorite. You don't even... Do you even care about me? Or do you only care about... about about others in my stream. 
Mata, please. I'm sorry. I can change. Do you promise? Pink ghost, thank you again, by the way. And coffee, thank you for the bids. Do you promise next time I tell you I have spoilers and secrets? Do you promise that next time you will let me give you the spoiler and the secret? Do you promise? See, you're saying you're still saying no. Unbelievable. It's a gift up. You're never gonna know Bricky's secret. Never gonna tell you. Now it's personal. I'm never gonna tell you his secret. He told me every one of his secrets. I never tell you a single one. Ever, ever, ever. No help. No spoilers. No help. No spoilers. Alright. So now with these little guys. Nice. Thank you, Tibby, for the bits. Mom, don't listen to the false mobiles. We want to hear your dirty little secrets. It's too late, Tio. I already know. I already know, Tio. You all don't really care about my secrets. I already know you all don't genuinely care about my secrets. I already know it's too late. It's okay that you don't want to hear my secret. Maybe I don't want to tell you my secrets anymore. Maybe I don't want to tell you my secrets anymore. It's done. It's over. Thank you. Thank you for the bits. <laughs> It's not like you're working on anything big, and I'm working on everything big. But you will Boop. never know. I will never ever give you spoilers since it's not what you want. I get it. We gotta be fair. Either you let me spoil my own projects and other people's projects. It's one or the other. It's one or the other. Oh, oh, oh. That's fine. If you find gemstones, you can craft them into a grappling hook. I found a few gemstones. I found a few topaz and a few other ones. Be the Mark Ruffalo? What does that mean? That's the Hulk, right? Ooh. All right, then, Matara. Keep your secrets. Let me guess. Is it about your 3D model? Baby. You think I would be this busy with a 3D model? Nah. Maybe. But nah. I doubt it. What I got cooking is cooking. What I'm cooking is cooking. That's all right, everybody. I have learned a lot today. I have learned very important things in the stream today. Thank you, everybody. Yeah, 3D. It's a 4D concert. Biggest car. So wait, this is another environment, right? I could technically build a house here as well. And somebody would want to live here. Oh, never mind. He's not gonna be able to jump. He's got a big, he's got a big torso. He's kind of thick. Oh, what? Oh, it's this little guy that killed me. Lol. I was wondering. 
The 4D concert takes place in your imagination. If you believe hard enough, the tickets will appear. It's how it works. Oh, oopsies, that's not the stairs, but it doesn't matter. Underground is very dangerous. We'll be fine. Oh, this is still considered the desert. All right, then. Oh my god, they really are spawning fast. What the heck? They really are spawning fast, huh? Thank you for the hype train! I just realized, thank you for all the bits and thank you for all the gifted. All right, Bricky's secret is... I'm kidding. <laughs> no, it was genuinely such a good idea that he had that I'm... that I'm upset I didn't come up with it. I'm genuinely upset I didn't come up with it. it it's a great idea. It's almost like he's an alright content creator. What's that? Big... Almost like he's sometimes okay at making content. Oh, what's this? Desert fossil? Ooh. Desert fossil sounds interesting. Is it? Will we get a Momo plushie one day like the one I'm holding? Maybe, potentially. I think it could be fun. You can make cool items using those fossils. Hell yeah. They're my fossils now. Is it theft or archaeology? Let's talk about it. NPC below. Yeah, he's going to have to wait a moment. Mr. Golfer. Yesterday, he just moved into my house, but now I can find him in the wild. I didn't know that. An acceptable name. Hello. Welcome back. Here I am, back again. Torn into pieces. Here tonight, can't pretend. Thought you were the one. Right? Welcome back. Wonder if this is going to affect the bug. Oh, I guess we'll never know. Oh, yeah, it does. I guess we found out. Oh, that scared me. The rope getting picked up. All right, let's keep let's keep going and save the little golfer man, so he doesn't die to the bugs. I'm that kind, Mr. Golfer Man. I've come to save you. Hello. Why? Thank you. I've been stuck in this sand pit for days. Good thing you can get water out of a cactus. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ooh, desert torches. I'm just gonna sell them. So I don't have too many torches. I know you're gonna say, Mata, you can never have too many torches, but that is false. You can. Stint, thank you so much for the two months. I'm not gonna lie, cooked cactus looks delicious. I remember you can make it in Fallout New Vegas. You can cook cactus. I've always wondered about its taste. But then I know some other folks have told me that cactus, when cooked, can be poisonous? What is the truth? What is the lie? Ooh, the music just got a little dangerous here. What's going on? Oh, the music got a little spooky. Ooh. Ooh. What's going on there, you guys? Come on. Okay, this is going great. Yeah, he's not coming back. Yeah, it's got that little rock music playing. That's when you know... It's when you know things are serious. You've got the little rock music. It's it's happening. It's 
kind of strange. I'm using their own body sword that they dropped to fight them. Oh, it's just this music. It sounded very dangerous and scary, but now that I'm listening to it again, it's just this music. It's fine. Really, Ark? I'll have to use him in the future. Thank you. Thank you, Real. Much love, Matara. Thank you for the fun streams. Thanks for hanging out. Hey, honey. Come get your daily 12-hour stream. Yummy, yummy. Oh, is that a, something I missed up there? A little fossil of sorts? Hi, Zenti. How are you? Zenti, guys, we are almost able to monetize the shorts channel. We need, I think, 3 million views. And we're at 2.2 or 2.4 last time checked, I think. It's, it's getting there. We're getting there. On the way. Zenti's been putting in the work. Finish dinner. À minuit? À 3 heures du matin? Tu as fini de manger à 3 heures du matin. Listen. But I get it, right? You want to stay awake for the streams. I get it. Oh, et c'est vrai, c'est la Ramadan. Désolé. You are right. You are correct, you are correct. You can only eat after sundown, my dear. Well, bon appétit. What did you have today? What channel? If you type exclamation mark shorts, it'll get you to the shorts channel. It'll get you the info. Exclamation mark shorts or exclamation mark VODs. Wherever you want to go, my loves. We have it all in links for you. We have it all in a very easy place to get to. And poor Zenti, without getting into into without getting into it, because Zendi Zenti has signed a non-disclosure. I'm gonna make Zenti even busier soon. Poor guy. Poor Zenti. It's it's work work. More work, Matara. Work, work. Is that the bomb that you're talking about? Scarab bomb? Narrow explosion that will destroy most tiles. Ooh. Pretty, pretty. Hi, Idol. How are you, darling? What is everyone's favorite part of Terraria? For anybody, is it like what I'm doing currently, which is exploring mines? For anybody else, is it uh, boss fighting? Nice. You love the combat and the bosses are cool. The music. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Making a house. That does sound really fun. There are so many bosses. Kind of scared by just how many bosses there is, you know? I wonder if it's going to work if I do this with... Oh, no, it doesn't work. It has to be on the floor for this to... Yeah, it has to be on the floor for it to get burned. Cool. There's a lot of iron here. So what blocks should I be prioritizing now? Tungsten, iron... What about all my... Fossil fuel. Where are they? There they are. Terraria brings back pre-COVID memory. Was this your pre-COVID game? My, like, big COVID game was uh, Hades. Tungsten is better. Okay, so I'll just ignore anything that isn't tungsten or gold platinum. Because otherwise I'm spending time getting, like, copper and things like that. You know, why? Why waste my time? Iron is good for potions. Mm. Oh, this isn't a copper world. Okay. 
Have I found any heart? I don't know what that means. Alright, so I guess I will mine iron. But if I see copper, I can ignore it, correct? Like, if I see sandstone, I can ignore it as well. Like, that there, I think that's... Tin. Tin, I can ignore it. Perfect. Oops. Wait, are you not... Oh, it is broken. It was just weird. For large amounts of mining, the toggle can help. Thanks, everybody. Mm, let's make... Oh, right here. Matara, the toggle! Matara, please! The toggle. Alright. Gonna do this little... Whoop. Nice. More iron. More iron, more metabots, more power. We're gonna do this again. Pop! Because you never know what's going to drop. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Nice. Eventually mining gets so easy that you mine everything. It feels like a little bit of a waste, no? To just mine everything. You love it when I make metabot references? I only ever make one metabot reference. And it's more metabots, more power. That's it. That's the only thing I ever say. I don't think I've ever even, like, quoted anything else from metabo metabots. Ever, 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 ever. But I'm glad, I'm glad y'all like it. I'm glad y'all are enjoying yourselves, my loves. My favorite metabot was the, the pink cute one. It was the pink, cute girl. Usually, that's always my answer to everything. If you're curious what my favorite one is, it's probably the girliest, cutest one. Believe it or not. Oh, look at that! There's another house! I wonder who lives there. There's like a big painting. Nutra Nurse. It's me. I live here. All right, Dave. Let's go. Nobody lives there currently. For now. For now. We're going to change that, baby. We will change that. What do we got? Silver recall heals potion. Lesser shuriken rope. Fleeting ancient chisel. Increases mining speed by 25%. That's my stuff! Sorry, baby. It's my stuff now. You don't need it anymore. You lost your stuff privileges. Sorry, baby. I want this painting. Can I steal that? Or is the person living here going to be like, Hey! That's my painting! Why do I never find a chisel? Because you're chiseled already, my love. You are already chiseled. That is why. You are naturally so chiseled. And that is why you never find the chisels. Take the painting. Yoinks. Uluru. Ooh, I know that's a mountain. But I only know that because of uh, civilization, to be honest. All right. Any any use for me to actually make this into a livable house for somebody? Or is this kind of too far for them to live and not worth 
Is there anybody who would prefer living in here versus just living upstairs in the desert? Because I kind of don't see the point, huh? Not worth. Yeah, okay. I just figure it's going to be so annoying to go all the way down here. Just to, just to go visit them. Not worth it. My god, this exploration's been so fun. Oh, ow! Oh, oh that could have been bad. That could have been bad. I don't know how deep that went. More scarab bombs. Nice. Goodbye. I do not know about the pylons. I only know that I must construct additional ones. That is all I truly know. That there is never enough pylons. Alright, let's uh, go back upstairs and uh, I will take that opportunity to use the restroom. It's a good sound effect. Uh, when I was younger, I thought it was pronounced Vespene gas. To be completely genuine with you. Because I spoke French before English. So it just made more sense to read it as Vespen. Play this with up. What's the most amount of players you can play this with? Eight? I'm seeing somebody say, or more? Because I feel like it would get chaotic real quick. Alex, thank you for the prime, darling. Press control. Fine. Are you guys happy? Are you guys happy? We're smart mining. Does this bring joy? Is this what you wanted? Don't try it, don't. Ah, uh, maybe I will. Maybe this is what the Vishojo girls need. Maybe we all need to get addicted to Terraria. Imperial Pheasant, thank you so much. Great name. It's like Imperial Peasant, but, you know, a bird. Our house. Opulent and imp... Oh, wrong way. And Imperial. You chose your girls and boys. I've talked about it a few times, but I will I will say it again because it does come up every time I say we showed your girls. When I say that we showed your girls, I 100 million percent include Kudo in that. When I say that we showed your girls, I am thinking about Kudo. There is an image in my head of Kudo. He is my honorary Vishojo girly. Oh, oh, no, 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 no! Oh my god, I accidentally... I looked at chat and I almost killed myself, y'all. That could have been bad. That could have been disastrous. Alright, I have to go back to my house and then I have to pee. I have to go back to my house. I have to pee. Come on. Ooh. I'm actually low on health. I gotta be careful. Oh my god. The, the vines make it, like, not that hard to see where I have to go. I like it. Wait. A lot of these bad boys. What you gonna do? Hmm. Are you guys really gonna do this? Are you guys really gonna do that like this? They don't want to fall down. Fine. It's okay. Two hearts. Three hearts. We're good. You guys are so... Sneaky goofy. 
You guys are so sneaky goofy with it. Unbelievable. I know that nothing makes me feel better than the dulcet tones of Matara mining. More work? Work, work. Thank you for the bids, darling. And Cuddly, thank you as well for the five months. Kuro is one of the girls. There is nothing to say there. Kuro is the girl. They drop mandibles, which you will use a lot of. Well, thank God. I remember I had a few mandibles in my other world. All right, let's see if he's going to sell me a teleporter. Woo! Oh! I feel like the golfer man probably won't love living here. Let's talk to him. Nothing better than having all the space. Okay, he doesn't hate it. Good for you. Good for you not hating it. Good for you. I'm proud of you. Good for you. Hmm. Hmm. I need a big space for this portrait, huh? Big painting. Big. Damn it. Let me use the restroom. Be right back. Time for a bigger house, right? Time for teleporters. I did this whole thing. For teleporters. Where are they? Hmm? Be right back, okay? I think I'm going to do that, Zenti. I think I'm going to put a whole room above and put uh, the painting in it. I'm going to do that. Maybe I can also put the fire in it, to be honest. So that I can keep this, put a chest there instead. Be right back. Hello? I know many won't believe me. But I washed my hands. I washed my hands, believe it or not. The, the hand clapping is exactly how, how I feel. I'm really sitting here like, mm, congratulate me. I did that. <laughs> I did that. I did that. I really did that. Painter's here. Yeah, I see him. I see him. I don't remember if he's happy being here or if he hates any of those guys. Okay, so he's not too unhappy. I just need to make sure none of them hate each other because I... I need a portal. And... Oh! 
There we go, baby. Here it is in all its glory. All right. So we're going to get rid of the fire. We're going to put the portal down here. Oh, right here. Oh, do I need... Is there... Beautiful. Beautiful. Hold on, sorry. I can never say no to money. So I have all these extra, extra things to sell. I just always have extra. Oh, I could just sell them all my desert torches. I know they're beautiful, but don't need them. Ooh, Acer, that's good. Well, luckily, I'm going to be getting a lot of those potions, huh? Lucky for me. That's what I like. All right, let's make a little treasure chest. Boop. Perfect. In this treasure chest, I will put kite, fossil, rope, lens, my potions. Is there a way in the future to combine all your chests? Like, will there ever be a big chest where you can just see all of the items from your other chests? No? Ugh. My sister in Christ, you have seven of them, but they're ugly. Actually, I'm going to delete them. Thank you for letting me know. They're ugly. I don't like those chests. I want the pretty chests. Not without modding. Ugh. So I'm actually going to have to do a little bit of inventory management, but with teleportation, it should be a little easier. Should be a little bit easier because then I can leave all my main blocks at my main base whenever I decide what that's going to be. Save the chests. No. No small chests allowed. Only big chests. And that chest is too small for me. All right. So now what we're going to do. We are going to build a third floor. Believe it or not. Because I didn't build enough floors, it seems. Where we're just going to put the painting. The painting. That's it. Nothing but the painting. It's the only thing that's going to be on this floor. Hmm. And the fire. The painting and the fire. Sorry, that's money right there. That's money right there. Right? Got money, I'll do anything for you. Got money, just tell me what you want me to. We're going to make two of the lamps. And then what are we going to do? We're going to do some walls. Thank you, mister, for the resub. I appreciate it, darling. You made that mistake. Never again. Which one? Which one? Share it with the class, please. Your deep secret embarrassment. Let it be known publicly. Ooh, making a crafting pot. What would I need for a crafting pot? That is a good recommendation, I have to say. If you're going to recommend me things, and you recommend me things that help with money, good recommendations. Oh, big ant lion. Oh, right. I need a wall first, huh? I just need iron and wood. Okay. I don't know how much iron I have. I have to go check in my main base. I don't think I have enough. To be honest. But we can find out. We can find out. Telling me I could have been cooking these critters the whole time. Beautiful. Maybe I will cook them. Thank you, Cade. Take my money. Thank you. I am taking your money. You won't believe it, Cade. Earlier today, the Momos... The Momos really... 
really showed me their true colors. There was another streamer in here. And the Momos wanted to know that streamer's secret. And it reminded me when I begged you all to give you my secrets. And you kept saying, no, 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 no. I'm still recovering from the pain of that moment. Still recovering. I think I'll be okay, though. I think I'll be all right. From that mo moment. It's kind of pretty, right? My God, now I want to live here. This is a nice spot. But we are going to cook these critters, though. All right. Let, let's chop these trees and then get out of here. You love to contradict me. Where's that little cat? I know in my in my uh, Twitch emotes, I've added that little cat. My mods added that little cat because my mods here are wonderful. It's that little cat going... Grrr. That's how I feel when you say that. Wait, the Uluru? I don't think that's in Australia. But I could be wrong. That's how I feel right now. Grrr. Oh, it is in Australia. Whoopsies. Still can't get over yesterday when Quinn thought that the NPCs were fighting. They were just talking. But I guess their tone must have made him think. I want to hear all the Momo secrets. They weren't even Momo secrets. They were my secrets. But the Momos didn't want to know them. The Momos told me, no spoilers, no helpers, no spoilers. Can't believe it. Let's get out of here. No tell. Stop, you're going to make me sad. Only other people's secrets. You guys suck. <laughs> oh, oops, I wasn't looking. I was looking at my water. Fine. You will never get a spoiler. Who's this guy? That Edwin, he really had no appreciation for a good deal. Oh, I don't think he likes Edwin. Displays the name of rare creatures around you. Kimono. Portable cement mixer. Increases block placement and tool range. Tool range seems kind of good for mining, no? Minor improvement to melee stats and lower defense. Hmm. I don't think this guy likes the other guy very much based on the things he's telling me. I could be wrong, though. Okay. Sell me the teleporter. There we go. Piggy bank. Got him. I only need one piggy bank. I guess I'll do, do two piggy banks to put one on the other side. Let's go. Beautiful. Gonna get rid of this. Gotta put a regular floor. Gotta get rid of this. And now we have our first two way teleporter. I have no idea how the teleporters work. Gold squirrel? Wow! That sure seems rare. That sure seems rare. That sure seems like a great item to have. Hmm. I can cook it. I'm gonna cook it. It's time to cook. 
Toilet, bathtub, trash can, glass kiln. Oh, I should do some of these, huh? I should do some of these, huh? Sell it for 10 gold? That's wild. All right. So you did say that the cooking pot will make me get a lot of, a lot of stuff. So we're going to do a cooking pot. And then I kind of want to try getting the kiln. And then I guess heavy workbench. I guess we're going to make a workroom upstairs. We're going to make a little workroom upstairs for all this stuff. More work. Work, work. All right. I guess we can put the really pretty chandelier in the workroom. And here, just put the regular, the leg regular little guy. Boop. Nice. All right. Back to business. Mm. Two doors. Three lamps. And, uh... I have some walls. Perfect. I'm playing your favorite game. Nice. It's really fun. You got a good choice in games, my love. I'm enjoying it immensely. I'm about to start cooking these animals that I've been hunting. I'm getting really lucky with gold this playthrough. Do you guys remember yesterday I was having so much trouble getting gold for even one teleporter? And now I effortlessly afforded two and just got the other squirrel. This is a solo world for me, so I can kind of learn the game and go up my pace. It's a solo little world for me. All right, I guess I only needed two lamps, huh? I can trash a lamp, worst case. Ah, oh, beautiful. All right, let's cook. It's time to cook. Bunny stew. Minor improvement to all stats. Golden delight. Major improvement to all stats. All right, everybody. What should I do? Should I cook the golden squirrel? Sell the golden squirrel. Keep the golden squirrel. Cook the bunny. Sell the bunny. Interesting. I could keep it. I guess I could keep the golden squirrel, huh? Because it is rare. I guess. I guess. What else do I have? I guess Angel Statue I probably don't need to display here, huh? I'll just display it. I like how I just have a bunch of stuff in that room. I just have a bunch of stuff to show off. It's like everything I ever own. It's my little show and tell space. Food buffs are nice to have. Can I only make the bunnies in the cooking pot? Because it's not letting me really look at the other ingredients. Oh, maybe I put my scorpions away. Let me check what I have in my in my inventory. The angel statues are useless. Aw. So they're just like a flex thing, right? Like, oh, look at me. I have the angel statue. This house looks better than any house you've made in Terraria. Really? Really? Scorpions are fish bait. Oh, I see. That's right. I can write things. 
bowl of soup. Rabbit and... Uh, I mean, mushroom and goldfish. Worth it? Alright, guys. What, what's, the, what's the worth it stuff? Y'all said bunny stew? And then bowl of soup? Mm. Everything can be cooked. I see. It says medium improvement. All of this so far is small improvement. All right, I guess I'm going to stop selling my bunnies. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to make another chest up there for the food. I'm just going to keep some of the bunnies there and stuff. For now. For now. We're going to keep the owl. We're going to keep the bunny. We're going to keep the goldfish. The scorpions don't cook, right? We're going to keep the mushrooms. We're going to keep exploring till we find that statue. Don't worry about it, darling. We will find it. I guess I'll just keep all my food here, huh? Quick stack. Sort. There we go. I guess I could sell all my rope, right? Since I, um... Thank you for the sub! I guess I could sell my rope since I have my vines. And I don't think I'm... Oh, actually, I might be running out of my vines if I don't get many more. Hmm. Back in my day... Hacked items were replaced with angel statues. That actually sounds kind of cool. Was it a long time ago? Thank you for the gifted Ogma. Yeah, we're bringing this piggy bank to the other place. Oh, I can teleport. Hold on. I forgot I can teleport. Are you ready? You've been playing this too, Towsy? Thank you so much, my love, for the... Oh, my goodness, y'all. Did you see that? I teleported. Wow. I really did that. I really went ahead and I did that. I teleported. I did that. Can we get can we get a little a little cheer for me, please? So see, I'm playing this. I'm still new to the game, but I am enjoying it very, very much. I'm still learning. There's a lot for me to see. There's a lot for me to learn. There's a lot of stuff happening, but it has been a wonderful experience. Are you playing this for the first time or have you played this before a lot? All right, let's uh, let's sell in my ropes. Cool, let's get out of here. And then should we go left or right? You guys pick, are we going left or right for our adventure? Good job, Matara Khan from Vishojo, thank you. Down. Actually, down it could also be. You guys want me to go down? Okay. Down it is then. Down, down in an earlier round. Wonder if I should be taking some of my bombs. I kind of want to keep them. For a rainy day, I want to save them. I want to save my bombs until another time. Up, up, down, left, B. Time to go deeper and deeper and deeper. Yep. Let's go. My God, look at all this money.
Let's just make a little bit more platforms and a little bit more torches, and then we're going to get out of here. Then we need more of the regular slime, huh? All right, everybody. It's time to go down. Should I have just done a vine? Hmm, I guess we'll see as we keep going. I guess as we keep going. We'll see. <laughs> Dig in a zigzag pattern? That is a pro tip. But, I don't need it. If I die, I die. If I die, I die. It is how the cookie crumbles. I feel like I can kind of see under me. Are those going to be my famous last words? Like, oh, I'm go I'm okay. Narrator. She was only moments from disaster. Little did she know. Falling does seem really fun. Falling endlessly to my death seems like a really really fun fun way to pass the time. I keep forgetting I have double jump. I truly keep forgetting I have double jump. I want these platforms to be good for my solo jump, though. It was at this moment she knew. NPCs pay taxes to you. When do they start? They live in my house for free, eat my food for free. When will they start paying me taxes? It is only fair. Oh my god, this is the worst. When you find a taxman NPC. Ah, how many NPCs away is that? Use rope. I just realized that as I sold my rope. That I could have indeed been using it. Oh, we found a hole. All right, nothing in the hole. There's another hole to the side. All right, first order of business. Getting back up. All right, getting back up is the first order of business. Perfect. All right, let's see what we got here. Whoop. Thank you, Hiki. Half a month already. We are in this ride. Half a year already. Can you believe I am starting my sixth month on Twitch television? Can you believe this month is our sixth month? April 15th will be officially my six months of Twitch television. It is wild how time flies, my love. Thank you. Thank you so much. You can buy rope from the merchant. Not after I already sold it. We'll get more rope. Thank you for the gifted. What the heck? Is that iron? Because if it is, I'm going to take it. 
guess we're gonna find out. Yeah, it's iron. We're gonna take it. Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the gifted, my love. I appreciate that very, very much. Thank you, Hatter. Hmm, there's like stuff under there. Interesting. Can't tell if that's a rare something. Oh, whoa! Oh, it's my own ghost. My own ghost scared me. Mr. Bad, thank you for the six months. And Nin Nintendo, thank you so much for the six month as well. Thank you, everybody. I still can't believe you all... You all have been here with me from the start. Thank you. It has been quite... Quite the journey. On Twitch television together. It has been quite, quite the journey for us. And here we are. Oops, wrong tile. Thank you. All right. Ooh, I think those are gems. So what do y'all usually do? Do you kind of keep on the same two spots? Even though we're going to dig into water? Actually, we're not going to dig into water. Yeah, I guess I'll go back to this spot then. I'll just keep digging down this one. Oh my goodness, what is this? Just straight down? Alright. Alright. If I see demons, I blame all of you. Fall damage, no! Demons are much further down. How much further down? Oh wait, I forget which two blocks I was digging. So let me go back up again a little bit. Which two blocks was it? It starts here. It starts with one thing, right? I don't know why. It's here, 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 here. Okay, this way. So it's these two. It doesn't even matter how hard you try. I don't think you're even classified as underground yet. Are we there yet? Tired of this, Momo. Are we there yet? Six minutes reaching, digging down for demons. Um, whose idea was it to let me dig for demons? I didn't want that. I never once thought digging for demons was a good idea. Can't see who that was. Which one of yous? Huh? Which one of yous came up with that? Oh, that was just a slime. We're underground. Oh, because the music changed? Oh, I'm so sorry. Everybody was telling me how amazing the... Oh! Outsmarted. Baited. And outsmarted. Ah! digging. Just gonna keep digging. Just gonna keep digging, y'all. Don't mind me. Ignore me. Ignore me. Was it again? Control. All right, it's getting a little dangerous in here. You almost jumped out. How do you think I felt? Oh. Oh. 
Spooky, scary. First order of business. We got to find a way to get out. First order of business is how do we get out? Perfect. Oh, all right. Ooh, this song. Ooh. Almost sounds like stuff that you hear in like gem mines, right? Hence the little gems here. Okay. How, what do I press for that rock to come out is the question. I don't know where the pressure plate is. Oh, what? Oh my God, what is that? Oh, that scared me. I thought that was something bad. Oh, I see. So it's the chest. Okay. So if I had opened the chest, the, the boulder flies. I see. The fairies are new to you? Do they always come find you in the underground or is it just a lucky follow? It leads to treasure. After I do my iron. After I do my iron. Or do they, uh, do they expire after a certain amount of time? Because it can wait. Oh, are you telling me this fairy is leading me to the cursed treasure? Matha, I messed up. Oh, what'd you do? What'd you do? <laughs> How did he already get so drunk? <laughs> Bricky's drunk. Quick. Compliment him, everybody. Compliment him, and he's gonna get all red. Bricky, you're kind of all right. Bricky, I can tell you grew up in a stable home environment where your parents liked you. Bricky, you are fairly well adjusted to adulthood. <laughs> No, I completely get you, Bricky. I hadn't drank for a while before going to Japan. And then when I went to Japan, my my like I my first my second night there, I think, I went to karaoke with our JP managers and oh boy, I was drunk. At least tell a, tell tell the class what drink you were drinking. At least tell the class what drink you were drinking. I'm going to see if I can maybe activate it this way. I'm trying to see if, if this is how it's done. I'm trying to see if this is something that I can do. Hmm. I don't think I can. Hold on. Oh, that's it? I just have to, like, break the block? Gin and sparkling water. No way! I drink a lot of gin soda. Good for you. Vodka soda, gin soda. You know, sometimes when I'm feeling... Oh my God, that scared me for a second. When I'm feeling a little a little cute, I'll do a tequila soda. Hell yeah. If ever, a squeeze of lime. Oh. Low calories, gets you drunk. The, the crazy one is vodka water. If ever you feel a little too healthy... Are you guys seeing that? There's a dynamo... Fuck this fairy. Every time, okay, I don't know what it is about fairies. The last fairy I knew, also a big jerk. The last little fairy girl I know, also a big jerk. Also a huge jerk. She would also potentially lead me to dynamite. You know what she did? You know what the last fairy did? Yeah, Bricky, I am living vicariously through you. I hope you know that. I um I'm no longer drinking at home this year. I'm only drinking socially this year. And even then, I'm drinking socially not um not uh, all the time. 
And uh, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, did you guys see that? It's all jellyfish biome. Ooh, what the hell is this music? Oh, this is nice. Oh, it's mushroom biome. Okay, even better. Let's find people to live in the mushroom biome. But first, I need to find out how to... Two drinks, though, really? At your big, big, big weight? And I mean that in, in, a, in a good way, right? All right, what's a safe way to blow this dynamite up, y'all? Let's find out the hard way. Oh, never mind. I picked it up. Okay, apparently there was no safe way. Slowly regenerate life. Let's go. And then tungsten bar, wooden arrow, night owl, recall. Hell yeah. Okay, well, it still blew up. There was no way around the blow up. My god, it still blew up. Mata, look right above you. To the right. Yes. Here. Dart trap. Oh, that's what they look like. Thank you. Grab the shiny chest. It is. It is rare. It's mine now. I'm the dead man. Yeah, because even uh, if you don't drink for a while, you, you do get uh, you do get a little tolerance reset. Oh my god, why can't I put my stupid torch there? There we go. But two drinks is still it's kind of crazy. Two drinks is kind of crazy. Mom, put the trap in your hand to see the invisible wiring. Ah. But then what does this mean? I kind of don't understand the pathing of this. Interesting. Naruhodo. God. You telling me that chest was wired to four different traps? Well, it was wired to the dynamite. It was wired to the rock upstairs. And then it was wired to the dart trap. And you know the worst part? That stupid fairy tried to make me get to the chest. What a jerk. There's no way around it. What an absolute asshole. <laughs> right? I'm sorry for my language, but... Like... What a bitch. I try not to swear too much because I want to make sure that when I swear, it hits extra hard. But what an actual jerk. Is anybody else drinking alcohol tonight? You know the worst part? If my if my girlfriend hadn't bailed on me today, I was going to have a glass of mimosa for breakfast. Because we were meeting up for like a late lunch kind of vibes, you know? And uh, I was going to meet up with her for that. So I was actually going to have an alcohol today. Oh my god, wait. I, I forgot to take out the, the thingy. I was going to have an alcohol today. A nice little mimosa. We would have had a little bit of girl talk. Okay, this tree, I want it. Hold on. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing. Maybe it is a rookie mistake. But I am chopping down that tree. It's my tree. I already chopped down a pink tree and everybody got upset at me, so it can't get worse than this. It can't get worse than this. God. Can't believe he's out there living his best life. <laughs> Getting drunk on a third on a Wednesday. God. Has anybody hit here been? To PAX East. PAX East is either a great convention or ugh. Let me explain. Sometimes they do PAX East. Oh! Bulldozer! A total of 10,000 tiles. Don't mind if I do. Hold on. 
I want that little statue. Look, it's a little grasshopper. Cute. I don't know if it actually does anything. Keep leave, didn't we meet at a Pax East? I remember I organized the dinner. Didn't we meet at a Pax East? Okay, so this actually is gonna is gonna tie into my terrible Pax East story. So sometimes Pax East happens early March. Boston is frozen in early March. Yes, I live in the frozen Canadian wastelands, but even I think Boston is way too cold in early March. Sometimes Pax East is in April, which is much better for the weather. Oh my goodness. One year was February. One year I organized a dinner and uh, actually Keith Leaf and I, basically everybody got into their taxis. And sometimes this was kind of around Uber time, maybe slightly free Uber time. Um, where Keith Leaf and I got a bunch of people into taxis to go to the dinner. And then it, it was a dinner for me. <laughs> and then we both walked through the cold. Do you remember that? Do you remember like trudging through the cold? And I think you had a hoodie on only, Keith. Am I confusing you with somebody whose name starts with a K? Wait, no, it was you. Was it another moderator? Oh my God, am I here saying that all moderators are the same? You know what's my excuse? Anytime people tell me that I'm misremembering something, I say, sorry, I drank a lot of alcohol at that time. And it's true. Sorry, I used to drink a lot. You always feel bad for the cosplayers. Same. In February? Ugh. Thank you, Jen. I'll do that once I'm once I'm home again. It was pleb. Was it actually? Why do I why did I think it's you? Wait, are you for real trolling me? Because in my memory, it's you. It was you and I through the frozen... Wait. I have to stop stepping on all the traps. I have activated... Oh, I see it. I see. I see the trap. Huh. Can I... Yeah, there we go. We met in 2017. I have pictures. I thought it was... So it was in 2017, the dinner that I'm talking about, right? Also, stop bragging about your pictures. Stop this. I will sue. <laughs> I will sue. Amethyst on your left. Yeah, I know. I haven't gotten there yet. I'm uh, I'm here at the moment. We'll get there after. There's also this over here. There's a lot. Matha, you're missing the amethyst. Guys, I'm going back there. Don't worry. I'm still just digging. I'm still just, just doing. I'm mining. Who likes living in the mushroom biome? Because we gotta make a house. We gotta go back to the palm tree and make a house and then make a teleporter here. So that the people who live here can live here in peace. I have to stop blowing up my torches. Keep is a true OG. It gets worse. It gets worse. Some of my, uh, some of my real life friends I met on Twitch television 13 years ago. They do not even watch streams anymore. You know, sometimes I talk to you guys about my friend, um, my friend that works at Ubisoft and his uh, super long-term girlfriend. They bought a house together. She's a teacher. I know I've talked about them a bit. I met him on Twitch. Years ago. It's been so many years that we had... We had like a different IRL friend group that we stopped talking to. That's when you know it's been a long time. When you've even gone through like friend groups that you no longer speak about. This was friend groups ago. We're getting deep Matara lore, right? The deep Matara lore tonight. What's up, baby girl? My God, all the old people are... Oh my god, all the names from years ago. I'm seeing you guys. Hello. I know. When you've gone through friend groups, it is absolutely... When when you are friends with people and then you, like, get into a friend group and then you stop being friends with people in the friend group. Actually, okay, I have gossip about this friend group. 
because I, I feel like it's okay to say this gossip because you guys will, you know, you'll never know them. Um. Okay, because this is actually really big gossip. Okay, okay, okay. This is drama! Can we get the little drama evil? Oh my god. God damn it, Bricky. I wish I was drinking. I wish I was drinking and spilling secrets to my audience instead of just spilling secrets. Speaking of spilling secrets, y'all. Remember when I wanted to spill secrets and none of you wanted to know those secrets? Yeah. Guess what I'm not gonna do now? Spill my secrets. Because last time I tried to spill my secrets, you didn't... No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm going to spill these secrets. These are these are too good not to spill. Okay. Hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. Don't remember. <laughs> That's actually the perfect reply. Sorry, Mata. I was drinking back then. I don't remember. <laughs> okay. 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 So, uh, we, had an we had a few more friends. Uh, and it was... Um, Big... Basically, as you all know, the woman whose body I live inside, she used to stream, right? Um, which is one of the reasons that I took over her body because I figured she would have experience being a Twitch streamer and I was correct. So I did good inhabiting a woman that had already streamed before because it's just easier, right? So. Um. A bunch of people met in her stream and then they became friends and already there was a few of Matara uh well I guess it was she wasn't Matara flesh woman's um flesh woman's uh real life friends were watching the stream and then because you know when you're a smaller streamer a lot of your friends are watching it's it was kind of newer it was it was a lot less people streamed um oh oh hello Mr. Worm hold on let me... So, uh... Basically... These, um... Oh, oopsies. Where is he? Come back. So basically, a few real-life friends and a few Twitch friends, and then eventually, some of them started dating. So eventually, this one lady and this one man started dating. And, uh, it was very cute. It was very cute. And, uh... Eventually, because the, the lady lived not in Canada. So she moved to the city where a bunch of us were living at the time. And uh, it was really great. She was going out with her friend. We were all very happy for him. Um, that friend, very conventionally attractive young man. But terrible, terrible luck with women. Um, he kept getting catfished on Tinder. And we all obviously obviously made fun of him for it because it's funny right haha uh it's kind of the only thing they had on him right because he's i don't know what it was about him like genuinely nice looking guy great dude whatever so anyway he found this woman they started dating we were all so happy for them she moved over to where we were living we were all so happy for them but then you know the girl had a little bit of baggage hey who doesn't right we're all watching Twitch television. We all got a little bit of baggage, right? Like, it's fine. Everyone's got a little bit of baggage. Everyone, everyone comes with uh, a few, a few, uh, a few things, right? So. The big, the big thing is, so at some points already, there was a little bit of drama brewing because, uh, basically, every time this girl it, with the new couple, right, they would want to go visit the other couple um they would basically say oh we're coming over we're coming over whatever and every time they would cancel last minute if it happens one time it's fine but at some point they kept canceling last minute and then you know the other couple would complain a bit to me about it because i was i was kind of in the middle i was just kind of there you know with everybody i was still friends with everybody and i i get it i'm like hey it really sucks you guys got to tell them hey we really don't appreciate if you guys just cancel last minute. It's fine if you guys cancel. We totally get it. Please try to not cancel last minute. We already have dinner on the table. We're waiting for you. We got everything set up. You know, don't do that. It's not cool. The big, the big, the big, how do I say it? The big thing that kind of broke apart the friend group. Um, I mean, already the friend group was kind of breaking apart because, uh, Basically, what had happened is, um, 
Oh my god, I like this. I like this. This is this is so much fun. I haven't. I only ever talk about it with like that, but my my friends and we. <laughs> so, the TLDR is uh, so the guy that my friend and I would always roast. He was our good friend, and we would always hang out. And it was the three of us, and we would always hang out. And then when you know my friend got a girlfriend, we would always hang out with her. And then when the other guy got a girlfriend, we would always hang out with her. Of course. But then eventually he stopped inviting us because he would always hang out with his girlfriend, which is fine, right? We get it. It happens. It sucks that it happens, but some people, when they get into a relationship or get friendship, right? And we invited her all the time. We were even saying, like, bring her along with us. We love, we love hanging out with her. So already things were kind of starting to get weird because, 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 um, he would start canceling on me. It's one thing, right? When they cancel. But then our friends started canceling on us. So we we were getting a little bit upset about it. We're like, all right, you know, you, you can't can't you can't keep canceling on us last minute. Da, 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 da. Um, and it was always like these weird excuses and whatever. So this is where it gets juicy. At some point, pretty much me and and my friends, the teacher and the and the Ubisoft friend, we're all kind of already not really friends with them they're kind of on their last straw we're not really close it's not and then um the the girlfriend of of the girlfriend that came from abroad she drove drunk she drove drunk and got arrested and it's not legal to do that Allegedly, she then called my friend, who is a teacher, meaning she has a government job. She works for the government. If anything happens to my friend and she has anything on her record, it's bad. She called my friend, who is a teacher, and guilt and basically said, hey, could you lie in court for me and lie about how much I drank? And she said, no. First of all, that friend, I love her to death. She cannot lie. She... If I ever killed a man, allegedly, I would never tell her to bury the body with me. I would go to her boyfriend. He wouldn't even ask questions. He would bury the body with me. And then afterwards, I'd buy him a beer and he'd say, what the fuck, Matara? I love you, but what the fuck? Can we talk about it now? But his girlfriend, absolutely not. So that girl who already had really bad relations kind of with, with us and the friend group, she called... Our friend asked her to lie in court when she's also an awful liar. And if any of this got found out, she would lose her license to teach. Allegedly. And and then when she said very politely, she was like, look, I'm so sorry. I don't think it's something I can do. I really don't feel comfortable. She then guilted her about it. That girl then proceeded to guilt trip her about it. And that's when we all were like, all right, it's done. Some friends, they do not grow up with you. Some friends, you keep them in the past. Some friends, you keep them. You do not, you do not, you do not continue life. How crazy is that? How wild. It, also, just, just being honest, out of every person she could have, like, not saying I would have lied for her. Absolutely not. But if you're going to ask somebody to lie for you, don't ask that girl. And already you were not being a good, oh, anyway, how do you like that story, huh? There was obviously a lot of other things, you know, that we're not going to go into. But it's the one that she, it's the fact that, honestly, I think the fact that she asked her to lie is bad. I'll be honest with you, I think it's bad. But I can sort of understand it. I think she was desperate. I think she was trying her best. I think she was, I'm not defending, I'm not saying it's right, but I'm saying I understand sort of why she, she did it. But it's the guilt trip after that, that we all, it was, a, it was an, awful guilt trip and then and then you know what else and then she made her boyfriend our old friend call the other male friend 
and guilt trip him into guilt tripping his partner. <laughs> And that's when we were like, all right, all right, this is it. This is this is done. But hey, I'm still friends with the non-red flag ones. Isn't that great? As I said, I think even though she should not have asked for somebody to lie in court because that is illegal. And by the way, if you lie in court, you have very high chances of getting found lying in court. Like, I'm genuinely telling you all. Please, please try not to lie in court, you guys. Please, please, please. Uh, but especially if you have a government job <laughs> that you need to keep. Um, but it's the fact that they guilted. It's the fact that they guilt tripped. Oh, both of them. Good times. Good times. True, we're not doing it at the moment. I'll probably do another one soon. I want to paint a few myself and, and make a few minis myself before we continue that series. But I'm glad you're interested. There's going to be more. There's going to be more. But yeah, that that was... Uh, I think at one point when you, when you get into, you know, your mid, early, late 30s, you should already have eliminated a lot of people. Eliminated is the wrong word because it sounds like murder. But you should have already... Mm, you should have already thinned out your friend circle considerably. I think. There, there's, there's just... There's a lot of flags and deleted, removed, alt control deleted, yeeted. Yeah, 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 yeah. And again... I think we've actually talked about it because th this has been like a big, you know, gossip for, for me and, and, and like my other two friends that remains. <laughs> At one point when uh, when quarantine was happening and I lived, as you all know, I lived in a little hut in the woods during quarantine. Well, maybe you don't know, actually, I shouldn't. Sorry. So when um, when COVID was starting, I, I basically moved far away from any big city. And I lived in a hut in the woods and I had to do a lot of manual labor and things like that. It was awesome. It was a great, great, great time. Uh, sorry, I shouldn't assume you all know. I'm so sorry about that. And uh, whenever quarantine started getting lifted a little bit and you were allowed to have a bubble or you were allowed to visit a few people, um, these two friends would visit me or I would visit them like they'd, they'd come pick me up because I don't drive. Or I'd hitch a ride from, if anybody knows about this, I had a really old neighbor, I'd hitch a ride with him, and then they'd pick me up somewhere. Um, but we, you know, we would, we would theory craft about this, because we would, we would think, okay, so, would we still have been friends if? <laughs> and then we just theory craft, like, okay, so, if the friend ended up then apologizing to us for always bailing and for... All that stuff. Would we have been friends with him? Oh, yeah. But not after the perjury stuff. But all the other stuff, yeah, we would have been friends. So we... <laughs> so after a few beers, my friend and I would always kind of be like, okay, so where do we draw the line? Where would we have continued the friendship? Because <laughs> there was like nothing else to do during quarantine. Oh, good times. Yeah, how low is the bar? And reality is, I think as long as the 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 guilting and the perjury stuff didn't happen, we we would have welcomed our friends back, both of them. If they each just were like, honestly, I don't even think they would have had to apologize at the start. I think eventually it would have had to come up because it's one of those things where, you know, hey, what happened that you guys were just kind of ghosting us for a really long time? We noticed, of course. But uh, then the other thing really kind of kind of put it in the cottage core Matara outfit. Epe, I hope you have uh, I hope you have room because I don't know. Epe Bay, you're giving me too many creative ideas for how busy your your client list always is. Hmm. Have you tried being less busy so I can hire you more? <gasps> what are these worms? Are these magic worms? Oh, they're just night crawlers. 
people get weird after getting into relationships? I, I don't know. I think people are always weird. Genuinely. My mind is my own enemy. Ain't that the truth? Yeah, the story, like I said, it, it's juicy. Oh my god, why do I keep... It's a juicy story, but... It's just... It's not my juicy story. I was adjacent to the story. Because she never asked me to lie. And good. Because I... I think there's one big reason why I don't drive is because, as you may be aware, I, I've been drinking for a long time, which is why now I'm deciding, you know, not to not to drink as much and making a change and all that good stuff. But I had worked in bars, clubs, all that good stuff. Um, and I just knew that if I would drink, I would A, drive drunk, and B, I would give everybody lifts. I'm that kind of person where I would give everybody lifts to go home. No, I, I can't. I can't be the one giving everybody lifts. All the time. I, I really, really would. So I would have, I would have. Yeah. Musician here, professional alcoholic. I mean, those kind of go hand in hand, huh? Charge them for gas. Oh, I could never. I absolutely could never. No drinky driving. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Which is also why it eliminates a lot of a lot of um, whenever we talk about living somewhere warm. Unfortunately, the fact that I don't drive eliminates a lot of anytime people talk about ooh move to the south of United States. Da -da 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 -da. Not with no driving. Maybe some places can work now, especially with Uber. But it's still. Then again. Some places could still work with Uber, I think. Ooh, ooh, oopsies. All right. Sorry, I gotta pay. I can't look at chat when, when this warm guy is coming out. Move to Europe. I don't know when's the last time I talked about it. So maybe some of you don't know about this. But right before COVID happened uh, in 2019, I was uh, doing my visa to move to Portugal. You can get a pretty easily, uh, I think, like two-year Portugal visa that you get then renewed. Um, that you then get renewed every two years, pretty much. And once you're in Portugal, it's really easy. And then uh, COVID happened, and I kind of chickened out. So if I hadn't chickened out, I would have been in Portugal during COVID. I was, I was working, and now I, I don't even know anymore. Now I don't even know anymore. I feel like now I'm, oh my god, I'm so bad at placing these. Now I don't even know anymore. Alright, so the fact that there's water here, I kind of want to drain out the water and then keep making my elevator. I'm going to drain the water on the side. And then after I drain it, I'm going to keep doing my stairs. Lana, thank you for the six month of sub, my love. I appreciate that. I know, there's some nights where you just get all the deep Matara lore. I don't know, I don't know. Maybe the moon is right. Maybe the stars are bright. Maybe the moon is bright. The lore is flowing. Okay, this... Emptying out this reservoir might take a longer time than I realize. So instead, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this, I think, right? I think this might be easier than emptying out the whole reservoir. Mm. I am going to empty out this first, though. Okay, perfect. Sticky bombs would be helpful. Oh, for blowing this up, huh? Smart. Ooh, there's a whole nother biome down there. Okay, we'll get there in a moment. You used to do security for nightclubs and bars in Ontario. Ooh. Hey, you're actually kind of on the way to Popehood, if you think about it. The current Pope used to be a nightclub bouncer. I'm just letting you know. If you're ever interested in Popedom or Popehood... 
You're halfway there. Wait, what? Yeah. The current Pope used to be a uh, a uh, bouncer. I think I think he's from Argentina, right? The current Pope. Or Colombia? Sorry. If I am... You're bluffing? Look it up! 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 If I am correct... You guys owe me kisses. <laughs> He's from Argentina, but thank you so much for mentioning Colombia. I got you, baby. I got you. Ooh, look at that spooky thing over there. What is that down there? Ooh, that's something big. Big and chunky. When he was a student, he was. Hell yeah. Hope lore is crazy. It's good. It's good lore. Isn't it? It's good, interesting, wholesome lore. God damn it. I keep I keep messing up the... I have a feeling I know why I'm messing it up too. It's really easy. I just have to stand here and then do the first one. And yet I always do it wrong. Oh, it's just a big slime. There's also something else here. Another big drop down. How big is it? His holy damage bonus helped him in bar fights, right? Against the undead. The ghouls of the night. Oh! <gasps> Ooh! Look down there! It's shiny! It's so shiny and pretty! All right, let's go back down there and just pick up whatever we dropped here. Do I think I could take the Pope one-on-one? -on -one? Uh, how old is he now? If he's, if he's kind of old, I think maybe. Oh, okay. I don't... <laughs> Wait. I just realized something. Okay, okay. Hear me out. Ages ago... I didn't realize it was Easter weekend. Back when I had a job at Hollywood, I um, I wanted to do a Crusader Kings run where we took over uh, Christianity and basically made it our own religion and made it a cannibal religion. Because there's like, there's this thing if you do cannibalism in Crusader Kings where it's super negative and everybody hates you. But eventually we would have just made everybody be a cannibal. It's kind of tough, but you know, you just got to do your best. And uh, I was basically then recommended by a lot of people that, uh, hey, maybe it's not a good idea to do that. It's a religious holiday and you are... But I didn't... I wasn't doing it. I know that it sounds bad when I explain it like that. But I swear to God, I never thought of it as like a... something purposely transgressive. I just thought it's a really funny challenge. And I didn't realize that it was Easter weekend. But now... Hey! The Cannibalism Crusader King run. When is Eastern weekend? When is Easter weekend? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I, I genuinely didn't realize it was Easter because... Um, first of all, I'm not very religious. I don't know if you may have noticed. And secondly, um, if we were, uh, it is Orthodox, right? Ukrainian Orthodoxy. So it's uh, it's a different Easter. And also, I feel like people in Orthodoxy, I don't know. So yeah, I'm very sorry. Again, I really do not mean it in, in a malicious or anything. It was just a fun challenge in a video game. We could do that now. So speaking of the Pope. Okay. Also, maybe a small disclaimer, right? I'm not trying to get canceled. I am saying this absolutely for jokes, not for serious, okay? Um, 
I think I could probably fight the Pope. Mano a mano. Womano a womano. Um. Yes. If he is just using his man powers, yes. I think we could absolutely duke it down. I think we could fight. For legal reasons, I am joking. Um. Even though he used to be a bouncer, he's pretty old. And my flesh woman is pretty young. If he starts using his god magic, I'm doomed. I am doomed. If he starts using his powers, that's when that's when I'm in trouble. For legal reasons, this is a joke. He's gonna cast holy fight. Yeah, he's gonna consecrate the ground I'm walking on. And curse me. Yep, when he brings out the holy water. Well, my flesh woman has been baptized, so I think she can resist the holy water, right? Because that's the whole point. So I think I think she's got like a little bit of natural defense, but uh, not that much. She'll still she'll still be in a little bit of danger. I do have bug brain and bug rot, so yeah. And I'm friends with Satan, right? Iron Mouse. But if it was just for real, just, you know, just the Pope and I, me in a bikini, the Pope and Trunks, woman to, a woman a woman, mano a mano, I think, uh, yeah, I think I could take him. I think I could take him. Don't make me imagine that. I mean, life is long. If you're going to be fighting, do it in a bathing suit, right? What about a rap battle? Oh, I will lose that. I can't rhyme anything ever. How am I taking damage to him? How did that work? He's like strangely attacking me, but I can't hit him. Mother slime. Sorry, baby. There can only be one. There can only be one. I am the slimiest mother. All right, where were we before I started talking about having a battle royale with the Pope? Glowing mushroom? Oh, wait. Nice. So I have to eat the life crystal. Yum, 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 yum. I have 140 life. Let's go. If you defeat the Pope, will you get their power? That's only if you eat the Pope, you get their power. And I think if I got into that, then I'd actually get in trouble. I, I think if we get into that, only in video games, only in Crusader Kings... Only in Crusader Kings. Wow! Y'all, this is so pretty. This is such a pretty biome! What the heck? Who's that little guy in the water? Oh, wait, Tinor is not important, right? At this point in the game? Should I build a house here? Is there a teleporter for this place? Because if there is, I'm going to build a house here so I can very easily teleport. And then just make a elevator down from here. Sometimes it always circles... Uh, somehow it always circles back to cannibalism. The heart wants what it wants. You know? He's so cute. Ooh, big mushroom tree. Hmm. Oh, I have the thingy activated. Okay. Nice. 
<gasps> what is this? Heart statue. Don't mind if I do. My god. So many things. Do, 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 do. What were we talking about before I started talking about the Pope? If you defeat the Pope in hand-to-hand -hand combat, he grants you one wish. I don't know. I'm doing pretty good. I don't want to... I get. I think I'd save that wish. <laughs> My life is perfect right now. There's nothing I could wish for. There's nothing I could wish for. World peace. Okay, but hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's a little selfless of me, isn't it? That's a little selfless of me. No? Selfless. I don't know. How about being a billionaire? You know? If we had world peace, I wouldn't be able to hate. Yeah, what about all the hate in my heart? Imagine if we had world peace and then I'd be the only hater. Mm -mm. You would wish for a JP visa. Oh, look at that little gecko! <gasps> Geckos, I'm coming for you. Geckos, I will eat your little tails. I will eat your little tails. So, the big thing with the JP visa that I know, I know a lot of folks are sad to know. Plus 20 mana? I already have a lot of mana. Um, a lot of folks are sad to know, but first of all, I cannot marry Henya. Um, because my flesh woman is a woman, and you can't marry a woman in Japan. Number one. Number two. It's not hard getting a visa for Japan. I know this. Because a lot of people that I know have gotten visas from Japan, from Canada, or the United States. And if I marry Henya, then I'd have to get her Reese's and split my money with her. Come on. All she would do is re eat Reese's every day. Political marriage. It's an alliance. <laughs> Oscar, thank you for the six months, darling. She is adorable, but counter, counter, counter argument. I can have Henya in my life without marrying her. Counter, counter, counter argument. I don't need to marry Henya to enjoy her cuteness, right? Sometimes you can go to the car dealership, drive that car around, and then get out and say, all right, I'm going home. I don't need to marry the car. And that's quite fun and exciting. You know? Oh, oopsies. I was looking away. And then the mother of slime came. You tried driving a car in a strip club? Well, that's your first mistake. You shouldn't do that. I wouldn't drive a car in a strip club. That's vehicular manslaughter. It's Grand Theft Auto V. Frey, thank you for the gift in my love. What if Henya wants to marry you, though? Well, she's not allowed. My sweet Henya is not allowed to marry anybody. Excuse me. My Henya is staying a pure, unmarried woman forever. Do you know what happens if you get married? You hold hands and then you get pregnant. She is not allowed to hold hands and get pregnant. So she is not allowed to get married ever. Not even with me. That is how it works. Once you are married and you start hand holding, Pergantent. <laughs> it's scary. No, she's not allowed. She has to be a pure, a pure child forever. 
Previous Henrys have married too much, so now she must bear the sin of all the Henrys ahead of her. And remain unmarried. Okay, so I asked this question before and I'm going to ask it again. Can I make a house in this biome? I don't know why I'm saying the word house. I'm having really a hard time pronouncing my words lately. I feel like I always pronounce them so strange. I don't know why. Lately, my pronunciations have been not great. I can build a house. Will the people living here give me... um, What is it called? Teleporters to the mushroom biome. Maybe even sober too long? Maybe. Maybe, maybe that's my problem. Maybe I work too hard, love too much, care too much. You're right. Maybe I'm too humble. There's only one NPC who wants to live there. Good. We'll find him and we'll make him live there. Can you spoil who it is? Please. There's an underground pylon. Ooh. All right, so I guess now we got to find the pylon, huh? It sucks we can't just construct additional ones. How deep can this game go? Some people were telling me that they had thousands of hours in this game. So, pretty deep. Pretty deep. And the music is just keeping you entertained the whole time. You need surface mushroom to make mushroom loving NPC to spawn. I have surface mushroom, the little golden one. Right? What do we got? Hook. Snail. Enchanted nightcrawler. Ow! Heart statue. Glowing mushroom. I should have a little blue seed. I don't see it. Mushroom grass seeds. I see it. Bull, thank you so much for the tier one, my love. Shroomerang. Ring, 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 ring. Shroomerang. What a name. Hell yeah. I'm shrooming. I'm shrooming with it. It looks phenomenal. You miss StarCraft? I get you. That's how I know. That's how I know you're of a certain age, my love. Shroom Tara Khan. It's funny because earlier t today when we were yapping, I was talking about growing my own mushrooms. Um, and uh, kind of talking about, you know, living in a place a little bit more off the grid, having your own stuff. But the problem is I'm a little bit away from that. It's the same reason why I don't want to have pets. I travel too much. I love too much, care too much, work too hard. I travel too much and it would be a burden if I had bugs, right? Not bed bugs, like actual pet bugs. And then it's one thing if you ask your friend to feed your cat, but another one if you're like, hey, could you feed my hissing Madagascar cockroaches? Thanks. You know, I think one and another get, I think they get treated a little bit differently. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. Am I still pre-hard mode? I don't even know what that means. I haven't fought a single boss yet, if that's what you're asking. Why? Because I'm I'm raiding the mushroom caves. I'm raiding the mushroom caves, my love. You get a shop NPC with someone they love to live here. Ooh, that's really smart. Thank you. We'll do that. I'll have you guys help me with that in a moment. Oh, wait. I want to use my shroomerang. 
Let's go. There's a heart in the water? Oh, there is! How did you see that? Okay, you got some crazy eyes, my love. Those are some great eyes. will o -Wiz, thank you for the three months, my dear. All right. A little bit of ecological terrorism. Don't mind me. Just doing my part. We got the gamer eyes. It is hard to see things here. You can almost immediately tell what stage of progression she's at by looking at the gear. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You tell him. Oh, he's coming. Where is he coming from? Ah, there he is. I'm thinking. Sorry, it takes me a while when that happens. It takes me a minute when that happens. I'm thinking. Mm. What did I start thinking about before before the Pope Battle Royale? We were cooking. We were thinking. Also, this is how I know I really do need that day off tomorrow. I'm taking the day off just to have meetings. Oh boy. I really do need it. Where I actually have to take a minute to think on stream. I'm like, wait a second. What am I thinking about? What are we doing? I think I need to take a quick break and get some water. I'm feeling a little thirsty. Oh yeah, let me try the bombs. See how those work. Oh, maybe get out of the way. Okay, that was a little worse. Ah, it's rolling back! Yeah, the bombs. I guess maybe if I throw it in a hole, if there's like enemies. Likely, thank you for the six months, darling. You were a druid in the woods, drinking with friends and sitting in the back of a pickup truck, driven by your elderly neighbor. Oh yeah, that was way before. We'll talk about that more sometimes. I have a lot of stories about that. Good times. Those good times. One of a kind. One of a kind good times. Uh, okay, let's make a little safety. Let's make a little safety. Let's make a little... I'm also... going to make a little fire. Just in case... Just in case some little guy decides to come in and try to kill me while I'm AFK. Dragon of War, thank you for the prime. And welcome, Skrillex. Ah! <sighs> <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna stretch. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't have a coffee today because I was trying the gamer subs, but I'm gonna make a decaf coffee. Because I wanna I wanna I wanna taste. The coffee. Anyone able to hear anymore? It's just stretchies. It's just stretchy noises. Big stretchy noise. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, nice, Janone. I think I'm going to try to make a few of those. Sounds like my tea is ready. <laughs> I don't think I can do it now. Because it's kind of late and I don't want to wake up my roommates. I don't know if my microphone's picking it up. The saddest thing that I ever learned from my vocal coach. Is that I have a really wide range. <laughs> that is that is very sad. Very, very sad. Ooh, one thing before I, I, I take my quick break. Who's excited? 
for the great, I, I don't know, we need, to, we need to find the name for the great Momo sacrifice of 2024. On how many days are in March? On March 31st, Sunday, I invite you all to church, the church of Matarakan. We will have a very special ritual on that day. We will be sacrificing momos. You will pledge your life and your blood for my big project of April 1st. I will be reaping you and you're harvesting your energy and your butts for my April 1st event. We need a really, really good name. I will be timing out all the momos who chat on Sunday, March 31st. By allowing me to time you out for 12 hours, you will be giving and pledging your energy. The Momo Munion, I like that. The great Momo Munion. I like it. Kind of sounds like Mana Moon. The great Momo Munion of 2024. Any others? Give me some more. Let's cook. The Momo Gedon. I really like Momo Munion. The great momentum. The Great Momo Munion of 2024. The Rapture. <laughs> I think I think that name's already claimed. I think I think that the name, the Great Momo Convergence, Harvest Day. The Momo Wing, like the Reapening. Mm -hmm. The Momo Quisition. The Great Momo Moment. The Great Momo Moment is cute. The Momo Convergence, the Momo Virgins. Kind of sounds like Momo Virgins. <laughs> Momos are virgins, the Momo Virgins. <laughs> like converging Momo Virgins. <laughs> I like it. We got to cook a little bit. We have to cook a little bit on, on the name for us, for this. Yeah, the momos die when they reproduce because basically you get eggs put inside of you by me. And then when new momos are born is because the momos hatch inside of a human body and then they spring out. It is an honor, truly, to let me lay my eggs inside of you to, to, to spawn future momos and birth. The great mobilization is great. Good. I like that. The great mobilization of 2024 leading into April 1st. I like it. Mobilization has a really good ring to it. Zero. Mark it down. Mark it down. The great mobilization. I like it. It's really nice. I like it a lot. All right, everybody, I'm going to take a few minutes and uh, get myself some decaf coffee, maybe grab a snack. And uh, we're going to be back. I can't believe I've already been streaming for five hours. I feel like I haven't even done anything. But since I'm taking tomorrow off and my first appointment, I think is actually, no, I wanted to go to the gym. So I guess my first appointment is at 10 in the morning. We can definitely do a longer stream tonight, though, because of that. All right, be right back. Behave, okay, my loves? Please behave. Zero, you're in charge. Zero, you are the adult, you are in charge. Please behave. All right, everybody. I say zero is in charge, but Keith was here too. I remember seeing Keith. I remember seeing Miwa. Keef, Keef, you can also be in charge. You can be second in charge. <laughs> you can be second in charge. You can be second in charge. Okay.
All right, be right back. It's a gift sub. 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 Hello? Ah! I got decaf coffee and dark chocolate with almonds. Be the voices? Oh my god, wait, why are we getting hit? Oh my god, wait a second. Why do you always do this when I take when I leave the computer? <laughs> what the heck? Cypherius, thank you for the prime. Vermilion, thank you for the gifted. Calm Wolf, thank you for the five gifted. Star Killer, thank you for the five gifted. OG, thank you for the bits. Thank you for the hype. OG, more bits. RTK, thank you for the gifted. You know what, everybody? I think my favorite oiler is coming out of sleeping. I think our favorite oiler, our number one oiler. It's a gift sub. She's coming out. She's coming out of her sleep. 
Vermillion, thank you so much for the bits. Unfortunately, when this Euler gives bits, uh, gives subs, it never it never counts for the hype train. But Matara, thank you so much for the 10 gifted Matara con. And Tannis and Wizard, thank you for the raids. What the heck? Thank you for the raids. Wolf, thank you for the 10 gifted. Thank you so much. Keith, thank you for the bits. Did anything happen while I was gone? The last of my bits, Cade, I think you've done enough. Cade, look at your bits. Now look back to me. I think you've done enough damage. Welcome, Raiders. We've got two raids just one by one by one. Thank you. Mm. Having dark chocolate with almonds. It's very good. Look at your horse. Now look back to me. These diamonds are now tickets. No, these tickets are now diamonds. Thank you, my love. My love is... Sometimes I like to pretend that you're all one singular Momo. But you're very many different Momos. Thank you, Roasted, for the bits, my love. The primordial, the primordial Momo. He is inside all of us. Mm. Ah, this is nice. Nice little break. Mm. You are the smartest part of the brain. You are the brain cell, Yomo. You are the one brain cell. Ah, oh, spiders makes me miss Mass Effect. I wish you could romance Legion. Legitimately. I know it would have been kind of strange because, you know, but they were cowards. I also wish they could have let me romance Rex. Cowards. Absolute cowards. I think it's a gift sub. What do y'all think? It's a gift sub. Ooh, we are 35 sub points away from 7,000. It's a gift sub. Thank you. Do y'all think, what about Grunt? It's no, Grunt up. felt too much like a, you know, he's a baby. Rex is where it was at. I genuinely don't really want a romance joke, uh, Joker, right? The pilot. I think him and Edie had the perfect thing going on. Rex was too busy repopulating his species. Uh, what about me? What about what I want? Mm-hmm. What about what I want? It's a gift sub. Mm. He could have repopulated with me. <laughs> Mm. Let me play the little Terraria music again for y'all. I wonder how that would work. Human with Krogan. I feel like the humans would die, right? I feel like the humans will maybe, possibly... Ooh, what's that over there? You guys see that? It's red. I'm going. Red is good. Red means good. Red means treasure. Red means treasure. Red means good. All right, let me first try to make those sticky bombs that you guys were talking about. Thank you. All right, let's make a few sticky bombs. Boo -doo -doo -doo. Oh, oopsies. I didn't Boop. sticky it right. Enya's Reese's gift card rebate. Thank you. I'm glad she was so happy with all her... Oh, shit. I wasn't looking. I'm glad she was happy with all her Reese's. I'm glad she was happy. I'll get her some more when I when I go visit again. I'll get her some more when I come visit again. I'm, I'm glad she really liked the Reese's O. Henry. Because that one, I feel, is always in stock. Unfortunately, some of the other Reese's, they're seasonal. Like, the Easter Reese's and the Valentine's Reese's are seasonal, unfortunately. Also, her and I have absolutely the different taste in Reese's. 
I prefer the Reese's with more chocolate, less Reese's. For example, I really like the um, thin ones. I really like Reese's pieces. But she prefers the ones that have more peanut butter, less chocolate. I purposely, I, I purposely like the, you know, like the, the thin ones and everything. You should get her the hockey puck Reese's. Are they in Costco? Because I didn't see them at my local kind of store that I went to. I went to three local stores. But they were just small kind of grocery stores, right? Nothing, nothing too crazy. Red means treasure. Oopsies. Ooh! Somebody lives there! No, no reason making a real house here, right? This is just for stealing. This is just for theft. Right, everybody? Oh my god, wait. What is going on here? What am I doing? Ooh. What do we got? Gold coin. Forceful mace. Can be upgraded with torches. Interesting. Hmm. Well, that's fun. Ooh, is that lava right there? Ooh. Let's go, everybody. It's time. The lava calls my name. At night, it calls to me. Thank you, everybody, for all the gifted. I really appreciate it. Thank you for always spoiling this community and letting so many others have the one gift that keeps on giving. The gift of Matara Khan. And remember, by the way, if you did get a gifted that you can join our Discord and you can uh, you can talk to other momos. All right, so I can probably scoop this up. <gasps> Ooh, that looks like a... Hold on, first of all. I want to see what block this is. I don't think I can I don't think I can kill it. I don't think I can kill this block. I don't I don't think this block is killable. Oh. You need a beggar better beggar. You need a better pickaxe. Okay. I'm too weak and frail to mine it. Oh jeez. When you say it like that, Or bombs. I guess I could try a bomb. I don't know if this bomb's gonna be strong enough. Oh! It was strong enough. It was strong enough. Ooh! It's an obsidian. Mmm. Mmm. Nice. Yeah, I want to get in there. I want to see what's what's in there. I want I want to see what's happening there. I want to see. I want to see. I want to see. I want to go. I want to go. I want to go. I love that there's no durability in this game, and you don't have to keep repairing your pickaxe all the time. I love that. Three spammable boomerangs. Ooh, sounds exciting. Oh, I know what this is. This is that stupid ball. Oh, we're back to the ant stuff. Okay, wait a second. The music? Hello? The music just sounded like something straight out of Lord of the Ring. Didn't it? Oh, so this is just... Okay. This is really just, we're back in the ant cave. Hmm. All right, then I'll go down from the mushroom. Oh, shit, that scared me. I'll go back down from the mushroom kingdom and see if maybe I can buy a, build a little house for that NPC. All right, let me, ooh, hmm. 
I need more vines before I go back down there. How do you guys feel about this place for the Mushroom Kingdom? Little mushroom house for a little mushroom NPC? Feels right. It's gonna be a little small, but... Ooh, what's that? Quick depth meter. Plus 4% movement speed. I think I'm speeding okay. Have a good night. Thanks for tuning in, darling. Always appreciate it. Ooh. 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 Where's my where's my crafting table? Oh, did I drop it? Oh, it's because I don't have enough room. Oopsies. Alright, snail, you're going into the garbage. Sorry, snail. All right, where were we? Perfect. We need to make some doors. Mushroom wall. Oh, that looks so cool. Mm. All right, let's keep going. Not the escargot. I'm sorry, my loves. The escargot. He was a spy. I'm sorry that you had to find out this way. He was no good. Ooh. It's the sounds of murder. Sweet, delicious sounds of murder. All right, let's see what we can craft. Mushroom candelabra? Stop. Little mushroom table? Okay. Okay, that workbench, I'm getting rid of it. Uh-uh. Screw that workbench. I want that little mushroom workbench. Mm-hmm. Oh. Cute. Cute, 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 cute. Little mushroom chair. Yes. Oh. Amazing. Show-stopping. Beautiful. One of a kind. Oh. Cute. I am going to change the walls into something not mushroomy so that these stand out even more. I feel like if I do this with the plank wood, it stands out even more. Oh, but I don't have enough. Ooh, that's awkward. Ooh, that's a little bit awkward. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? So can an NPC live here? The room is missing a wall. All right. They're moving in. Where is it missing a wall? Is it here? I'm confused. The room is missing a wall. Where do you guys see that? Oh, all the natural walls? Mmm, I see. Thank you, Zari, for the two months, my dear. I appreciate it. Sucks because the mushroom walls look so cool. But if they're natural and thus not good enough, that sucks a little bit. Sorry, squirrel. You're going at the garbage. Sorry, squirrel. All right. So I would need two people um, that like each other to move in here and upstairs if I make another hut. And then with that, I'll be able to... Um, And with that, I'll be able to um, get a portal, right? All right, everybody. This is where I need. I need your. Um, I need your big brain. Okay. Ignore every single person who's gonna tell you no help and no spoilers. Give me help and give me spoilers, okay? Once I'm out of here, 
you will need to tell me who we're getting. Who we're getting, who we're buying. Do not give me the no helpers, no spoilers. I want none of that. I want helpers and I want spoilers, okay? I want helpers, I want spoilers, okay? I want both. Oh, that door is very cute. Demolitionist would like living here, okay? Hold on, let me show you my other guys so that you can you can find you can see all my other all my other ones. I got a few I got a few of these of these guys, you know. I think this is going to be too small. Then again, I only need two people, right? Did that skeleton drop anything? Let's find out. Money. Basically, right now, for my help and spoiler, I'm trying to make two people move in together that like each other. So instead of me, you know, going on the wiki for 15 years. So these are the people that I currently have. I have these guys. Who kind of likes each other in these two? The guide and truffle. Who's truffle? <laughs> So Bradley, Merchant likes the nurse. So Merchant and Nurse, if I move them here, they would be able to sell me a teleporter. Because I just need, I just need them Okay, hold on. Let me let me finish building this and then you guys will and then you guys will will check the wiki for me, okay, my loves? Let me finish. And then y'all will y'all will check the wiki for me shortly. Okay, I also got to put a little put my little thingy so he doesn't break the door. Okay. Um. All right, we need uh, another hanging lamp. And then uh, another door. Actually, no, he can just live in here, right? As long as I have a chair. I don't really need to min-max it since I probably won't be back here that often. Wait, that's not true. I will be back here often. I have the power. I have the power to be back here at any time. Ma'am, someone's at the door. Let him in. Let me in! Let me in! All right. How are we moving these people in, huh? Die Trader likes desert and painter. Machin like the nurse and the forest. So somebody told me this, but maybe I misread this and it is a lie. Somebody said, I can, I can basically get a teleporter as long as two people who like each other live here. So with that information, which two people could move in here out of the ones I have that like each other. Arms dealer and nurse. Okay. It's three minimum. Oh, I see. You wouldn't put it on the first floor because they can get destroyed. 
That sucks. Because I don't think this is enough room. You don't have enough people yet. Okay. Um, because I don't have enough people yet, so what I'm gonna do... Because of that, then what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna keep building up. I'm gonna keep building up then. And I'm just gonna do a bigger one. Okay. We're gonna make it happen, I'm, I'm telling y'all. We're gonna make it work. Some people are saying two people. We can try it with two people. I think we could we could always try it. Um Please be big enough. Fuck. Can I put the door on top of this? Probably not. Nah. I guess I only need one hole to glide through, right? All right. Okay, that would work then. I could just have... here be a hole that I climb through and it kind of works oh my god I keep placing the wrong block the rooms don't need doors what do you mean the rooms don't need doors the people need doors to live the only person who likes the underground is a demolitionist. It's fine. We'll at least move the demolitionist underground. How about that? We'll at least move Dolgan downstairs. And then basically we're going to wait until I get more people. Because right now, only Dolgan can go downstairs. But if I put more places here, more people can move in. And then maybe tomorrow some other people will move in that like Dolgan or that he likes. Right? We'll get there. It's a slow and steady progress. Someone's got to do it, though. Me. Cool. I'm going to keep my mushrooms, though, because I want to keep my pretty mushrooms. This is... It's not letting me... Put my little... All right, screw it. Um, okay, I'm gonna get rid of this here because somebody did tell me I read that when you said don't put them on the first floor because just in case they get killed, you are correct. It would be very sad if they died. It would indeed be very sad. Cool. So if I make more stuff, more people will move in and then we can kind of start doing the other things slowly but surely. Perfect, perfect. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Can't put a torch because there's a dirt block there? What do you mean? Oh! It looked the same color as the wood. Oh, ow! It looked the same color as the wood. That's why. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I thought I had put a wood block there. That's why I was confused. Alright, perfect. Look at us. Getting through. The architect in you is irritated. Good. That mushroom decor slate. Thanks! Thank you, Froggy. I'm actually going to do a regular decor, to be honest, just because I want to keep all the mushroom things for upstairs. Right? When you're already living in a mushroom world, when you're a little girl in a mushroom world, what's the point of having a mushroom world, right? It's so much more prestigious to have wood from the surface instead. Right? Why? Why would I? Why would we do this? You know? 
So that's why I'm going to bring everything from upstairs. Mm-hmm. I think it's way more prestigious. All right. We need two tables. Bam, bam. Number one. Number dos. I know realistically we won't have four people living here at all times. That's ridiculous, but you know, you never know. I just want more people to move in. I don't care if they hate where they live. I just want them to live here. My veins, I already did it. I already built my thing. We're fine. We're good. I wouldn't worry about it. I wouldn't worry about it. They will never see the sunlight ever again. If they so choose. If they decide they like it here, then yes, they never ever have to see the sunlight ever again. If they decide that they like it here, they never have to see the sunlight ever again. Oh my god, it's so thin, the little... If that is what they want, that is what they want. Alright, um, well, now that my inventory is pretty full, let's maybe make a little treasure chest. Oh! Would you look at that? I just happen to have a gold chest in my inventory that I can just easily put down here and put all my nice things into. Wow. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? I don't want to accidentally drink my potions. I won't accidentally make mistakes. I won't accidentally do a bunch of... Oh, I can actually put the painting in here. Nice. Little painting. Then we're gonna sell all my stuff. How do we feel about the boomerang, by the way? More so than the bow? Or keep both for now? Do 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 do. Do 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 do. You think my architecture is better than yours? I believe that. How do you feel about the boomerang? I like it so far. The problem is like if I accidentally throw the boomerang too far, like right now, I can't, you know. With the arrows, you can just keep shooting the arrows. But with the boomerang, if you shoot it too far, you're like, ah, bye-bye. Oh, fuck. Ooh, I gotta make sure I don't get... Had to make sure I didn't, I didn't fall down. I didn't snap back to reality. You know? Why is there Abigail? Because she's my sister. Who passed away. Didn't you know that? I can't leave her. She's my dead sister. Of course. Yeah, I'm guessing it was one of those... You know how in the Fortnite today... You know in the Fortnite they have Goku? Right? This is basically the same thing. This is basically Goku in the Fortnite. Biz, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome, welcome, everybody. I am exploring Terraria for the first time. I mean, I played yesterday, so I don't know if this is my first. <gasps> Second money portal, let's go. I played yesterday, um, but here I am playing again. So much fun. This is the furthest I've been. I haven't been deeper. I don't know what's deeper. I'm going in. I'm trying everything. I'm making mistakes. Checking my list. Eating it twice. How is your stream today? What kind of stuff are you doing? What kind of stuff are you up to? You should go fishing. We'll get there. One thing at a time, buddy. One thing at a time. One little thing at a time. Oh yeah, you're gonna... Look at him shooting me. Look at this little guy. Look at this cheeky little guy. You like that? You like that? Yeah? You like that? 
You like that? That's what I thought. He liked it, by the way. He told me in, in confidence that he loved it. Yeah, how was your stream today? Did you have a good one? What kind of stuff were you up to? Ugh. Okay, it looked like yellow water for a moment. Eek. Icky. Icky poopy yellow water. I really like this scam because there's a lot of things to do. What? What do you mean by I really like this scam? The game? Ah, actually people were talking about that today, that they're basically doing a little, not a reboot, but a continuation of, uh, of the game. Don't get scabbed. I'm trying. It's tough. Oh, I missed a gem there. And I missed a gem here. <sighs> Missing gems everywhere I go. I can never see those little guys. Or these big guys, apparently, either. I just can never see any guys, it seems. So much money. So much money everywhere. Devs want to make it Terraria too. Mm. This is like the fourth final update. I like that. That means you can tell they really love their game and they love working on it and they love updating it. Right? Versus sometimes you get into games and the devs just completely abandon and, you know. I know everyone's got their reasons, but... What was that person's chat logs? Do y'all get what I mean though? When it's kind of nice that the devs just really like working on this game. I think that's awesome. The devs just can't get enough. They just don't want to stop working on this game. Oh my god. I Everything here is transparent. I can never see it on is that a crowbar gold godly mandible blade almost said goldly because it's gold right so it's easy to say goldly all right i guess let's go from that side hello little bug i got him from the flying bugs from this biome i actually got two but i sold the other one but the other one wasn't godly that's why i sold it all right, where the heck am I going building down? There's water everywhere. It's water everywhere. Yeah. You know, I used to have nine on. I used to have nine legs. But now I only have eight. I lost a life. Only got eight left because I ripped one out and now it's my now it's my sword. Uh, there's water everywhere here. I wonder where I can dig down. Stupid water. Stupid sexy water. You suck at spelling? It's alright. If you become a Twitch streamer, you don't have to worry about spelling explore the desert a little more but i'm going lower and lower right people told me that they wanted me to to dig deep so now as i'm digging deeper i'm trying to basically find a place with not a lot of water so i can dig i want to get rid of the water here to be honest i wonder if the water is just always going to be a problem then because it's always going to keep going Right? Hmm. Water management. This is just like Dwarf Fortress, darn it. Hmm. Let me.
me see where I can go. Because I could easily, like, just put the water on one side. Like, look, see here? No more water. Easy peasy. Now we can walk freely over here. Then maybe dig here? Then there's water there, right? There's- there's a no, I've been there before. Hmm. Yeah, I guess we could do a little... As long as you're able to make air pockets, take the water- take the water down with you. Ah, that makes sense, actually. Like, just keep digging lower and lower and- and kind of go down with the water. Here, I have a great idea. Watch me, everybody. Look at this. Look at this. Ah? Isn't that the craziest idea you've ever seen me come up with? I came up with that by myself. Took me a while, but I'm finally here. I always dig with the water, even though I'm drowning. Help me, I am drowning under the water. Basically, I want to dig next to my new home, right? Because eventually, I will have a teleporter in that home. So I want to dig here so that I could eventually just teleport up and down from it. Alright, let's see what's in the water. Baby, there is a shark in the water. Oh, is that what the elevator is? You've all talked about it today. You've all spoken of it. You may have mentioned it once or twice today, my loves. Soon we will be drowning in money. Once we get to hell and make a pact with the devil? I hope so. Oh, look at the little geckos! They're so cute! Uh, oh, is that a statue? Boomerang statue! Does that do anything? Is it just another lame one? Lame. Lame, lame, lame. Hmm. Okay, this is not looking good for me. I think I have to like... I think I have to break over there to go down. And then once I break that to go down, that looks deep. It's gonna get rid of all this water as well. Oh my god, water management! Water management! Perfect. Is that enough? It's not much. But it's something. It's high noon somewhere in the world. Yeah, I think in the future, I will- I will block off my hole from getting... I will do better. I will do better. With my- with my hole. But for now, I made a rookie mistake and that is okay. And I- for my rookie mistake, I will pay. Oh yeah! I do have a lot of explosives. I made a mistake. Okay. All right. All right. It's happening. It's happening. We're digging. We're going. We're in. Imagine making a rookie mistake as a rookie. I know. It's so embarrassing. Ooh. Ooh, how could I? Mmm.
Those are the metals you need. Every metal is an important metal. I will mine all of these metal. Because they deserve it. Wait. Ugh. Okay. Hearing a little mouse, I think. Maybe it's Satan. I don't know. Platinum in Terraria is a diamond in Minecraft. Ooh. Well, lucky for me, I found a lot of them. I have found a lot of them. No, not the water! Fuck. Ooh. But... There is a bomb. It was worth it. Okay, so here we're back to the ant cave, right? That's why it changes the color. Hmm. Who's the moon lord? The ants equals piss. Ah, oh, thank you, thank you. Naruhodo. I understand now. God, I can't believe I've been playing this game for... Six out. Well, maybe less because we started the stream, right? Ten is the one I told y'all I wasn't going to collect anymore, right? Mm -hmm. I made a promise, I think, to the people. Ooh. Hi! That guy. Knocking me off my stuff. Uh, what is that sound? It sounds like rainbows. Oh, it's the tree. I see, I see. Alright, let's go get that heart. Alright. I feel like I've gotten so many hearts now. 180 health. Ooh. It sounds like rainbows. You know what I mean though, right? When I say it sounds like rainbows, does that make sense to y'all? I think it makes sense. It just has that kind of magical, like, leprechaun, fairy little sound to it. Oh, oopsies. I guess I can hear it. You can more than hear it. You're amazed you didn't think of it sooner. It's true, this fast mining is kind of nice. I'm glad y'all were yelling at me all day to put it on. I get it. I get it. I get it now. Maybe y'all weren't completely wrong. Alright, let's get out of here. Ooh. Welcome to Terraria. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I didn't understand most of what you said except the falling in the lava. Which, oh wait, why didn't I put my rope there? Oopsies. Which, let's be honest, is kind of the quintessential Minecraft slash, I guess, Terraria experience. Before this, I thought only in Minecraft would I fall in lava and unfairness. But no. This game wants me to know that. No, no, no. This game as well. Minecraft isn't the only one. You carried 99 iron buckets. That's so funny. I could see that, you know, when you're younger, thinking, oh yeah, I'm just gonna bucket all the water as a solution instead of just letting it run down. I could see that. Oh, fudge me. Okay, you know what? Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna... 
There we go. All right. Kind of sounds like a ghost, that little... I guess that's a zombie. Genius. Wait, where can I... Wait a second. I got... I, I can click. I got this. Pixel perfect. Yep. P pixel perfect. Yep. Perfect. See? Genius. Oh, this is where it falls. Yep. Fuck! Sorry for my language. Please excuse my swearing. I don't know what came over me. I am usually such a polite young lady who's not young or polite, but here we are. Oh! Oh my goodness. I just discovered the secret to immortality. I just discovered. Wow. I, I did that. Oh! Okay, I also did that by accident. But I was trying to show you that other thing that I did, not by accident. Okay, okay. You guys watching? Okay, okay, okay. Look at that. You put a wood before it falls. Huh? Wait. Okay, I'm just gonna do it. I got this. Perfect. Beautiful. Absolutely gaming. I think I'm just gaming. Space Roach learns how to live even longer. That's me. I'm finding treasure. Previously with the sand, I just did the thing you do in, um, in, sorry, in Minecraft, right? Where you put the torch and it worked. I don't know if it's going to work with silt, but I think that other trick is even easier. I like how the quintessential experience is just me, me showing everybody the cool trick that I learned that you've all learned five years ago or 12 when the game first came out. What's that? I'm like, hey, watch this cool thing I just discovered. It's great. All right. Let's keep digging down, shall we? I think that is the way. Don't downplay your creativity. Thank you. You're right. My creativity in this video game has been revolutionary. The creativity once in every many years comes a woman so creative. Saint Terraria came out 11, 12 years ago, makes me feel ancient. I like how Zero was there to make you feel even older. Um, actually, it's been 13 years. Actually, oh, we we dug a hole. We're going to keep digging. We are dwarves and we are digging this hole. Momos of the stream rejoice. Sing, sing, sing with... Or it was a dig. Dig, dig, dig with me. Kind of running out of my tools. All right. I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. You know what else I think? I don't think we're in... I don't think we're in the mushroom biome anymore. What is this? This does not look like the mushroom biome for me, y'all. Where could we be? Are we in Ohio? Maybe. Does it look like Ohio? Do we have any... 
Any Ohioans? Statistically, it's highly unlikely for anyone to be in Kansas. Meanwhile, the Momo's in Kansas crying. What do you mean? That way I won't bring the other water with me when I dig. Oh, fuck. Sorry for my language. Wait, Ohio Energy? That's a new one. I can't say I've heard that line before. Ohio Energy. This got strong Ohio Energy. The walls is actually a bit clever. <laughs> this is the beauty of playing games as an adult. <laughs> The stuff that, like, you know when you're a kid and you see somebody do this? Somebody's like, you probably looked up those videos where it's like, top 10 ways you can wall off the water so when you dig down, the water won't come. But when you're an adult, you just, you know, you just use your big, sexy adult brain, you know? <laughs> oh, 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 that went deep. That went, that went deep. Right, like, I, when you're an adult, it's just like, yeah, I just did that. I just, I just did, did that, yeah. <laughs> Am I smarter than a 13-year-old gamer? Barely. Barely, barely, barely. Speaking of big, sexy adult brain, go on. Go on. Yes, okay, uh-huh. I am curious how you will um I am curious on how you're gonna you're gonna transition from that. Uh-huh. Extractinator place in silt slush fossil. Oh, I have silt! And I have fossil. Ooh. Alright, you buddy. That looks really useful. Alright, we're gonna start I have to start collecting silt. Okay, so something more useful. How useful are we talking? How useful are we actually talking? You know what else is probably a good thing to do? Dropping random campfires. So that when you're going up, you get the energy regen, right? You get the extra energy regen. regen. Free money? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, then I want that. Some people told me to keep the fossils for, like, weapons and something else, no? Or was that wrong? Were they wrong? And we should shame them for being wrong. Was that over there? I think going up soon might make sense. Just because I want to see who moved in, number one. I want to see who moved in. And um, I want to start doing the extractor on the fossils and stuff. Let me make a little bit more stuff and see what I got. Oh, I can make scarab bombs. Oh, from the fossils. Interesting. All right, let's make the sticky bombs. Do -do 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 -do. Little sticky bombs. Oh, I don't have the regular torch. I don't have the regular torch stuff. That's okay. Web rope. Nice. And then rope rope is just... Okay. Scarab bombs are cool. That's true. You know what else is cool? Staying in school. Oh, wait, where were we? Uh, hold on, I completely missed it. Somebody was saying, speaking of big sexy brain. I, I, I want, I want, I want to know the topic of that conversation. Speaking of big sexy brain, uh-huh. If you typed it and I missed it, you have the floor. My Momo, you have the floor. You failed college twice. 
Thanks for sharing that with us. Tell you what, you haven't failed it three times, right? You haven't failed it three times. At least you got that. At least you have that with yourself. I'm just curious. That's such a good way to, to caveat. Speaking of big sexy brains and then silence. I want to know. I want to know about the sick, big sexy brains. Ooh. Wait, is that a... Okay. Y'all. This is some traps in here. Look at that. There's a detonator. Why the hell is there a detonator? Hi, Miwa. We all have girthy brains here. Girthy old people brains here. I'm gonna blow that bomb up. How did I see that? I'm getting good at the game. I'm starting to see. I'm starting to sniff danger. Oh, actually, wait, I didn't need to put the rope there. I'm gonna try shooting my arrow at it. Or my boomerang. Oh, it doesn't work like that at all. Thank you, Shaddy. I appreciate it, darling. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Jump onto it, smiley face. I don't have so much money. Actually, I don't have... Well, I do have a little bit of money. right click on it the problem is all right i believe that a tactical retreat is the best solution if you hold an axe you will see the wires Break the blocks under it. You can break it with a pickaxe, but like then it like turns into a click. Oh, you mean the dart trap. I feel like, look. I'm not that close to the dynamite there, right? It looks safe. Huh. All right. Okay. Now. Okay. Well, I clearly don't know how dynamites work. And we got a ton of iron. Yay! Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. Oh, that little zombie has a little hat. I'm guessing he probably drops the little hat if you're lucky. Cute. All right, everybody. I have learned today how demolition works. I am a demolitions expert after tonight. I have learned 
how demolitions work. I am an expert. Two gold from one slime. One life to live. Two gold, one slime. Pinky drop some pink slime. Yeah, I have a little bit more up. Oh, wait, I'm full in my inventory. I think it's time to go home soon, y'all. I think it's time to go home soon. Time to go to casa. But first, when I took my break, I forgot to pee. <gasps> I forgot to pee! I'm sorry. I've been hydrating. I need to pee.
Hello? I spilled my water. To the surprise of nobody. I'm back! What did I miss? Also, hi, Joel. Hello, hello, hello. Joel, I forget. Have you played this before? Am I the only... Oh, right. I think you have played this before. Because you are a youth. And the youth have all played this. The youth have all played this. Oh, never mind. You're not like other youths. You are... different. You are different than the other youths. Oh, the sci-fi one, uh, Starbound? A lot of folks I know said they preferred this game to Starbound at the beginning. To start off with. Agree? Disagree? Let's talk about it. I have to go back to the surface soon, you guys. A, my inventory's full. And I have another chest filled with inventory. B, I'm almost out of useful items. I need to farm gel and stuff for torches. Matara, I like cheese. You and I both, baby. What's your favorite type of cheese? You hate Twitch chats? I'm sorry that you are named after Joel the fish. It's like saying you hate Beyonce just because, you know, you just happen to also be named Beyonce when she's so iconic and beautiful and wonderful. You just should have gotten a better name. Have you considered just not being named after somebody so iconic? Bone sword? 19 melee damage, 4% critical. 18 melee damage, 9% critical. The fact that I got that godly mandible, what felt like pretty early, seems pretty OP. Not the evil Joel. <gasps> He's evil. Oh, oopsies. I was... Okay, nobody saw that. Okay, that's fine. Nobody saw me taking ridiculous amounts of damage. Right? We're fine, right? Nobody saw that? You've never played Terraria because it's confusing. Hmm, I see. I see. You think this little children, baby little game is confusing, huh? Interesting. Interesting. Very, very interesting indeed. You're saying this little baby game confuses your fragile, fragile mind. Ooh, there's a golden chest, but I don't have any more room. Alright, I'm gonna dig down there so I know how to find it. Guys, I don't even know what to get rid of anymore. I hate Matara from Vishojo. SMH Matara from Vishojo. SMH. Matara from Vishojo. I don't know. Every time I've seen a chest in the wild, it's been a trap. What if it's another trap? It's always a trap. It's always a trap. It's always, always, always a trap. It's gotta be a trap. It's gotta be a trap, y'all. Shoot it, it might be a mimic. Ooh. It's not a mimic, but I'll know that in the future. All right. I don't see any traps. Oh my god. There's no traps. Gaze into the mirror to return home. Wait a second. Is this a forever teleporter? Or no? 
It's a forever teleport back home for free. Wow. What else have I gotten that's pretty lucky? I've gotten the allows the collection of vine rope, which is good, but, you know, ropes is also great. Um, slowly regenerate life. Uh, cloud in a bottle. The bunny ears I bought. Increases mining speed by 25%. I got the fleeting ancient chisel. And I got the magic mirror, so where do I put it? Oh, I can only put it in one of these slots, huh? Wait, where do I... Oh, no, I just have to equip it. You don't need the detonator? Perfect. Get out of here. Oh, shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Sorry. Wait, is it a forever item or does it expire? Is the next question. That's very important. It's a forever item that uses MP. Oh, amazing. My god, now we're really cooking with portals. Alright, I'm gonna get rid of these flowers. I don't think I really need them. Alright. I gaze into the mirror. Lucky! My god. That is pretty lucky. What can I say? Why do these not combine? Oh, there we go. 28 gold coins. Yay! All right. I have a lot of statues that I don't know what to do with at the moment. So, I will put them up here because I don't know what to do with them, okay? Don't know what to do with this statue. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, the inventory management is going to be kind of annoying on all of this. I know. I know. There we go. Did you see that? Did you see the juke? I did that. Did you see that? I did that. <laughs> I did that. The problem now, though, is that... All the stuff that goes into this machine, I left it I left it down in the other mine. I left it in the other cave. Left it in the other cave. Alright, let's see what we got here. Sort? Um, we got a lot of stuff. I think I need a whole chest just for potions, to be honest. Extractor work a little bit weird. How so? How so? Talk to me about how it worked. Gotta hold click for a while. But the problem is, I think I left all my items downstairs anyway. So I, I don't even have the items that I would need right now to make it work. I don't even have those items on me. Ruby gem lock. Okay. Sorry, we gotta capture the animals. You just need silt. I have a ton of silt, but I have it downstairs. Like, I left it in another place. It's in my other... It's in my other place to live, unfortunately. Alright, so we're gonna put all the potions here, I think. And all the, like, kind of rare-looking items, like Amethyst Gem Corn... From what I'm guessing for the gem corn, is that what makes the gem trees grow? Oh, I'm so silly. But I'm guessing you can only build them either underground or maybe not. Maybe not just underground. Underground on stone. There we go. So. I will. Okay. Can I sell the bone sword? Is everybody okay with that since I have a better sword? And can I sell the mace since I have a better... Oh, I love the mace upstairs. That little mirror thing is really important. Well, it's a good thing I got it. It's a good thing I unlocked it. It's a rare sword. I have a chest for weapons, just store them. Yeah, maybe you're right. Maybe I could just store my weapons. Like, no need to, no need to get rid of them, right? Okay. 
platinum candle. That looks cute. All right, let's make our... Where were we? All right, so maybe that's what I should do. I should have like a... Um, I should have uh, hmm, different uh, different things for different stuff. Right, everybody? That makes sense. Different things for different stuff. You know what I mean. When I say I should have different things for different stuff, you know exactly what I mean. You get it. You instantly get it when I say that. You're like, oh yeah, Matara, I get you. You get it immediately. I don't know if the gem should be going there, but whatever. I just like separating the gems from my downstairs inventory. I feel like that makes sense. Uh, I guess seeds can go for the cooked food for now, just so I don't, uh, I don't really lose it. The lamp is going to get hung. Right? Like, I just gotta hang the lamp for now anywhere. Doesn't matter. Hook. And then the mandible. Hmm. We're gonna want a lot of storage. Apparently, huh? Oh, I have 21 silt block. Okay. The rest of my silt stuff is downstairs. Oh. Okay. We're going down to get the rest of that silt. Silt. It is basically... Gamba. It is basically Gamba. Also, don't worry about the squirrels. We will cook them. This is why I'm capturing the squirrels. Because we will cook them. And we will eat them. Wow. We're going back to get all that silt, y'all. Nice. All right, for now, I am going to put all my potions and some of this equipment together. I will take the equipment out later. It's just right now, I want to kind of put it in a place. I don't think I need to keep copper or tin ore. So what is the ore that I don't mind? I don't mind tin and I don't mind copper, correct? But I mind the other stuff. Just not tin, not copper. I kind of don't care about it. Right. Okay, perfect. Thank you, everybody. All right. We're, we're kind of starting to get a little home. We're kind of starting to get little things over here. Things are happening. Things are growing. Things are developing. Can I leave the pink... I guess I'll keep the pink slime on me. Oh. <gasps> Edging Master Raid. My ultimate edging master. Project Melody. Hello. How is your stream? How are you? Baby. I can't wait to come visit you and hang out. And we can party. We can party and have a good time. We haven't actually finalized deciding if I'm going to visit you or we're going to take a trip together to another city. Mel, I am so inspired by your Warhammer streams. And so are other people. I'm having so many people come in and tell me about how you're painting and building and doing so much stuff. I love you. You're doing amazing. And I miss you. And I'm sorry that we haven't properly caught up. Mel's been DMing me a lot to talk. And I'm always like, Mel, I'm so sorry. I'm so busy. We'll talk in a bit. Thank you for the rain. Welcome, everybody, coming in from Project Melodies. Hi, I'm Matara Kana Vishojo, double D's, triple threat. <laughs> and tonight I'm playing Terraria. Mel, I think you'd really enjoy this game. And tonight I'm playing Terraria. I'm having lots of fun with it. We're exploring, we're doing some things, we're, we're getting some stuff done. It's fun. It's been really, really nice and fun. We played with dolls. I saw that. I'm glad you had a good stream, Mel. Makes me happy. Okay, everybody. I need your help. We're going to go to the desert. And you're going to tell me who is unhappy there. So right now in the desert, we have... He's happy here. 
And then those two are happy here as well, correct? Because this is... Painter. Are you happy? Are they all happy together? Mr. Painter? Painter? Oh, we have room for one more person to live here. So who else could live here? We have Zane the, Zool Zane the Zoologist. Jane the Zoologist. Man, if only I could do names right. Golfer prefers the normal biome. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to send Golfer to the forest. Who else? Don't move anybody else in here. Okay. But right now they're living underground. Which they might hate even more. What if they hate the underground even more? You should find the arms dealer. I think as I keep growing more stuff, they'll just keep... Alright. So I guess I will have to make another building nearby. But yeah, everybody, welcome Science Squad. Did you have a fun time with Mel today? Tell me a little bit about her stream. I completely understand Mel, by the way, if you have to go. I get it. I get it. After streams, I'm like, alright guys, I gotta go. She beat you? Hey, that sounds fun. That sounds seductive. That sounds fun. You gotta pay a lot of money for that. Made a blurple. She made a blue purple orc. You know, I've never seen a purple orc, so. So nurse can live in the desert, right? I can move the nurse away from the forest, correct? And it feels like everybody probably likes the nurse. And then we'll put the golfer back in the We'll put the golfer back in the in the forest. She ate her food into the microphone. I'm so proud. I'm so proud of that, baby. I'm so proud of that. Hell yeah. Eat your food into the microphone. It's what they deserve. It's the it's the forbidden ASMR. It is the forbidden ASMR. I thought you all loved Mel no matter what. Through thick and thin. Till dead do we die. You know? Apparently, you all love Mel and then all oh, you hear a little bit of And suddenly, oh, I don't know, it sounds, food sounds, you know? Stop. <laughs> Sorry. Are you saying you encourage her beating us? Yes, absolutely. Beatings are fantastic for morale improvement. The beatings will continue until your morale improves. You know what you don't do well enough, Science Squad? Have a high enough morale. She will continue beating you until you are happy. All right? Some of you will learn to derive pleasure from the beatings. Some of you will start looking forward to her beatings. All right? Some of you will learn many things about yourselves. It is sacred time with Project Melody and the Science Squad. Remember that. Also, Mel, I think you'd really like this game got a lot of stuff it keeps you engaged it's you know it's like minecraft but i'd say almost simpler it almost feels simpler genuinely all right let's go back down to where my mushroom biome was and see if we can move anybody into the mushroom mushroom biome oh, what a what a peculiar place for this cactus to grow, huh? Okay, Dwarf Fortress is awesome. Wait, where did I... Where was my... 
Was it back in my original base? I think it was. Let's teleport back. Oh, and the nurse is moving. All right. So now that the nurse moved, can I move the golfer back here? Is he going to have fun living here with these guys? So it's going to be Edwin the Merchant. I need somebody to open the wiki. Edwin the Merchant. Mr. Golfer. Bradley the Guide. Arnie Palman the Golfer. Wait, the golfer doesn't like it here because it's too open. It's the forest, right? And then y'all said the Jane, the sister, also can live here. I think. Sorry, I'm capturing all these bunnies to cook them later. The fact that you need a wiki proves is complicated. It's not complicated. It's just we are on a cruise. We are. We are. Ooh, doo -doo. 80 iron bars. Let's see what we can make. Let's see what we can make now that we got now that we got all this fancy stuff with us. Alright. I have tin helmet, two defense, chainmail, five defense, tungsten, and then wood greaves. For capture the gem, it drops when you die. Interesting. Amethyst hook equipable. That sounds good, right? I feel like I have so many items in my inventory. I might have to use Abida's hook when I'm... How do I... You become Spider-Man with a hook? Use it with R? It's not... Oh, it's an equipable. Ah. Wait, what? Why am I... E? Ah, thank you. And then how do I unequip it? Oh, nice. Okay, okay. That was a little confusing. That was a little confusing, but we got the spirit. We got the spirit. We got the spirit. I, I eventually caught on to what I had to do. Took me a while. All right, let's get tungsten everything then, shall we? Do I have enough? I have 51 tungsten. All right, let's get tungsten greaves. And then let's get tungsten helmet. All right. I now have three tungsten items. Talk to me. Talk to me, everybody. Am I beautiful? I should have real good defense now. I should be absolutely defended. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, Mata. Gorgeous. I'm going to buy a few ropes. Perfect. I can do whatever a spider can. It's true. Spider con. Spider con. Does whatever a spider does. Oh, see? This is why... He's too low for my boomerang to hit him. You get a bonus if you wear the whole armor set. Isn't that just three items? Or is the sword in the arm? No, you said armor. You didn't say weapon. You did very distinctly say armor. Yeah, you got the spirit, Joel. You got the spirit. First boss fight incoming. Soon, I hope. Soon, TM. Come here, rabbit. I'm gonna cook you. I'm gonna get cooked. I'm gonna get cooked, little man. Do I have 200 HP? I have 180. Ooh, a lemon. Yummy. Momo, we gotta cook. I can't believe I got a free recall. That's so awesome. I feel a little, I feel a little spoiled. I feel a little happy. Free recall just for me. 
All right, let's plant these acorns and then get the heck out, okay? All right, planted some acorns. We're getting the heck out. Uh, let's buy a little bit more rope from him. Just because I don't have that much. And if I'm going down in an earlier round, Mir can evolve. Ooh. Can't wait to see that. I'll get there. The first boss won't come until you have 200 HP. Is there a way to craft hearts or no? Does she have a piggy bank? That I do. That I do, my friend. I have 28 gold, 53 silver, 63 copper. Do you think that's enough? A lot of rope. It's all to tie you up, sweet Momo. You've been misbehaving. You've been misbehaving. Mm. You've been misbehaving, my sweet. All right. Um, let's go into the darkness. All right. Well, now that I did the rope, I'm just going to... gonna do this instead now that i understand the moment i understood the weakness of the rope you should carry the piggy bank with you for extra storage i'll start doing that after i think for now it's fine it's fine while i'm kind of still learning and getting the hang of things i feel like it's probably safer for me right now to go back to my base sometimes anyway while i'm still while i'm still oh, stop while I'm still learning. Okay, I have got to stop this. This is not where I was placing it. I was placing it here. There we go. All right. Hmm. Okay, I see where my little guy is living. Do you guys see him on the right? So then I go down here, and then I continue my elevator further down where he is. Right? Yeah, that's what I had done. I continued my elevator further. Okay. Is there anybody who wants to live with him that doesn't hate him? Is the real question. Is there anybody who wants to live with him who doesn't hate him? Because he's all alone. He hasn't spawned yet. Damn it. Everybody hates him. He's just doing his best. He's just doing his best. He's just living. He's just surviving. He's just surviving. Oh my god, those were actual Minecraft sounds right there. Those were legitimate Minecraft sounds. Ooh. There's a lot of people who feel neutral about him. I think we needed people who aren't neutral with him though, right? So that we can get the little bonus. Uh, quip depth meter and arcane compass. I could I could get rid of those, right? I don't think I really need need them. Wait, what? Store but do not sell. Fine. 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 I'll make another chest. I just want to sell my things. 
Oh my god, there's so much stuff. I can't find the chest. Where is it? Huh? Am I... I don't see it. I need an iron bar. We can't see the chest either. The mace hits super fast. I'm going to try with it. But I really, really like my godly, godly mandible sword as well. Ooh. And I can make it a fire mate. Ooh, wait, what? Oh, okay. Ah. My god. Look at the... Whoa. Mangaka, thank you for the turn. Oh my god. Look, look how big my mace is. Jeez. Jeez, it's it's kind of big. It's kind of big. I feel like this is actually really good for keeping enemies at bay. I might have to keep it. I might have to keep it. That does look really, really nice. Then do it fire damage. It depends who I'm fighting against, right? Thank you, Mangaka. I think it might be a gift sub. Not quite sure. But I think it might be a gift sub. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, my love. I really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's a gift sub. All right, everybody. Are we upgrading it? Are we upgrading our thing? It's a gift sub. Are we doing it? Oh, I was... Ah, you beat me to it. You beat me to it. I was going to ban them. It's a gift sub. Thank you for the gift sub. I think it might be a gift sub. I think I have a sneaking suspicion there might be a gift sub. It's a gift sub. Oh, I needed an iron bar. I see. It's a gift sub. These iron bars can hold my soul in my story hole. I see is you. And I'm terrified of these four walls. Iron bars can hold my soul in. All I scream for you. Come, please. I'm calling. I'm calling. Show me what it's like. Then teach me wrong from right. And say it to me, say it for me. I'll leave this life behind. Say it if it's worth saving me. Ah, ma, 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 ma. As you all know, I am a slight fan of the Nick Nickelback. What a beautiful voice. Thank you. Thank you. Say it for me, say it to me. I'll leave this life behind me. Say it if it's worth saving me. Okay. Quickly, though. Amethyst goes here. Sorry, I'm getting confused in my own chest. Sapphire? It's hard to tell what's a gel and what's a... Okay, are you ready for the gotcha, everybody? Are you ready for the big gotcha? Wait, hold on. I gotta open my inventory while I do this. A diamond? Oh, get out of here. Where is it? Hold the button. What do you think I'm doing? Baby. What are you going to tell me next? Press space to jump? Come on, baby. Come on, baby. I'm a gamer. 
Come on. Darling. Darling, come on. Darling, you know about my gaming. One whole gold bar. One small step for Matara Khan, one giant gold bar for mankind. Wow. I really did that. I really went there. We really did that, everybody. We did it. Huge. You've played Terraria for years and you've never used that machine. It's all right. But I completely get that. When you've played a game so much and then you watch a stream and you go, wait a second, you can do that? Oh, I, I get that feeling 100%. I have been there. This is why I like watching people play um, stuff like RimWorld. And then I see things and I go, wait a second. I could do that? What? And I just never knew. I never knew that everything was falling through. That everyone I knew was waiting on a clue to turn and run. When all I needed was the truth. But you know, that's how it's gotta be. You know, right? The RimWorld expansion, expansion just came out, no? Or maybe I mistook it for a mod. All right, everybody. You know what time it is? You know what time it is. It's time to go underground. You can keep the gel in ammo slot for quick use. Um... Oh, I don't need to keep the gel in uh, in the main inventory? Thanks. All right, let's try our new sword. Ooh, looks fancy. Let's keep digging. Are y'all ready? I'm back to doing the little elevator thing y'all y'all were telling me about. Only elevators here. This is an elevator only stream. Just gonna get rid of this little water. Wow, 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 wow. If you remove the platforms, you can fall faster. Ah, uh, yeah, but that's gonna take me a little bit of time because I accidentally put those platforms here before... before I realized I could do the rope. Ooh, we got a little bit of gotcha. We got a little bit of silt. Don't mind if I do. All right. Keep going, keep digging. I know I had previously made another another place there with a little elevator, but I want an elevator from my base straight to the bottom. Straight to the bottom. Slush works at gotcha. I know, baby. That's why I'm collecting it. I know, darling. I know. We were just doing gotcha. We just got a diamond for it. All right, keep going. Keep going, never stop. Always keep digging. Fossils too. Yeah, I got a bunch of those too. But then some people told me to make armor out of it, so I don't know which one's better. I don't know which one's better, which one we're gonna do. Oh, he's coming down. I see him. It's fine. It's fine. We'll be fine. We survive. We take these. We survive these. Thank you, Astria. Thank you so, so much for the three months, my dear. You did, Masalar. 
I've yet to find out why we call it that, but I'm guessing is because it's gonna go straight to hell. I'm on a highway to hell, as the children say. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, is that an evil bunny? What? Sapphire bunny. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do a little evil bunny. That means there's an NPC nearby. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Keep, keep talking. I'm listening. I'm listening. Where would he be? And what kind of bunnies does he sell? We do have a little home here. We do have this little home. There's only one guy living in it, unfortunately, because nobody else likes him. Nobody else wants to live with the demolitioner. Nobody else wants to live with him. He's just a little guy. He's just a little guy, but they don't want to live with him. Oh, I see veins. I don't know if my aim is good enough for that, to be honest with you. But I would be curious about spells and magic. I usually like those in games. Да, я знаю, можно назначить, кто там будет жить, но никто его не любит. Я хочу найти человека, кто будет его любить. Или хотя бы, хотя бы... Oh, slimes are falling from the sky. Should I go back upstairs and farm the slimes? So that I can have a lot of gel? I want to see this event. First boss? Oh, I didn't build... I didn't build anything for the first boss yet. Uh-oh. I didn't build the... I know everybody told me I'm supposed to build a little thingy. Oh, oopsies. Okay. Also, I don't have any food on me. You'll be fine. I don't have any of my food. It's easy. All right. How do I know where he is? I just kill slimes? Okay. How come this didn't happen last playthrough? Like yesterday when I was playing. It spawns after killing 100 slimes on slime day. That wasn't happening yesterday though when I was playing. Oh, it's a random event. I see, I see. Is the snowstorm a regular thing or is it just a sandstorm? Or am I just unlucky? That one has a little bomb in him. So I just got event on event on event on event on event. I see. All right, I'm going to go back to forest because I have... Oh, no. Oh, my God. All right, I'm going to teleport, I think, back to forest. I think it's going to be a little easier than whatever I'm trying to do here. All right, let's go to the side so that... Y'all kind of scared me that he can kill my NPCs. And I'm excited, Mr. Slime Man. I want to see if my cozy fire is still going to hit me. All right, let's see everything I've learned. Let me move my kombucha. Let's see if I've learned enough to destroy Mr. Slime Man. You know what I can do while my ghost is fighting the slimes? I can build... I can build my, um... I can actually build. Wait, I can't build it because of the trees. I can't build it because of the trees. I guess 
supposed to have double jump. Right? Oh my god. <laughs> I can't build it because of the trees. Lol. Thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate it, darling. I guess I'm a little too far for the fire, but I can put a fire next to where I'm going to be fighting. All right, let's put a fire here. My God, look at this beautiful, 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 beautiful. Isn't it beautiful? Isn't it beautiful? Beautiful. This is now my fighting arena. Truly. Still? Still haven't killed a hundred? Come on, you guys. I feel like I feel like I've killed a hundred. I hope the, the event doesn't end at the end of this day, because, uh... Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's beautiful. This is my masterpiece. Uh-oh. Is it time? It was saying, Chad, it did say I killed the 100 blue slime. Total. I feel like if you combine all the slimes I've killed today, it's got to be a hundred. All right, you guys. Oh, King Slime, he's here. Here comes Johnny. Oh, I do have Abigail. Okay, maybe this is... Is this doing a lot of damage? I missed it. Nah. I'll just keep... Okay, wait. Get out of here. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just noticed my health. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 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 wait. Whoa, 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 wait, wait. Fuck me. I wasn't looking. I was looking at him. I wasn't looking at my health. You all said this was going to be easy. You all lied to me. You all said this was going to be easy. What the fuck? You all said it was going to be easy. You all were like, Batara, you're going to do it. You're so fun. You're so good at this game. Batara, you all were telling me, Vatar. All right. I gotta be honest. I didn't notice um the. I didn't notice how much health he had. I also don't have any potions. But from what I gathered from him jumping... Sorry, I was, like, not even paying attention to him. I really assumed I could tank his whole damage. Okay, we're gonna do it again. I'm gonna go back home. I'm gonna take my potions. It's H for potions, right? And then I'm gonna make that little arena and just always keep him at bay. And, uh, just do my stuff. Was that embarrassing? No. No. I did that on purpose. So H, right? For healing. These guys kind of stay, right? Or are they going to despawn? Because if they stay, I'm just going to build my arena. While, um... You think it's one King Slime per event? 
So I have to wait for another event? You all underprepared me. You all underprepared me for this. You all deceived and misled me. I honestly didn't even look at his health. That's the worst part. I wonder if I can put the little slime banners. I don't know if the slime banners will affect the big boss, though. I don't know how the banners work. From what I gather is you do more damage against the enemy, but is it only against that enemy or against the bosses, too? Oh my god, wait. I can't aim. <gasps> I forgot to resummon Abigail since I died. I was wondering where she was. Ah, it's only against the specific enemy. Ah, oh, then it's like, all right. All right, I'm going to start building this while Abigail takes care of them. I'm going to just start building my little platforms, okay, everybody? So that I can fight better. I could be a better gamer. I could be a better fighter. I will never stop fighting. I will never stop gaming. be a lot easier range. I have a boomerang. So I feel like that should be all right. It does a lot of damage. Then again, I do have a good bow. Hmm. Right? This is enough of a jump, right? Yeah. Don't worry about me. Just mining. Make fire arrows. I have fire arrows. Would a bow? I have a dark wood bow with, uh, with fire arrows. Would y'all prefer that over, over my boomerang? But my boomerang's fun. My boomerang is fun. I'm wearing, um, the five defense armor. I forget the name of it. Fire arrow and running around. Well, I will introduce you to... I'll introduce you to... Boomerang and running around. Almost like the other thing. Actually, ice arrows. Get ice arrows. You just need to find ice. <laughs> it's really easy. No, Matara, you just need to build the nether portal. It's so easy. You just need all of these ingredients that you don't have. It's really easy, Matara. Anyone can do it. You just need all of these items that you do not currently have and have no idea where to go get and frankly don't have the time or the desire to go get, but you should really go get them before this boss fight that potentially could happen again. Trust me, Matara. I love this game. Trust me, Matara. You really should. I think that would be a great idea. I think that is what you should do, my dear Matara. You should play how I want you to play, my dear. Ah, 
not. We'll be fine. I'll get the ice arrows when I get the ice arrows. Um, I guess I could go make like a stronger bow. Because I do have a dark wood bow, but I can make the iron, iron and tungsten and whatever they're called. I guess. Okay, this is almost... This is almost straight. Right? This is almost. I agree. I think we should use hacks. Spawn the most powerful weapon. Let me equip it. For the giggles. For the giggles of it all, I say we should let me have the most broken. We should spawn a Mjolnir from Ragnarok Online. I think I have to double jump for that one. Longy, it's my first time. Oh my god, I didn't even see the stupid slime there. I know this is a big jump, but I got double jump now, so I should have still made it a shorter jump, huh? I'll make it a shorter jump. Ugh. Now I'm gonna have to wait for another event. Sad. Who was here the time that Matara failed at killing the slime? Who was here at that fun time? You could summon him with an item. With a ruby, right? I saw somebody, right? Maybe I'll change bows then and then we'll summon him. Maybe I'll make these... Maybe I'll make these things a little bit higher first. Maybe I'll put Tiki Torches down. He needs a Platinum Crown. Ooh. Can I just wait for another day? Can I just wait for another rare day? Alright. Alright. One more? Or is this good enough for now? All right, let's see what I got in my inventory. If I can maybe summon him. Let's see what we got. I have 25 platinum. Is that what you guys said for the crown? Or was it something else that I mid that I have uh, misheard? And a ruby. Oh, it's not letting me... Oh, do I have maximum mana? Whoopsies. You made so much progress. I started... Well, I, I played a little bit yesterday, and then we're playing today just... Uh, I got very lucky. I got two gold portals, so... I didn't even really have to farm or anything. It just all came to me in a dream. It all came to me in a dream so wonderfully. I do have to say, getting so much gel, amazing. Lucky? It's not luck, baby. It's skill. Remember that. Remember that. All right, let me see if I have a ruby. I have a ruby. All right, let's see if we can make the crown. Let's see if we can make the crown. So a platinum crown. Maybe that's not here that I make it. You might need an altar. All right, platinum crown, but I don't know if it's going to automatically put the ruby in. It has to be at an altar. Hmm, I see. Need dimmon crimson altar. Ah, well, unfortunately, we cannot make the thing. 
It is sad. But we may not make the thing. Let's go back to our scheduled programming, all right? Go back to our scheduled programming, my loves. Boss, unkilled. Viewers, unsatisfied. I guess I'll keep the potion on me. Do I like monster boys? Maybe. Depends who's asking. Depends who's asking. You know? Alright, let's see if we can make a... Uh... Yeah, so I guess I have to have all my items in my inventory. To... I'm guessing platinum is stronger than... I guess we can see the bow. To, to judge. 10 ranged... 4% critical strike chance. Uh, would this really be better than the boomerang? I guess y'all did say that the bow is from further away. So I can just always kind of be further away than the shroomerang. With the fire arrows. Oh, it's 17. I see. I'll keep the shroomerang for now, but I'll, I'm definitely going to keep the bow for future... definitely going to uh to do that wait oh no 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 wait uh, what i thought i was putting my money in the piggy bank i didn't realize i was putting my money in the garbage uh... It's fine. It was only like 20 gold, right? Not 20, 20 silver, right? It wasn't that much money. It was honestly pennies to the dollar. I threw that money out to prove to it that I didn't need it. It was very little money. I'm I'm too rich anyway. Honestly, I'm so rich. It's it's kind of embarrassing. It's embarrassing y'all think 20 silver is a real amount of money actually embarrassing that's that's the real sadness of it all thank you chief i appreciate it darling thank you thank you thank you i appreciate that bunny tail don't mind if i do little bunny tail i'm very cute all right who's living at my house so far not that many people What's the current project? We are doing an elevator back to the ground. It's just, um... It's just, um... I got interrupted by slimes. And then my computer lagged and I died to the slime boss. It was really embarrassing and really bad. I'm really upset about the computer lagging like that. Not very cool. Thank you again, Chief, for the bits. I appreciate that. Right, we're gonna we're gonna put this water on the side so that we don't have to deal with it. Perfect. It's so unfair how it works that way, huh? The lag was really unfortunate. It really was. Are right, we talking about D and D? Yes. This is basically a D and D expansion called Terraria. It's great. Lots of, lots of crazy things happening here. I think you'd love it. I froze for like three, but I really did though, because I, I wasn't even paying attention to my health. I'm like, la, 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 la. You know what it was? It's because previously I was fighting all those slimes and they were doing one damage. And then all of you were saying, Matara, he's easy. You're a gamer goddess. So I was like, oh, my Momos wouldn't deceive me. I'm a gamer goddess. He's easy. It does start with me. You can't spell happiness without Matara Khan. I agree. Nobody said the later part. But you were thinking it. You know. Let's be honest with one another. You were thinking it. 
You were... You were thinking it. Right? You were thinking it. So... You know. Did I die from King Slime? Yeah, I got lag. I got lag. My internet, like sometimes in the middle of the night, my internet's not so good. Sometimes, sometimes when it's the nighttime, you know, it lags a little bit. How is there water here again? Digging the same stupid. Why? My God, he scared me. Him falling down like that on me. Jeez. Down, 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 down. The music in this part of the game feels very, um... What's the word? Like, it's taunting you. It's like... Ow, 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 ow. Feel very taunted by it. A little bit. Y'all hear it? My cousins are being jerks? Then go fight Zen's cousins if mine are being jerks. <laughs> go fight Zen's cousins. See if that's better. Apparently they're going to be adding a third faction soon. I'm excited to see. I'm excited to see what it's going to look like. Oh, oopsies. There we go. Let's continue. Am I at hell yet? Are we there yet? Bow, wow, wow, wow. Am I on fire? Yes. If you're asking me if I'm hot, very. Oh, oh, oh. I see a little silhouette of a man. Man, I'm not even remotely down where I was on the other map. Ow, 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 ow. Is this my gotcha? Oh, there it is, my little gotcha. Ow, wow, wow, wow. More gotcha. Hold on, everybody. I just threw away 20 silver. I need this gotcha. Ooh. And this platinum, apparently. Oh, wait. Ah, what did I just do? Accidentally found a little... A little thing. Ow, wow, wow, wow. Suffocated a bit. It's okay. A little bit is fine. A little bit is okay. A little bit of suffocation. It's like a spice, you know? It's like adding just the right amount of, of, of condiments to your, to your burger. Oh, look at all this gotcha. All of this gotcha. I know I should be digging down, but I cannot wait to go back and spend this, all of it. Perfect. You want a bees burger? I haven't had a bees burger in a long time. I haven't had a bees burger in a long time, I love. It's been a while. Why am I not using this marker, sir? Hi, here. Are you happy? Are you happy? Does this spark joy? Is this what you wanted? Here, I'm using it. I'm using it. It's because I feel when I'm digging down, it, it like, it goes everywhere. That's why I wasn't using it. Because when you're digging down, it just kind of goes all over the place. You know? 
But then I saw the de the the gems, and I thought they were truly outrageous. And here I am digging for them. All right, let's go. I am aware that I am doing a parallel elevator base, even though I had just done one elsewhere. But it's okay. Time is honey, and we got lots of it. It's only. Oh my god, it's 1 a.m. I spark joy. <laughs> Thank you, my love. Thank you, my love. I like that you can build a rope above yourself and then catch that rope. I like that logic. Thank you, heck. It's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of fun, and uh, I've been really enjoying it the whole way through. And we're gonna be doing a lot more of that kind of stuff. Welcome, I. Ah, uh, oh. Ow, me, ow, me, ba, 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 da. If you make a rope bundle, you can throw it. My god. These ropes. Now the music sounds a little robotic. Alright. Look how on the right on my map, you see, like, I had already dug it down, but it wasn't coming from my base, so it doesn't count. Doesn't count. It was, it was, it was fake. This is the real one. This is the real one. Oh. You little shithead. Look at him. Yeah, you're right. Maybe I should be just sticky bombing it. Wait, can I scare a bomb it? Scare a bomb is just going to make one long hallway, or does it only work horizontally? What do y'all think? Scare a bomb should work for it. works vertically. <laughs> Careful is my middle name. It's Matara Careful Khan. Didn't you know? Didn't you know? Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, this is exciting. All right, well, first order of business. Let's uh, not bring the water in. The water is evil. Yeah, this is so exciting, y'all. Okay. Let's place bets. Will I blow myself up? Oh my god, I can't make a scare bomb here. I'm missing something. Be careful. You like how every game has the same air bubbles? I mean, if it's not broken, Joel, don't fix it. Oh, I can't make it. No! I know I had something before to make it. I guess I could just go up. <laughs> I guess I could just, you know. was sand, huh? Are my other scare bombs on the other place? All right. Whoever said it was bombs and sand? Bruce, thank you for the raid. Thank you for the raid. I really, really appreciate it. I actually was lurking the other day. I remember I followed you after you were playing with Giga. And I remember seeing you the other day and I was like, oh, I haven't actually seen his channel in a while. How the heck have you been? Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome Raiders, hello. I am Matara Khan of the Shoujo. Yes, same company as Giga. And uh, I am playing Terraria. I'm discovering Terraria. I am a noob at Terraria. 
I played a little bit yesterday, but this is all brand new, fresh, discovering, learning, doing. I'm having a lot of fun with it. And I'm currently digging an elevator all the way down to hell. If any of that sounds interesting, if you want to hang out with us, please do. I tend to stream pretty long hours. Uh, also, by the end of this month, I am hoping to, okay, into the next month, finishing Warhammer Mechanicus, uh, finishing Vampire the Masquerade, starting Bolt Gun, and of course, this summer, I'm going to be playing through Metal Gear. It's going to be exciting. It's going to be, it's going to be something. Mm. Oh, I'm so excited for Bolt Gun. So excited for Bolt Gun. I hope you had a great stream. Thank you, though. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I hope everybody else that's tuning in also had a fun time. What kind of stuff are y'all up to today? Thank you for the raids. All right. Is it the right time to, to put all my fossils into the machine? Okay, everybody. Let's do a little bit of gotcha. There comes a time in everyone's life where we kakigurui masho. God. A gold ore? Don't mind if I do. Oh my goodness, look at all our stuff. Truly outrageous. Truly outrageous. Look at all this stuff. My power grows with every item that I find. It does not stop growing. It only keeps growing. What is gotcha? Um, it's like loot boxes, basically. It's like loot boxes. I'm basically making a joke about how I'm opening and there's like a percentage that I get an item, but then I don't know what item I'm going to get. Think of it as a loot box. Zinc, I am definitely an original species. Uh, nothing that has any copyright or anything like that on Earth. I was very careful about that. But, uh, yeah, you know, I guess some bugs really do look alike, and sometimes it may seem like I resemble other bugs, but I am very much an original bug. Thank you. If you've ever seen in Japan, whenever you put money and there's a little ball that comes out, that's what it is. All right, let's see what we can do with the fossils. Oh, the fossils do the same thing. Aha! More gotcha, more. Bigger numbers, numbers go brrrr. Oh my god, she got a diamond? We got a lot of stuff. We got two diamonds, ruby, amethyst. We got a bunch of copper ore, amber. Cool. We got a few nice things. Let's put our little diamonds here. Let's put our amber. And then we didn't get that much actually from it, unfortunately. With studying? Wait, what do you mean by studying? I'm past studying age, darling. No more studying. If I don't already know it, I'm never going to learn it. This old cockroach cannot learn new tricks, baby. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. It simply will not happen. Of course you can. Nope. Oh, the sturdy fossil. I see. So the sturdy fossil, is that what I'm going to be using to make um to make the scarab bomb? It's sturdy fossil. Make an amethyst hook. Already did. Already did. See? I just don't know. Okay, there we go. Dark, thank you for the six months. I appreciate it, darling. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. 
I guess I could make a better pickaxe than my lead one, huh? I think we're fine for now. Oh, I made a mistake. That's fine. Fossil pickaxe is really good. Very fast speed. Plus 43% pickaxe power, plus 18% size. Eight melee damage. It's just too better. Mm. Oh yeah, it's better than platinum, but it can mine meteorite. So what should I do? Should I do fossil everybody or should I do... Or should I do platinum? Fossil seems like the play. Oh, everybody wants me to do platinum instead because 59% pickaxe power? Fossil better? You're the only one that's saying that though. Who do I believe? Do I believe you or do I believe the masses? You know what I mean? The masses are demanding. The masses are demanding platinum, my love. I gotta give the people what they want. I gotta give the people what they want. I'm sorry, sometimes the people speak. Wait, what? Uh, I did it again? What? No! This is so bad. Why is it? Okay. Fuck. I'm sorry for my language. Fuck. But when you sell things to the store, you press control. And then, but like when you press control here, it just sends it to the garbage. You know it's bad when I'm swearing because I don't swear a lot on stream. You know I don't swear a lot on stream, but damn it. Damn it! Darn it all to hell. God dang it, Bobby. Uh, it's fine. Start bombing the place. I scare of bombs. Alright, so it's where I'm facing, huh? Let's try it. So how do I face down? I have to jump, maybe? Oh! Try pressing shift. It's not doing it. May not work with water. Hmm. You know what might? Heat! I think that's a heart container. Does it look like it? Kind of looks like it. Oh! <gasps> My heart! Wow! Alright. Is that a trap? That kind of looks like a trap. That big button. That big button. Looks suspicious. Huge button. Huge button. Big button above me. Ah, oh, I see the rock. Oh, oopsies. No, please don't blow up the chest. Thank God. Have I played Worms or Magadon? Playing Worms or Magadon right now. Ooh. Playing Worms or Magadon right now, my love. <laughs> Recall. Archery. Flaming arrow. Bar. Dynamite. Another magic mirror. Another one. Lucky. Feels a little lucky. Not that I really need to. What do you mean 
I haven't played it. It's a rite of passage. Of course I've played it. How dare you? This is blasphemous. You telling my audience I have not played Worms or Magadon is blasphemy. I'm suing. Magic Mirror. It's my sec. I already have one. I got two. Wait, where's my second one? Wait, what? Sword? Yeah, I got two. Bye, AJ. Thanks for hanging out. Always appreciated, darling. Might as well sell it. I think so, too. Capitalism. Ho. Oh. Right? Okay. What's going on down there, huh? What's going on down there? I'm hearing suspicious noises of battle. Hmm. All right, I'm going to try it again with this bomb, okay, everybody? All right. So I just have to face down straight. So how do I... Oh my god. I did it. I'm doing it. Ooh, and there's a little bit of treasures over there. You can throw them while holding the rope. I think that's what I'm going to start doing. It's kind of cool. I like it. Definitely a really fast way to mine. Your first mistake is waiting for me to answer. Your second mistake is assuming I know what you're talking about, my love. What are we talking about? It's my stream, but I have no idea what we're talking about ever. Such a sticky bomb more than scarab bomb? No, no, no. Don't trust the bombs. Trust in me. Who's the bomber? Don't trust the bomb. Trust the bomber. Ah? Believe in the me who believes in the me who will bomb this whole cave. All of it. Cybertruck Elon made just like the Tesla car. Yes, I know about the Cybertruck. It looks amazing. I do not know how to drive, but I would learn how to drive just to have a baby pink Cybertruck. Yes. What about it? You've been using dynamite? You never thought Scarab would work so well? See? This is what I love about these games. No matter how many hours of playthrough you have, you always learn more stuff. Why Baby Pink? Uh, have you heard of having colors that you really like? I'm gonna open your chat logs. You're being a little silly. Oh, You were being a little silly, weren't you? What would you do if Zero sends you a cyber truck in real life? Waiting on Matara Khan to answer. I would murder him. In Minecraft, allegedly. For spending his hard-earned mo- ah! 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 Okay, I got karma. See, every time I talk a little bit of poop, I get karma. I would hurt him, allegedly, in Minecraft. I would hurt him, allegedly, in Minecraft for daring to spend his hard-earned money on buying me a car when I don't know how to drive. Allegedly. Are you happy? I answered your question. I noticed you. I gave you attention, my love. Are you happy? Is this the what you wanted? Was this the outcome you wanted? Why 
zero out of... Just curiously, is it just because they're a mod? I'm just... I always... I always wonder, like, why... Why... Why'd you pick zero? Is it just because they're moderating? You think zero has many doubloons? To spend? Zero. You you str you strike my audience as very rich. Did you know that? You have rich man vibes. How does it feel? How's it, how does it feel to have rich man vibes? That's true. Zero has a lot of money. Because it's always Zero's birthday. And since it's always Zero's birthday, Zero has a lot of money. You're right. You do that. I'm sorry, that is very funny. The fact that that was your question and you're like, no, no. I need Matara Khan to answer. I need to know what she would do if her moderator bought her this car. I need to know. <laughs> I love it. Thank you for the question. That actually made my day. That made me giggle. This is why I love Twitch television. Everybody is so silly and goofy all the time. You just may not have a sad day on the Twitch television. They say they loved your answer. Thank you, and I loved your question. See? I love Twitch. It's always such a happy time. I know sometimes with the way that, like, I talk about questions, it makes it seem like I'm being a little, you know... Like, I'm like, oh, you said something silly. But I like it. Trust me. I, I love it. I love it. Oh, no. Oh, no. The water has escaped. Who could have predicted that was going to happen? God damn it. I'm going to have to deal with the water again. It's fine. Because you know what? I think I'm going to go back and buy Scarab Bombs. I don't remember if he sells them. I don't think he did, unfortunately. But man, are these bombs valuable. Man, are these bombs nice. Alright, chat. What would you do if Zero bought you a Cybertruck? What would you all do if Zero bought you a Cybertruck? Sell it, drive it, crash it. <laughs> Damn, okay. Okay. Not what I was expecting there. Test the durability. Of course, of course. By crashing it. Hmm. God. Sticky bombs and tunnel snakes rule. Did you all know that? Did you all know that? They really do. God. They're great. I love these bombs. Alright. Let's get back to business. Mining is serious business. I love that. I love that everybody is just out here thinking, you know, Zero. Zero is a secret quadrillionaire. Also, Teddy, how are you? Nice to see you. Hope life's been good. I saw you and I was like, oh, I gotta say hi. And then I started talking about Zero being a secret quadrillionaire because he has birthdays out all the time. You know that Zero secretly gets one dollar for every person he times out? It comes from John A. Twitch himself. That's why he's been... If you've ever been unfairly timed out by a moderator, it's because John A. Twitch is secretly in cahoots with them. Oh, that went... That went far. Anyway, this is still the mushroom biome. We've been here before. It's the same mushroom... Oh, that's a secret house, I think. 
Nice. Another house, another painting. Ooh, and a little mining dribbler statue. I don't know him. Ghostly, thank you for the prime. Oh, we are 14 sub points away, y'all. Ah! Oh my god, not me surviving. Not me surviving the grand fall of 2024. Wow. I truly am unstoppable. Chest? Chest? Guys, please. My loves. You've been doing this thing lately. Where if I don't click an item in the first four seconds of looking at the item, I get a bunch of mata? 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 There's there's an item. Mata? Oh. Mata? 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 The chest? Mata, the big chest? Big Lebowski, the chest? Mata? Oh, ah. I accidentally drank that potion. That is not what I meant to do. That's a little awkward. Not what I meant to do. But it's okay, we will live. Mata? All right, it's time for the godly. Wait. It was godly and now it's only superior. Lame. Lame. The game cheated. Mata? Mata the mace? Mata? Mata the pot? Mata? Mata? There's a pot up there? Mata? Mata the, the, the iron? Or is that silver? I can't tell. Mata? Mata the platinum? Mata? Mata, the, the iron? Mata? <laughs> I love it. I love it. Y'all are very cute. Mata, there's a zombie. Can you please kill him, Mata? Mata? Please? Please, Mata? Please, Mata? Mata, there's a bat? Mata, I love you? Mata, I really enjoy your long streams? Mata, there's pots? Mata, be careful. Don't take fall damage. It hurts. Please? Matara, please? Oh. There's lava. I don't know what I was expecting. Mata hot? Oh, they're burning. Wait. Okay. They burned, and because of that, the lava disappeared. Interesting. <gasps> Little gecko. Watch out, geckos. I'm coming for you. Oh, it fell down. I see, I see. Am I gonna have to learn lava management? I will kill that gecko. That gecko will die. I am the danger. I am the menace. Did y'all see me miss that block? That was legitness. Did you guys see that? <gasps> Thank you! Hey, Mata, I found you through... Ay, Bricky. You're the first streamer I've ever donated to. My wife just released her first book about Monster Boys. She's trying to spread the word about Monster Boys, but it isn't having, having much luck. It's well written. Called Tabby Swain by Cynthia Queen. Check it out if you want. Either way, thanks for your time. Thank you so much for the bits. I very much appreciate it. Um, I gotta be honest with you. 
right now books are not exactly on my priority list. I got a lot of Warhammer books still to read. But maybe if anybody else thought that that sounded like a fun thing, maybe they can check it out. Good luck on your wife, on your to your wife on her publishing journey. May I recommend she starts a Twitch stream? I know streaming isn't for everybody, but it could be a great, very natural way for her to promote the book if she's streaming and maybe talking about it or doing anything or just streaming and then having the book on the side. Thank you so much for the for the bits. Good luck on your wife. <laughs> you know what I meant. Thank you for stopping by. Listen. Self-advertisement, not good. Self-advertisement for money. We we can we can sometimes look the other way. We can sometimes look away the other way. You know? We can we can sometimes respectfully look away. Thank you so much for your generosity. I appreciate it, darling. But unfortunately, you you cannot imagine how little time I have to read at the moment. Book club has been on back order for God knows how long. Oh, oh shit! I have got to stop. Okay, it's because I put I put my rope on six and it used to be on seven. So now I'm accidentally Oh my god. I'm accidentally throwing my sticky bomb sometimes and it has been terrifying. Sets a bad precedent. We could get a bunch of self promo donos. Yeah, but if we do, the way advertising works on Twitch. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on. Please feel free to send your self promoting donations. <laughs> but the way self advertising works, um, it's if if I just raid a streamer. They won't necessarily grow a viewership just because I raided them. If somebody comes into my stream and says, I'm a streamer too, you should check me out. Very rarely does that do anything, to be honest with you. At maximum, maybe could be one person. So if people suddenly started giving me, you know, $20 to be like, hey, Matara, I'm promoting this. I'll say thank you. And just, you know... Can I advertise my friend's brother's cousin's wife? Yes. Is she beautiful? Is she smart? Does she have children? Does she want children? How does she feel about short, bulky momos? Does she like them? Are you offering her up for marriage with us, all of us? Do you have enough brother's cousin's wives for the whole stream? Visha, thank you so much for the bits, my dear. Can I advertise in your chat? We might, we might need to make a rule. All, all, all jokes aside, um, j just so we are clear, I am joking about the advertising. Um, I do think it would be very scummy if I had a stream and I was like, hey, you can advertise your stream if you give me a hundred, you know, fifty dollars, twenty dollars. I, I do think it's scummy um, to do that. Obviously, I was just kind of playing up on the joke that being said the person that tipped that they did say they're from bricky and from youtube it's kind of different right on youtube if somebody leaves a comment and says hey i see you love monster girls my wife is writing a book about monster girls that, you know nobody really sees that as advertising and nobody really bats um their eyelashes you know and gets surprised but on twitch it's slightly different people oh, there's another chest on twitch people get a little bit more um yeah, on Twitch, people just kind of get a little bit more, you know, up in arms about it. And I get it, right? As somebody who does stream on Twitch, I get it. If you don't, if you don't put boundaries, people will come in and just advertise. So that's why I didn't really say anything, like I said. And please, I'm sorry. I know we started this whole conversation over you just talking about your wife's book. But I am very grateful for the kind words. Tell you what. 
since you found me through Bricky, and Bricky was in this chat earlier, getting drunk on gin and sodas. If I ever meet Bricky, I'll buy him a drink with your money. One drink! Oh! <gasps> Oh my goodness, you know with, with Oni bro, when I told you all that if you give me $10, I'll buy him a Whopper? I never bought him a Whopper. <laughs> Next time I collab with Bricky, I'm gonna tell you all, Hey guys, if you... <laughs> In my defense, I offered to buy him a Whopper. Don't be surprised, I actually offered to buy him a Whopper. It's Okay, okay, before you say robbed, let me explain. I tried to pay for as much stuff as they would let me. I had to trick them to keep paying. You know what else I did before I left? I had um $200 in yen left. And I was in my room. And I put it under the desk mat. So Onigiri only ended up finding it after she was cleaning her room for her mother to come visit. So, I gave them as much extra money as I could. I did my best. Trust me. At one point, I did tell Oni bro, hey, um, would you like to go for a Whopper? And he said, nope, let's go to this like fish restaurant instead, or let's go to this other place instead. I promise you, I promise you, okay? I promise you, I really tried. I really, really, really tried. All right, I'm getting rid of all the mud. I don't think I need the mud. And I'm going back upstairs. I'm filled with equipment. Look at all that money up there. How come there's so much money up there? I don't want that money. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's why there's so much money up there. Ah, oopsies, I made a mistake. So, how about this? Next time I collab with Bricky, I will tell the chat, Hey, for every $10 donated, or three subs given, I will buy Bricky a drink, and then I'll just never buy him a drink. <laughs> I'll just avoid him if he's ever at the same convention as me. I'll just completely avoid him. I'll just be like, oh, sorry. Mm, I have... <coughs> I think I have COVID. Sorry. I think it's a great strategy. Listen. All right, I really want that money, but I don't think I can get that money. I don't think I can get that money. All right, I. Mm. All right, let's go upstairs because I got I got too much stuff now. I got too much stuff now. You're jealous that Bricky's friends with me? I wouldn't say we're friends. I would say we are good co-working acquaintances. It's funny because we actually had a really deep conversation about adult friendships and like kind of taking your time that if you work with people that you take your time getting to know them because in many regular jobs right you take your time befriending people and in twitch it's like oh you collaborate once and suddenly you're best friends right and you basically have then um and then if that person has any behavior you're automatically 100 percent supporting all their behaviors all their stuff all their things no 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 we're working acquaintances. Oh, I forgot about my mirror. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. I completely forgot about my mirror. Thank you, Vikings, for the raid. I appreciate it, darling. As a chat, it is our... Wait, what's with the music? Is it me or is the music a little bit terrifying? Okay, the music at one point got a little intense. Ah, it's because of the storm, I see.
Yeah, the storm is... Oh my goodness, this is intense. Something's coming. Is it actually? Is it actually? You promise? I'm gonna keep the extra mirror. You're lying? Oh! <gasps> How could you? Oh, Crim Tame Orb. Hmm. Music is good, though. Music is really nice right now. Oh my goodness, what's going on? It's raining, it's storming. Alright, where were we? Um... But yeah, I just feel like when it comes when it comes to other streamers, right? It's like you just instantly you have a collaboration and everyone's like, oh your best friends. Well, well. I can actually keep my uh Abigail flower down here. I don't need to bring it with me. So back to my plan of, uh, back to the drinks plan. How do we feel about it? You guys like it? Do y'all like that plan? You love getting scammed? Is it a scam? What if I say, because look, with the Whopper, right? With the Whoppers, it wasn't a scam. Because I told Oni bro, hey, let's get you a Whopper. And he said, nah, let's go here instead. And then I paid. So if I... Here's my, here's my plan. If I see Bricky at a convention at 10 a.m. and I say, hey, let me get you a beer. And he goes, nah, Mata, it's 10 a.m. Maybe tonight. And I'll say, sure. And then I avoid him at night. I still was fair when I said, let me get you a beer. It's his fault for saying, no, I don't want a beer at 10 in the morning. What if he says yes? Well, then I got to get him a beer. You, you get what I mean? That's just deceitful. Is it? Fine. I will not deceive you all. You know the, the Simpsons where Bart just kind of writes on the board all the time? He's like, I will not do da da da. That's me tonight. I will not deceive you. And take the Momo money, the Momo Kane, away from the Momos. I will not try to separate the Momos from the Momo Kane. I will be just. Have we fought any bosses yet? Yes, I was fighting the big slime boss, but then my internet cut out mid-fight. It was really unfortunate. It was really unfair. Super unfortunate. Um. Yeah. Mid fight. Not cool. Yeah. When did that happen? Uh, like uh, an hour ago, maybe. Well, I mean, the internet lagged and it caused the, the lag, right? That's how lag works. <laughs> it, it. 
it lagged and then it lagged again. You must have missed it. Don't worry. It, it wasn't anything crazy. It wasn't anything crazy. Why not say the game crashed? Well, then I'd be a liar. The game didn't crash. It was the lag. Yeah. Well, I think there, there was the treasure there, right? With the house? No, it was further down. Boo do do do. All right. You will not bring me down. Okay. I remember there was maybe more treasure here that I missed because I was uh, full. My inventory was full. Let's see what else is here. Wait. Ugh. So long, Gecko. That's for not letting me eat your tail. Kind of want that gotcha over there. Let's go get this gotcha. Hi, Izu. How you doing, darling? Yeah, I wasn't. It wasn't fair that it happened to me. I hope the game stops doing that. It was really uncool that it did that. Let's keep going down. Little crab. Okay, where were we? Right, we were there. These little birds, I can never see them. Do, 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 do. Do, do. Oh, oopsies. Fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're, we're fine. Ignore the lava. The lava can't hurt me if I don't look at it. Hmm. So I think I should just. Right? If I just do that. Ancient gold helmet. Ooh. That sounds exciting. All right. Okay. Perfect. And now... See? All according to Keikaku. Keikaku means plan. By the way. May I suggest that you make yourself a grappling hook? Thank you. Great suggestion. I loved it. I thought it was a good suggestion. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. I thought it was nice. It was nice. Thank you. All right, I have to stop getting distracted by the amounts of gotcha here. I have got to stop getting distracted. I will not be able to find hell if I keep getting distracted by simple pleasures. Depth meter. Displays depth. I already have my radar though. Maybe the depth meter. Oh, but the radar is 3% damage. I don't know. 3% damage sound exciting. Ooh. I think there's lava down there, y'all. I can't prove it. But I got the vibe. Wait, fuck. Sorry. Okay. It was, I did that on purpose, by the way. I did that on purpose, by the way. I was just trying to show you all how it works. Okay. I was, uh, I was trying to show y'all how it works. 
the sticky bombs. I was just I was just making sure that you all knew that you just throw the sticky bomb down, right? And that's how it works. Yep. All according to plan. All right. So now that I'm in hell, what the hell? Water? Oh, is it just like that other game? Is it just like that other game? The Minecraft? I understand what must be done. It will be done. I get you. It must be done and it will be done. I understand. I, 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 I. Ah! Oh, look, there's a little guy! Do you guys see him? He's got little eyes! Ooga booga booga! Oh. Eesh. Wait, wait! I gotta probably block that off, actually. Or cut that there. Mm, no, it's gonna keep going. Eesh. It's okay, we got a lot more water up there. Hmm. Yeah, I think I gotta block this off. Okay, let's wait a second. It's a different infinite water glitch. Ooh. It's a unique water glitch. I like unique and I like water glitches. It's okay. We have a lot of water at the surface that we're going to bring down. We're also going to get a lot of obsidian this way, which is exciting. All right, let's see what we got. Okay. Now. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, beautiful. Beautiful. So, do I keep mining this way? Or should I just ignore this lava completely? Oh, I can actually mine through it. Hmm. I don't need to be using my bombs. Would stop the lava. Hey! You feel an evil presence watching you? Go home now. Y'all said I wasn't even in hell. I thought y'all were saying I wasn't even in hell. Oh, I keep forgetting about my mirror. Thank you. I thought you guys were saying... I thought y'all were- What do you mean prepare to fight? I don't want to fight! What? I don't want to fight! I'm a pacifist! I'm a lover! What? Hello? I'm Bialf, that's right. I'm, I'm a lover, not a fighter! All right, I gotta focus this time. Can't be like last time. Oh, fudge. Oh, this one. That's the one I fought the first time, actually. That's the one I fought the first time when I played this game. Anonymous, hello? Thank you, Anonymous. I promise you I will not have my internet cut out this time. I promise you, Anonymous. Oops, actually, I should have just went down. Why didn't I? How many is that? Hold on, I can't tell. Hold 
Hold on, Anonymous. Ooh. My god, I can't out-jump him. Ooh. Thank you! Thank you for the gifted! Thank you! Hold on, hold on, hold on. I can't, I can't, I can't look at chat. You may not distract me with your money. I am very grateful for all your generous money. But you may not distract me with it, okay? I'm sorry. I think it might be a gift sub. It might maybe be a gift sub. Please do not sabotage me. This is the run. Good music. Oh, what the hell just fell from the sky? Oh, maybe it was an arrow. I can't see these these little baby eyes. I can't see them because of the darkness. Good music, though. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's casting spells. He's doing stuff. Now he's a teeth. There's no more eyes. It's just teeth. me. Ah. You cannot sabotage me. I will win. Yay! Thank God my computer didn't lag this time, huh? It's a good thing my computer didn't lag this time. Mm-hmm. It's so nice. I didn't lag this time and I beat him. Fair and square. Hey! A hundred? All right, we are definitely above 7,000 sub points now. And the hype trade. Drago, thank you for the tier three. Dark, thank you for the prime. Drug, thank you for the three. Mori, thank you for the prime. Oh my God. Oh my god, what a time to be alive, y'all. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for spoiling me, y'all. I appreciate it. And Nair, thank you so much for the gifted. Yeah, I wasn't really bad at all. Plus, I didn't have to worry about anything. I could just tank all his damage, so that was good. I'm going to kill the slime next time and not even struggle with it. I promise y'all. I promise y'all. I can't believe a hundred gifted. What the heck? Thank you for the 100 gifted. Oh. My God. A hundred whole gifted. Ah, thank you, Carrie. I was actually wondering if I could put tiki torches down. Because they do seem like standing torches. Captain, that happened. I had the alert pop up today. I was playing a game of uh, Death Must Die. And uh, it happened. That alert popped up for me while Death Must Die happened. Thank you. I can't believe it. Thank you again, Anonymous, for 100. Did you notice Anonymous actually gifted before before the game started? So I'm going to, in my in my head canon, I am going to assume that Anonymous believed that I was going to win. Anonymous believed that I was going to win. That is what I will choose to believe. That Anonymous thought to themselves, you know what, Matara will win. Matara will succeed, and I will give her this gift early. But I know she will win, and I know she will succeed. Thank you. Thank you, Zombie, for the raid. Welcome, Raiders. I just beat my first Terraria boss. Well, technically, I've already beaten that boss before one time when I played before with a friend. But that was a really long time ago. And now I'm re-doing re it fresh and all that stuff. Thank you. How is everybody? Did you have a good stream? Also, I think it might be a gift sub for anybody joining. I think it might be a gift sub. I think it might. Oh! Ah! 
This is the worst day of my life. It's a gift sub. I'm not even trying to be dramatic, but this was the worst thing that's ever happened to me. It's a gift sub. That was the worst thing that's ever happened to me. And I'm not even trying to be dramatic. It's a gift sub. I'm not even trying to be dramatic, my loves. That was awful. It's a gift sub. Nice starter house. Thanks! You want to see my other starter house? I have another one here, but I can't teleport to it yet. Look, 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 look. I'm scared to do anything with this money now. Scared to do anything with this money now. Thank you, Big Red, for the prime. You played Resident Evil 7. I have not played that one. I've only ever played the first Resident Evil, and it freaks me out. It's so scary. I kept... The dogs kept coming out out of nowhere and killing me. And it, it was terrifying. The dogs just randomly would spawn. I, I don't understand how that happens in that game. You go back to areas, there's no dog. Then you go right back and it's like, ah, surprise, surprise dogs. And then I just yell. А почему так много русских тут? Не знаю. Не знаю. Шпионы. Может быть. Может быть шпионы. Но не уверена. А почему нет, правда? Почему нет не быть шпионом? Oh my god, all these, all these little slimes. Oh my god. Oh my little slimes. Ooh, yummy, yummy, yummy slime gel. Why am I walking all the way back? Just for the gel? Это товарищ майор. I am the mayor of this stream. Looks like your colony could use a mayor. All right, everybody. Let's go back down. You've given me... I'm also going to change the way these items are. I want them to be one next to each other. I wish to go back. I wish to go back. That I was watching me and that's all nice and good, but I wish to go back. I want to watch it back. It's my turn. Mother said it's my turn on the murder. You might be able to make a crimtain item. I have 11 plus 3, I think. So I don't, I'm not sure. But I'll do it after. I don't want to lose my time. Speaking of losing my time, I might have to take a moment to pee again. I know. I know. It is unfortunate. Sometimes it feels like I pee more than I stream. But alas... Alas, Artery. Blood Butcherer. Butcher. Butcherer. Flesh Catcher. Tendon Bow. Ooh, the Tendon Bow seems insane. The Tendon Bow seems really, really strong. Am I right? I think that's what we should get. Oh, you guys can't see it. 19 range damage. 4% critical strike. And this is only 10. So I think I'm going to do Tendon Bow. Because now it's 19 instead of... Oh, wait. These are butterflies. Whoopsies. Shouldn't be murdering them, but here we are. All right. The other bow is going to get sold. I didn't even raid Tord the other night. He wasn't even live. 
I ended up raiding Krub, which was great. And I love Krubbert and he deserves it. He deserves all the love. In the this is worth five silver. Wow. A four wasn't even live. Yeah, I know the butterflies sell for a pretty petty. Trust me, I have so many animals at the moment. I have a whole menagerie of animals. Oh, Faith the Dryad. Oh, I think I was locked from getting some of my people until, um... I think I was locked from getting some of my people until... Until I beat the boss because I was at a maximum. All right, everybody. Where does Faye want to live? Probably not in the underground, huh? Probably not in the underground. Hmm. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. The jungle. Unfortunately, Faye, I have not discovered the jungle yet, so you will be patient, my love. I have not discovered the jungle quite yet. Wait, is this a different wood? Wood, oh, wood platform. Mm-hmm. Thank you for the gifted sub! Don't forget the traveling merchant before he leaves. Oh, yeah. Where did he spawn? I keep missing the traveling merchant. I don't see him. Nobody saw that. Oh, there he is. I see him. Hello, sir. You have to beat wall before the jungle? I saw the jungle yesterday and I hadn't beaten anything. <gasps> Chicken egg! Should I get that? Summon a baby harpy? Yes. Oh, but it's one platinum. Oh. Should I buy a little blue chicken? That sounds cute. Honestly, this painting also seems great. One platinum. Unfortunately, I don't have that yet. I didn't realize there was even bigger currency, you guys. Ugh. Is that it? Okay, good. I didn't eat the chicken. It's a good thing I didn't eat the chicken. Alright, I'm gonna put the blue egg here. Not even close to a platinum. I got 15 gold now. Put the egg in the pet slot. Ooh. Come here, little chicken. Oh. I'm not sure which one is the pet slot. Hold on. Wait, where did... Where did my egg go? What do I have to click? Camera mode, housing, equipment? All right. Now walk. Come here, chicken. Yesterday, I didn't kill anything, and I found the jungle. All right, let's let's maybe try to find... <gasps> oh my god, it's so cute. Uh, look at it. Are these the mountains? It has a different music. Oh no, I think it's the forest again. I think it's the forest, but it looks like the mountains. Hi! No, chicken, chicken, come back. This chicken better be fighting. This chicken better be fighting my enemies. It's good to have your emergency snack with you. I think it's a gift sub, y'all. Thank you again for the gift sub. I really appreciate it. It's not a battlecock. Shame. Shame. I mean, yeah, it's kind of cute, but also, you know. It's just a chicken. I prefer a fighting chicken, right? Otherwise, it's just a chicken. 
I like how spinning this around also gives me light. I really need a little helmet or something that gives light. It's a gift sub. I think so. I think it's a gift sub. Wait. Alright, let's keep going. Oh! Actually, I should maybe block this off. Oh, there we go. It's a gift sub. I completely forgot I told you all I was going to pee. Does anybody else remember? Oh! This feels like the jungle is getting closer, doesn't it? The vines are coming. Things are happening. My chicken's getting stuck. Instead of a regular quack, you just hear a man say quack. I had no idea. Because this is my first time owning a blue chicken. I truly had no idea. I had no idea. And I still don't. Ooh. Alright. We are looking for the jungle. We're on a highway to the jungle. And if we stop by hell, I'm okay with that. It's a gift sub. Ooh, I see some ore. Come on, game. Where's the jungle, Lebowski? Boop. Thank you, Angel. Thank you so much. Oh my god. Not the not the nightcore song. <laughs> Wait a second, are we free? Oh no. I thought we were free. We are never free. We will never be free from the gifted subs. They rule us. They control us. They rule us. Are these fake vines? I can't climb them. Nobody, thank you so much as well for the three months, my dear. I appreciate that. I feel like... Oh. Oh, I think that's just regular cave noises. Let's go back up there and see what's up. Let's see what's up there, my loves. Remember, you got a grappling hook? I always forget. Actually. It's hard to remember when I'm always in the cave. Forgetting about my grappling hook. Oh! We are free from the tyranny of the gifted subs. Thank you so, so much for the gifted subs. Wait. Is this the jungle? It sounds different from the previous place. This is the jungle. Yes, it is the jungle. It's got bamboo. Wait. Nice. All right. My lady will be so happy living here. Welcome to the jungle. Okay. Well, I'm going to try to go more to the edge of the jungle and then see what's on the edge of it. Is that a beehive? I think that is a beehive. Whoop. All right. I really do have to pee. I really do have to pee. Okay, here's the plan. I see how long the jungle is. And then I decide where I put the house with the teleporter because we're going to move some people in there. Be right back, my loves. I'll be quick with it. 
can't believe I've already been nine hours almost. Oh God, I have bad news. I might have to wait. No, it's what time is it? It's only 3 a.m. Maybe like two more hours. Plus, we just got a hundred gifted subs. It would be rude to Anonymous if I left. It would be really rude to Anonymous. I am basically going to tell Anonymous, you know, if I leave after a hundred gifted subs, it's like me spitting in Anonymous's face. Right? It's just rude. It's just not nice of me. Right? Fair of that. Hello. I'm back. What did I miss? Superior slime staff. Summon nine summon damage. Summon a baby slime to fight for me. How is everybody? I'm back. That is super rare. I'm lucky, what can I say? That is one of the rarest items in the game. All because I decided to stream. Remember, 100% of gamblers quit before they get lucky. They quit before they make it big. I could have left, right? I could have left. I could have quit. I could have said goodbye. I'm done. Oh my god, look at him! Oh, I can't have both him and my ghost, huh? Shit. Wait, what are those lanterns? Okay, now we have a problem though, because is he better than Abigail or was Abigail better than him? Oh, I get it. It's because I defeated the boss. Slime is better than Abigail? I don't know if he can jump that far. I don't know if my slime is going to be able to jump as far as Abigail can jump, though. Because Abigail can fly. Alright, yes, I know I could have activated control, but I didn't, okay? I didn't activate control. Look at my little slimy guy. Look at my little guy. He's so slimy with it. Check the damage on the item. It said nine. 
But I don't have my Abigail flower with me now, so I don't know how much damage Abigail would be doing. I'm guessing since Abigail flies, it's probably a little bit better. But, uh, I don't know. Oh my god, not me taking all this damage for free. The slime is definitely very cute, though. Very, very cute. The chicken I can maybe get rid of. The chicken feels a little... What is that? That red thing. Come on, Mr. Slime. Slime does damage but can fly. Oh, that red thing was just like somebody's dying stuff. Wasn't very important. Alright, everybody. I need you on high alert for when we leave the jungle. Okay? I basically need to find the end of the jungle. Because once we find the end of the jungle, that's when I can kind of figure out where I want to put my, my teleporter. High alert. Oopsies. I hope that flower wasn't important because, uh... Wiki says Abigail does six damage but can fly. Her flying feels very OP. But at the same time, somebody told me about an armor I can make. That will make me be able to, uh... To have both. So that sounds like my next step, I think. She flies slowly. She flies pretty fast, it seems, no? My god. Is the jungle always have this much water? Or did I just get very lucky with my jungle? Very often? Mmm, I see, I see. Always wet. I mean, it is a jungle, right? What am I asking? Oh. This new bat has been... awful. I absolutely hate him. Oh, oopsies. I looked away for a second on the screen. I'm so happy I never gave up. Haters were telling me to go to bed. Haters were telling me to take care of myself, to stop, to stop gaming, to stop streaming. But no, I knew that the treasure was coming. And I am glad I continued. That was yesterday. No, no. Today too. I'm sure that today too. Haters never sleep. They grind. Remember that. While you sleep, Will Smith is on the treadmill. Wait, that kind of insinuates that Will Smith is your hater. That's a little... That's quite unlucky. If that's your case. That's that's quite unlucky if that's if that's your case. Giga is playing some weird named stuff. What is she up to at th 3 in the morning? Oh. Screw you guys. Get out of here. What a great stream and free day in morning. Hello, darling. I've been here for nine hours and I got maybe an hour left in me. I say this, but maybe two. I don't know. I'm taking tomorrow off, right? Yes, it's for work, but since I'm taking the day off streaming, right? I feel like I I should stream a little longer tonight. You're not going to see me tomorrow. Are y'all going to miss me? Thank you, Zaho, for being here. I appreciate it. It, it is true that nerds do watch him. Kind of. Kind of's not good enough. Promise me you'll be sad. I'll finally be able to catch up to the to the VODs. No smiley face. What is... What do you mean you can't catch up with the VODs? 
I'm only giving you 13 hour VODs every other day. That's my secret. I'm always sad. Good secret. Good secret. These little guys. Perfect. Oh, oopsies. Wrong one. Oh, I'm out of uh, platforms already. Don't push me! Oh my god. I think, I think the bats are by far my least favorite enemy. I know there's probably worse enemies, but the bats are... I hate them. If I could, I would do my best to end their life. Oh, you're drinking? What are you drinking? I'm jealous. I'm living vicariously through you, and you're drinking. Water? Maybe I'm not living vicariously through you anymore. I too can drink water, so I don't need to live through you to drink water. You know? The blood of your enemies. Now we're talking. Now we're... Little frog! Oh, wait. I, I don't have my net on. Then I'm gonna have to wear him in my inventory. No, 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 no. Screw the frog. Okay, I did get the frog. But screw the frog. Guys, please. Can you stop spawning for three seconds? I'm trying. Okay, you know what? That's it. That's it, you guys. I'm done. I'm done. Okay, that bat just being able to like stick on me this way. You suck. All right, I'm, I'm walking. I'm done. I'm done building a road. If I play my cards right, I never have to walk back through the jungle ever again. Wait, let me. If I play my, my cards right, I will never come back here. Ever. Okay? That is what I'm doing right now. Playing my cards right. What about the rare fish? Nope. I'm leaving the jungle forever. My god. That was really painful. Can of worms. Throwing knives. Other things. Wood is a good loot. Why am I full? What do I got? What do I got? Zombie banner, copper ore. Yuck. Wood, come to mama. Jungle grass seeds. Yuck. Day bloom. Yuck. Mug, mud block. Yuck. Yuck. Oh, what is that sound? No day bloom? Not yet. Thank you. That's why my inventory was doing what it was doing. That sounds like... a strange noise. That absolutely sounds like a strange noise. We're gonna go investigate. There's a sort inventory button. Really? Okay. Is this the beach? So this is a different biome again. Okay. Since the beach is here, I'm going to put my teleporter in the in the meeting in the middle of the jungle, I think. And then we're going to make something on the beach. All right, everybody. My goal for today, having a beach house and having a jungle house. Look for the kid. 
But then I'd have to take care of him. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. Go back to the ocean. There are chests there. Guys. Please. I just told you what I'm going to be doing. I told you the plan. The plan is simple. I'm going to build a house in the jungle. Then I'm going to go to the beach and build a house in the beach. You can tell me to go look for the little boy. But he's going to have to be lost for just a, a little bit longer. That little boy will have to be lost just a tiny bit longer. I think here would be a good space because it's kind of good sort of in between. Just in case I ever need to do anything in this environment. Oh, oopsies. All right, let us begin. Ow. Ow. At first order of business, we're gonna wall off the water. And now it's time to make a nice little home. Doing numbers today. This is gonna be my third, actually my fourth house I'm building today. Can you believe that? I have built, I have, I have done real estate. I am real estate. I am real estate. Real estate fears me. Women love me. I eat fish. Oh, wait, this is actually the perfect fast. I always have to remember, like, sometimes I take it off, sometimes I put it back on. We gotta do what we gotta do. Alright. Now. Well, thank you so much for the 20! I appreciate it. Thank you, my darling. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my god, I feel so spoiled today. What the heck? I feel so nice and spoiled today by everybody. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much, KCZ or Z. I don't know. I'm in Canada where we say Z. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Free real estate means there's fake estate. Oh yeah, there's definitely fake estate. But not in this stream. In this stream, we only have the real estate. Not that other stuff. Not on those other streams, you might have that fake stuff. Not here. Not here, baby. Ah! I accidentally pressed B. Awkward. Awkward, awkward, awkward. Didn't mean to do that. Did not mean to press B. Yup. That's gonna be, that's gonna be, that's gonna be that. Ooh. I hope it wasn't a rare potion. I'm telling you, I always press B because it's always B in video games to build. Oof. Oof. Oh, and thank you for the five months, Ton. I appreciate it. Y'all, thanks for spoiling me. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> All right. We're also going to put a chest. Big golden chest. Wow. Um yeah, we're going to we're going to we're going to have to we're going to have to put rich mahogany. <gasps> Ooh. Wand of sparking. Oh, do I have to aim the wand? I thought it would be a, like auto aim. Hmm. Hmm. 
Also, thank you for subscribing. Oh, wait, that kind of hit it. Wait. Oh, no, it's because I was aiming at him. Yeah, it's all right. It is nice. Wand of sparking. It's nice. Hmm. Guys, I think it's a gift sub. The gift subs are taking over. Do not let the gift subs spread their propaganda, everybody. Do not listen to the gift subs. Do not listen to them. Fight the gift subs. Stay away. Fight them. Stay away. I want to do... Oh, wait. Bamboo wall is probably a natural wall, huh? Does bamboo wall count as a natural wall or does it count as a... Uh... Oh! Goblin Scout? Oh. That's awkward. He's definitely dead. Ah, ah, fudge me. Threw the wrong item. These bats? I hate them. All right, everybody. Let's talk it through. Let's talk it through. Let's talk it through, everybody. What walls are we making? Goblin scout? Shouldn't have been scouting. He showed up at the wrong neighborhood. God, I hate the jungle. All right, let's try to do bamboo wall. I feel like it should work. I hate the bats. I hope they are never born. I hate everything they are and everything they stand for. I truly detest the bats. I wish to exterminate these bats from existence. I'm sorry. I hate them. I absolutely hate them. Ooh, I got 666 bamboo. Spooky. The bats on the harder difficulty debuff you. Ugh. It's just annoying because it feels like they're sp spawning so much. Wait, why can I not? All right. Perfect. Beautiful. Majestic. Let's go. Let us continue. We need a teleporter and we need it pronto. We got to keep moving. Got to keep it separated. Beautiful. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba 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 ba da ba 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 da ba 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 Alright, little door? Little door right here? And then maybe a little... Ooh, a little goblin scout. I sure hope nothing bad happens to him. I sure hope nothing bad happens to him. I sure hope he lives a long, healthy, and wonderful life. Oopsies. All right. It's time to have some friends move in. I'm so excited. New friends. All right. Let's keep going. Perfect. We need tables, chairs, dining area. One, two, three, four. Bam. 
Tables, tables, tables everywhere. One, two, three, four. Perfect. Beautiful, beautiful tables. Gorgeous tables. Gorgeous place to live. Gorgeous house. Gorgeous view. Thank you, Scooter. I really enjoy the vibes and company. Thank you, darling. Thank you so much for the five months. Always appreciate that. Welcome back. Six months already. Although we know we know the time the time cheats a little bit, right? We know Twitch adds a little extra month. Twitch is a little cheater. Twitch is always cheating with the time. They are never fair with it. I don't know why. I'd rather live than die. Look up towards the sky. For answers to our lives. What? What? Can't catch me. What? Perfect. <gasps> I really think I'm decorating this place gorgeously. If you have the painter, you can get the pile on setup with the dryad. Yes, I do have the painter. I do indeed have the painter. Oh, I thought that was my slime. I'm not gonna lie, he kind of looked like my slime. Music here is so groovy. Do I want some pie? I like pie. It's been a while since I had pie, actually. Um, it's been, it's been a while, while, while. I'm trying to think. I honestly can't remember. Genuinely. I had birthday cake. But pie, I cannot remember. Which is a shame. Oh, I need one extra door. Darn it. Yeah, I didn't realize I'd be... Actually, I don't need this door here. I won't be coming out of here. I can just put this door there. Perfect. I love a good uh, apple pie warmed up or rhubarb pie with a little bit of the um, vanilla ice cream. Ugh. I really like raspberry pie as well. I'm not a big fan of those kind of pecan pies or anything like that. I think they tend to be too sweet. What about y'alls? You just haven't had my grandma's pecan pie. All right, so. The Dryad, you're moving in. And then the Painter, correct? Mauricio, you're moving in. I, okay, I lied. I love pumpkin pie. Love pumpkin pie. There's never enough pumpkin pie. I hate that pumpkin pie is only a Halloween thing. Thank you, GR2. I think nine and a half hours of Terraria is quite the gamer day. God, pumpkin pie. One of the best pumpkin pies I had was a little bit spicy. Kind of a spicy pumpkin pie. So good. So, so good. I'm just going to put some of these guys here. Just because I, um, I don't want to worry about them. Okay. So now, I will. Oh. I should stay here, right? Because they're going to move in the morning. Or should I be away from this? I think I need to be away from this house for them to move in, correct? Yeah, I think I need to be away from this house for them to move in. Oh, the campfire is off. Oops, thank you. I was accidentally touch it. Yeah, if I go to the beach and then I come back, they'll... They'll come back. Oh my god, not all the bats. Alright. Oh, not this again. Not you guys again. Why did I wait until night time? Why do I live just to suffer? Also, I just realized I could have easily been throwing the glow sticks in the cave. Actually, 
I could just run. Could have easily been throwing the glow sticks in the cave. Right? All right. So it just kind of goes to walls or what? Ah, it's at walls. Yeah. Should have should have been doing that. Should have been doing that. Should have, could have, would have. All right, we're off to the beach. I have a little bit more inventory space. I'm ready. I think there was a healing potion here that I missed. Nope, I missed 71 copper. Get out of here. Get out of here. Woohoo! Oh, the Demon Eye banner actually looks really, really cool. All right, guys. I'm sorry. I'm out of here. Sorry, guys. Blue chicken. Yeah, but he's kind of sucky. He's not really doing anything fun. He hasn't really been doing anything fun, you know? He's just there. Not really doing much. Banners are useful. Where do you put them? Just in your house in the same biome so that your people can fight him or what? Don't talk about the chicken like that. He's not that useful to me. I'm sorry. Where you fight? Yeah, but these guys are weak mobs, right? You're not really... Oh, sleeping angler. Thanks, I guess, for saving me or whatever. You'd be a great helper minion. Apparently, demon eyes can sometimes be amphibious. They don't fly. They swim. Want to see the look of someone's face when they find it in their bathroom. They hang around in the same area. That means you really want in. You want me to... You want me to fish? For you? Ugh. Thank you, Pure. Thank you so much for subscribing, my dear. I don't know if I'm ready to take the commitment of fishing. It's a pretty big in-game commitment. You know? It's a pretty big in-game commitment. What if I get addicted? Lightning Welk Shell. 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 I thought it said Shelk. Oh, God. The rewards are nice, and it resets every day. Okay, honey. I guess I'm gonna make a fishing rod. Okay, honey. Okay. I guess I'll make a fishing rod. I guess... I have a bunch of scorpions as well for the for the bait, so I think I'm fine. Oh. They're fighting. Kind of scared me when he jumped out like that. Okay, that is a big deep sea. That is a lot of water over there. There better not be a big huge shark in it or something. Where am I going? Uh, you're asking me? I don't know. I don't know. I, I thought you know where I'm going. I thought you would know where I'm going. I thought that was the whole point, is you know where to go. Is it always the same biomes? Where it's like sand and then jungle and then, um, I guess this, the ocean? Kind of. Kitty, thank you for the raid. I appreciate it, darling. How was your stream today? Hope you had a good one. Where's my where's my slime? 
Where's my slime? Try to grab the underwater chest. Guys, I have a mission. I'm building this. Guys, please. I'm on a mission. I, you know one thing I do I do wonder? So, you know, usually on streams, when you don't finish a task that you're set up, setting up to do, people don't like that. People don't like seeing you not finish a task. In this game, every time I do a task, everyone's like, mm -mm, Matara, stop what you're doing. Something else needs to happen. You must stop your quest. Oh, am I at the edge of the world? I think I'm at the edge of the world. Yay! I was on a quest. I was trying to get to the edge of the world. It's a very important quest. I know you guys are impatient and excitable, and I love you. All right, let's build a house in the beach. All right. Because I am sure some very cute people would love to move in here. But they may not. And I would love to teleport here. Oh. Yeah, beach house near the beach. That makes sense, right? Beach house near the beach is perfect sense. It makes so much sense. All right, everybody. It's time for the beach house of your dreams. Can you put the beach house on bamboo stilts? It's traditional. That's a lot of work. I'm sorry. It, it sounds like it's a lot of work. I'm sorry. The umbrella? Did I get it? No, I already had an umbrella hat. I'm just wearing the ears instead because they're cuter. I'm sorry, my love. How about a little traditional bamboo workbench? Do I have Mousy's blood in her? I mean... She did, she did find me on the side of the road. So maybe, maybe she infused some of her blood in me. You know? She did find me on the side of the road. She did adopt me. She did invite me in and said, and then she streamed. And here I am streaming. It is how it happened. It, it did happen like that. Yeah, I feel like building the beach house is a little early on. I don't think I need it quite now. I probably need to beat more bosses before more. Because right now, the only new NPC I got was uh, Faye. Oh, and Jimmy. Jimmy's going to want to live here. Wait, is it me or do I have less NPCs? Huh? I feel like I got less. I used to have them over here. That's weird. Wonder if they died. Rip. Rip NPCs. But they will come back. Right? You all said? Right? They're just they're just at a different beach house, right? They're gonna be back. Right? Will they respawn back in their homes is the question. They ain't the same person, though. Potato, potato, tomato, potato. You know, if you wake up in a different place, you wake up in a different time, will you be a different person? I don't know. And neither do the people in this game, so it doesn't really matter. All right. Get our stuff. Right. Potato, potato, tomato, potato. Where's my chair? Ah. 
there it is. Oh, wait, did I just have the door open? Guys. Please, where's my slime? I do think the ghost seemed more effective than the slime. I gotta say. I gotta say, the ghost definitely seemed more effective than the slime. All right. I don't know if this was real. But it certainly felt more effective. Certainly felt like it wasn't making such rookie mistakes. You just thought of collabing on the other girls on here? I actually talked about it. I talked about uh, Henya playing it or anything like that, but how about that? You try to get them, okay? You organize it. You get them in. It's harder than it looks. Yeah, Abigail was just always on my side, it felt like, and this slime is never near me. So because of that, uh, slime sucks. The building sound is satisfying, right? I love it. It's nice and nice. Actually, somebody told me previously to be careful of the door because then they can break it, right? So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to block the door. Oh, that was the last time I would. All right, I'm blocking the door with bamboo. Don't worry about it. Boom. I think I can... I can actually put it over here, right? Because then if there's no door here, they can't break that. I guess, yeah, they can break from this first initial side, but... Oop. They'll be fine. They'll be safe. They'll be alright. Got nothing to worry about. All right. It's time to cook. It's time to cook, Momos. Yeah, I definitely should have made my, um... Hmm. I know, I know it's not going to be symmetrical. I know. Oof. You want to cook the momos? But why? What have the momos done to you to deserve cooking? Okay, first order of business, Angler, you're moving in. Congratulations. Oh, it's missing a chair. Never mind. Um, Angler, you're moving in. Congratulations. Angler, you're moving in. Congratulations, baby. All right. Let's try that little diving thing everybody was telling me about. Oh, wait. No, I don't want to teleport back home. I want to go back to the, um, to the jungle, actually. I don't want to dive deep down there. I want to go back to the jungle because I want to see if um, my pretty lady moved in and I can buy a teleporter from her. Thank you, Janum. I can't forget because uh, I haven't done that yet. Is it forgetting if I haven't done it? Can I? Hold on. I want to see if I can grab onto the earth. Okay, yes. And I have to like... Oh, okay. Yeah, I get it. So the trees, you can hook onto them. But you can hook onto the... Hmm. Okay. How happy are they? So two couples walk into a bar and one says to the other, Want to get a goblet of beer? Solitude is sometimes good. There's room to grow and to breathe. I kissed a tree in the jungle and I liked it. The Jalopy of Sacrifice is 3% crimson. I don't understand what that means, my love. But hey! A jungle pylon! Prevents you from accidentally destroying the environment. No, I like that. 
grass wall, sunflower grass seed purification powder cleanses the evil pumpkin seed. Dirt rod. Cool. Good news, everyone. We can teleport even further now. We did it. Part of the cards. Part of the cards. We're doing it. We're teleporting. Hmm. I can sell my armored shackle. Three defense. Maybe that's more worth than the one I have. Oh, oopsies. Not camera mode. I have the... Wait, hold on. I don't know how to get out of this blue chicken, baby slime. How do I get out of this view and then get back... Oh, there we go. I have no shackle. Yeah, I'm selling you the shackle. I don't need this. I don't need this. And I'm pum pum pum. She tells you how much bad in the world. I wonder if the crimson spread is like what I have to fight against. So I'll have to kind of hurry up and do stuff in the game. 22 silver? Oh my god, these shells are crazy. Wait. Wait a second. When I when I make items, do I just have a percent chance to make bad items? And I just did. I just percent chance made bad items. Why did it have to happen on the rare item? Hmm? Hmm? You can re-roll them later. Alright. Back to the pit. Definitely gonna need more chests, though. Definitely I'm gonna need more chests. Don't even know for what anymore, but just more chests. More chests, more everything. Fallen Star. Yes. Okay. Um, I'm going to take back my Abigail flower. I'm going to put back my little... Oh, wait. Oopsie. Wrong. The sounds of my microphone are nice. Thank you. I get that a lot. Thank you so much, darling. Wait, no. Uh, I don't know. I think I'm going to put all the new materials I picked up here. Like anything that's kind of a material... Tulip shell. I'm gonna pick up here, I guess. Kind of worms feels like it's going up into my. Hmm. Probably should have made a thingy up here too, huh? Oh my god, everybody. There is so much stuff. So many things. So many things. So much stuff. All this thinking. All this thinking. All this thunking. All this doing. Definitely wish there was an easier way to organize your inventory. Definitely wish that was the case. I'm also going to get rid of this little chicken egg. I don't want to hold it. I don't want to hold it. Don't like the chicken. I think the chicken sucks. I think it's silly. And I think it's stupid. And I don't like the chicken. I'm sorry. I am aware that what I'm saying is very controversial. But you have to admit it's very brave. Just don't like the chicken. Don't like it. I'm sorry. Can't change my mind. Also need to buy more piggy banks. Should have actually put the summoning item there, huh? Definitely don't need 42 potions. 
Is there a way to split the stack? In this game? Maybe like a T? Or a V? Or a B? Or a C? Yes. Mm hmm. Right click or shift click? I am terrified of clicking shift click after the last things that happened. I lost so much money. I'm scared of shift clicking now. Oh, I wonder if I'm going to be able to get more mana now. Nope, I'm still at 200. Shift, right mouse click. Mmm, thank you. Just don't want to accidentally drink all my potions, which I know I'm going to do knowing myself. Thank you. I can't believe I got the worst bow. Ugh! Unfair. All right. I'm just going to put the glass lens there. I don't even know where it goes and I don't care. All right. I definitely need to have a better placement of um, the cooker. Because now I have to go all the way back here for the anvil. And I think the cooker and the anvil should be next to each other. So it's easier. All right, my loves. Is it back to the basement time? Too scared to do this any other way now. I have fishing bait. Maybe I can make a fishing rod. I know, I know you all really want to see me do that, huh? All right. I'm going to make a I'm going to make a really good rod. I think platinum, right? Let me check what I can do. Um Let me see what I can cook, darling, for us. All right. No. I remember there was a fishing rod with the with this material, but I don't have enough. Maybe there's another material I can take. Maybe the wood. I'll just grab the wood and see if I can make it with the wood, maybe. But I would prefer... Grab the lead. I only have 14, but we'll see what it can do. Thank you. Um... Reinforced fishing rod. It was any iron bar. 15%? Alright, let's do it, everybody. It's time. So I'm gonna get just a little bit more wood while I'm here. Fine. Oh, sorry, buddy. It was an accident. Sorry, buddy. Didn't mean to do that. Sorry, buddy. Uh... Sorry, buddy. Please close the door. But what if she dies? Wouldn't that be funny? Wouldn't that be exciting? Oh, you're right. I should definitely close this door. I should probably not even put a door there, huh? Like, these two doors don't even need to exist. I can just keep going up there. All right. It's time. Oh, I don't have a teleporter to the beach. But it's actually not that far. He's very close. Hello? We're going to put a little piggy bank here. And we're keeping the other piggy bank. All right, Jimmy. We're going. Going to Jimmy. My friend, my pal, my buddy. All right, I gotta remember E. I gotta E and like angle down. Okay. Ooh. 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 Perfect. C. 
See, I'm doing it perfectly. Don't forget to buy the pumpkin seed. Why? Can't see shit? Don't worry, me too. Don't worry, you're not the only one. Don't worry, baby. Just keep swimming, as they say. All right. Pumpkin furniture kind of funny. I guess I'll do it after. Um, okay, so a perfect bet for me. Weird fish that try to sting you and pinch you. Caught in desert. You want a Scorpio fish. Oh. So I have to find water in the desert to catch his fish. You can fish in any water. Okay, good. So I don't have to fish in the desert to catch a Scorpio fish. Gotta be desert. Okay, died is a big word. My computer shut down. It doesn't count. My computer shut down. My my whole neighborhood lost power. Okay. Question. All right, you can backseat here. Am I doing something wrong? with the fishing right now? Or is this just fishing? When it bobs, click it. I did it before and nothing happened. Oh! Never mind. I got a tuner. No, no, I don't need to go to the desert. I'm not trying to do the quest. A trout. I love getting wooden crates. Not now, everybody. We're fishing. I want to do the crates at the end when we have a lot of crates and we can just uh, gamba. For the water in the desert. Uh, buckets. And then I just bring the water there. How do y'all feel about that? So technically, if I can switch my bait, is it going to grab the first bait? So if I put these guys as my first bait, but then I just pull them out the moment it bites, I probably won't lose the bait. Bomb fish. Another tooth. Another crate. It's gotcha time, baby. So you can just keep fishing with the same worm. Oh. 
Because my worm, I still have three glowing worms. And they give 35%, I think. They give more fishing power. 35% bait power. Eventually it is... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I have to use my secret grapple power. All right. Back to the pit. A shrimp? I'm sorry, everybody. I know what I'm doing for the next few hours. All right. Let's gotcha these three crates. Gills potion. Ooh! This means we can go get the... The... The, the thingy. Shrimp check. I'll check the shrimp in a moment. Check in the shrimp. Okay. Here's an idea. We drink the potion. We go dive underwater. And then go to the desert and start fishing there. La 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 la. La 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 la. I see many things. <gasps> wow! Aw. They will unfortunately die. Oh, glow sticks! I forgot about my glow sticks. I can just hold my glow stick. I have to start using glow sticks. Can I mine this? Yes. Ba -da -ba. Is there anything I should be getting from... Oh, inventory full. Is there anything that I get here? Wow. So much for those underwater chests. Y'all were... Oh, there he is. There's the big boy. Oh, wait. Okay, I might actually... Wait. I might actually die. Uh oh, oh. I can't see him. Ooh. I'm going home. Oh, wait, he's not here anymore. I actually don't have to go home. For now. If he comes, I'll go home. Yeah, that was way too close because I couldn't see him. I should have just... Arcane jellyfish necklace? I should have just did it sooner and went sooner. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Oh. Nobody saw that. That was a little spooky. Uh, I definitely got to be a little bit careful. I definitely got to be a little bit more careful. You know, the worst part is I had a health potion. I had a health potion. Okay, so. Let's change things around a little bit, okay? That was way too spooky scary. I did not like that. Careful is my... I need to find all of my glow sticks. I had a million glow sticks and I need to find all of them because these glow sticks are very useful. I'm going to get rid of this bamboo platform because we're going to make more platforms. All of these fish... I got so many. I got so much shit. Sorry for my language in my inventory. Sashimi. Medium improvement to all stats. Ooh. Oh. I can actually enchant my worm, too. Hmm. Probably do that a few times. Let's see. Sashimi feels like it's worth it, right? Is there any other fish things I should be doing other than just cooking my fish as as is? Feels like this is the right play. But maybe I can cook it in a pot. It's potion material. 
Hmm. All right. Well, then I got. I guess I gotta keep it. Yes, I gotta keep it, my loves. Sorry. I'll put the, uh, actually, no, I'll keep the scorpions for now, because I'm going to need them for fishing in the other place. Oh, we're never getting out of here. We're never. The fish you can't cook are potion material. Mm. You can use the guide. Why would I use the guide when I have my lovely Momos here? Who will tell me what everything does instead of me using the guide. My lovely sweet Momos can just tell me everything. You're way cooler and cuter than the guide. You know? Ah. 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 For teleporting. You're way cooler and cuter than the guide. Why would I use the guide when I have you right here with me? Hello? I like how you can just cook the sashimi. Oh no. Yeah, by the workbench. All right, let's teleport to the... Let's make a, I guess, iron bucket. Oof. And then let's figure out how much water we're gonna need. Empty bucket. One, two, is there any other strategy I do? Hmm. What do y'all think, a little bit more? My inventory is always full. One is enough. Perfect. Three buckets at most. Porkway three. Thank you, Jira. I get that a lot. There's an infinite water glitch. Hmm. All right, let's get out of here. There's a lot of water up here. It's not super far away. Am I going to have to just... Uh... How much water is needed? Unfortunately, there's no water closer. 75 blocks of water. Okay, question. Am I able to make the water down here? Or does it have to be like independently in... Um, does it sort of have to be independently outside of the house? It could be down there. Need a big hole? Yeah, right, for 75. Let me just see if I could... Oh, nice. Yeah, I could throw that. Okay. Let me just uh, give him his little floor. So he doesn't freak out, my little guy. That way I can pretty much just fish in the house, right? Let's do that. You love the accent cactus? Thank you. I did it absolutely on purpose. Thank you, my love. Uh, math is hard. I think it's easier to count if I go up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven times. Okay, this is definitely going to be 75 if I just keep. Right? Like it has to be one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's 77. Right? So just up to here is already 77 and we're good. I might have to fill the little rope. Just in case. Oh, God. How dare you all give me this mission? Okay. Can somebody tell me... Okay, the bucket glitch that everybody's talking about. Number one, how hard it is. Number two, will it ruin my world? Oh, 300 for best rates. Very easy. Perfect. So. Explain it to me, please. I have a bucket of water. And now. I'm listening. Explain it to me like I'm your little sibling. Wait, you're right. I can just... Wait, 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 wait. I could literally flow that water down. Wait. Let's make it the fun way instead. Don't flow the water. Why not? It's fun. Are you sure you want to try that? Yeah. I'm gonna flood things? Good. The NPCs can drown? Here's an idea. I will float the water under here. Under where? Under here. I will secretly flow the water underneath the water. Ah? Uh? Actually, I might just use that potion now. Just so I can keep, you know, digging and not have to worry about anything. Ah? Uh? Oh my god, we are thonking with portals. This is some absolute shenanigans. Don't let the water reach the top. What do you mean by that? When you say those words, what do they mean? This is going to be so bad. Why? Uh oh, okay. Yeah, keep going this way. I could have just done this for air, but it's fine. I am a genius. No, there was a few caves next to me. Oh, I think it has to keep flowing down. Is that it? Hold on. Fishing quests end at 4.30 a.m. Shit. Okay. Okay. So now... I, the sand is easy because I can just put the wood. I can just put the wood where the sand is. Okay. I could dig out right now. All right. 
I could technically flood that in there. Hmm. I could. If there's no cave. The sand's gonna fall? Yeah. And I'll pick it up. Oh, you mean getting it into the sand biome, huh? I could put I could put something to block the sand when we're closer. It'll be a pit. Yeah, the pond could be here. Because this is somebody said this is technically the desert. Okay. Question. Question. Since this technically has more than 350, would this count as a... Um, or would I have to, like, make it deep? Top needs to be uncover. What do you mean uncover? What does uncover mean? Remove the dirt? Which dirt? Surround it with sand. Like... Like this? Kind of? Where you are right now counts as forest? Somebody lied to me and told me that where I am now counts as desert. One of you in the chat, I remember, I saw you earlier and you said and I quote that it counts as desert. So let's find out. Let's find out. The background is desert. So let's find out who is right and who is wrong. We begin. We begin the quest for the ultimate fish. Who is right and who is wrong? Will I get the quested fish before 4.30 in the morning? Let's find out. Flounder. Okay, we begin. I'm not sure if this is five. Well, what did you guys say? It was 500. I don't know if we have 500 for the best fishing. It doesn't look like it. it definitely looks like less than 500. Let me make this deeper. Let me make this deeper, okay? Nina, thank you so, so much for the six months, my dear. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope you have been get, having some wonderful days, some wonderful streams, some wonderful things. I really appreciate it. Thank you, darling. Hope you've been having some good stuff. It is time. The fish will come. Build it and the fish will flow. Teach a fish to flow and the fish will flow forever. Tell a fish to stop flowing and the fish might not flow for a while. Tell a fish you like its flow, and it might keep flowing. To fish. And to flow. Oh. 
All right. I think it's starting to feel like... Like 500, right? It's starting to feel like it's a lot of water. It's starting to feel like sand. Right? This, this feels like it could be five. Oh, 300. This feels like it could be 300, right, y'all? Yeah, if you teach a fish to fish, you will never have to worry about the fish fishing. But if you tell a fish to fish, then teaching the fish is fishing to fish. Do you know what I mean? You get it? It's all right. We can fish here for a little bit and then... I did all this work when I could have just waited 30 minutes for the biome to reset, y'all. <gasps> gotcha crate. Hunter potion. It's only been 10 hours. I'm... Still only only 10 hours into the stream. Thank you, Lost Wig. Thank you for the six beautiful months. Is it 4.30 Eastern? Or is it 4.30 Pacific? Where did the devs grow up? Not grow up. Where do the devs live? Right, I need somebody to do quick math. Does this look like 300 water? 4.30 in the game clock? What if it's... Oh! Wait, when you say 4.30 every day, do you mean in-game 4.30? thought you meant in the real world 4.30. Oh, I have no idea what time it is in the video game. You guys are crazy! I have no idea what time it is in the in the video game. What you guys are talking about real world? You guys are crazy. The bobber land effects to so try to get in the middle. What do you mean the bobber lands? And in the middle. Oh. Oyster, platinum, mana potion, screw this acorn, master bait. Uh, probably shouldn't have read that out loud with so much gusto. I, I was just reading and then I'm like, wait a second. <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> I was just reading the text. I was excited. I was excited because of the text. Damn it. That's gonna be, that's gonna be, that's gonna be. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right. It's time. Beautiful lake. Loved it. Will definitely come back to visit. Loved it. Had a great time. Had a great everything. Um, definitely didn't need all that bait, though. I, I can sell the scorpions and I can sell the other stuff. Definitely gonna sell all that. Mm. Definitely gonna sell all those, all those things. I'm not gonna lie. Definitely don't need all my scorpions. Don't need all my things. Probably will stop. No, I kind of want to keep my net in, get, in case I get rare things. Selling bait. I mean, it's cheap bait, right? I got the master bait. Wait, what do you mean there are not enough villagers near the current pylon? What? Huh? Is it because I left the door open? Is it because he died? Why was my die trader not living here anymore? What?
What? Where did he go? Why did he move out? He just moved. You broke his floor. I did. And he said, screw this. And he moved. You're right. It's this guy. He moved away. I hope he moves back. Real soon. Damn it. And just when I needed him most, he moved away. Just when I needed him most, he moved out. Come on. You can make him move? I did, I did. I uh I, I put his portrait in. I'm waiting for him to finally decide he wants to live here again. Not gonna lie, getting a bunch of medium food feels really crazy. Getting all this medium bonus stat. Do the bonus stats affect my fishing, by the way? Oh. I know I can use mirror. But I want to be able to teleport back. That's the thing. Life crystal? Don't mind if I do. So, uh, yeah, again, uh, back to the same question. Sorry, I didn't notice the answer because I got so mesmerized by my reward. Um... Do I, do, does my eating fish, does my eating sashimi make me better at fishing? Let's find out. Another golden crate with another health potion and a mining potion. She's really out here, Matara Khan. She's really out here. It's me. I am her. And I'm really out here. Alright, let's keep fishing. I'm obsessed now. I'm addicted. I want to have all this medium food for next time I get a boss. Wow. All these flounders. I could do a stream where I'm just mining. I could do a mining stream. Oh, I put all my wood away. Hold on. Let me fix that. I could talk to Angler for another fish quest. But I can't teleport right now. I could use the mirror to go back, but then am I sure that... I mean, the guy will move, correct? So I'm okay to tell... I got even more master bait. Ooh. Okay, there's no nice way to say that. I'm sorry. There's, there's no way to say that word. There's, uh... Yeah. The bait. Alright, Ladybug. You're going to the Garbaggio. You're going. You're going to the Garbaggio, Ladybug. Lens, you're going to the Garbaggio. Alright. Mirror. Get me back. Get me back, beautiful mirror. Alright. Wow. Let's, uh... Gonna have to get another chest. Or just the fish, I guess. Oh my god. So many things. Oh, 
Oh. I almost made it. You know what? I'm not even... Almost made a great mistake. Alright, I'm gonna have another chest just for the fish, I think. And the bait. I don't even... My god. My god, I have so many things. Alright. Let's uh, sell all this stuff and then go back to see the little guy with his quest. And hopefully he's gonna give us... He's gonna give us a nice quest and he's gonna give us nice stuff to worry about. Ooh, 35 silver. Don't mind if I do. I'll just sell these golden chests. I'll find a million others. Maybe I should keep them. They're so pretty. Ah. Selling them is the correct decision. Do I have a gold rabbit? I do. And I have a sapphire rabbit as well. I have a sapphire rabbit as well. I just don't remember where I put it. I think I just put it in. Oh, there we go. Sapphire bunny. Let's make some cooked shrimp. Yummy! Escargot. Mmm. Lobster tail. Ooh. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. Sir? Ah, uh, well, awkward. Oh, there he is, Hano. Yes, okay, let's keep going. Oh. I really should make a door on this side. We're running away. We're running away quickly, we're going. time. I have until 4.30 in the morning to do his quests. We must run. I don't even know what time it is, but we must run. Perfect. Sir? Caught in surface tundra. My friend, you suck. I'm going to stay here until he... I'm going to stay here until he uh, changes quests. I'm going to stay here until he changes quests, alright y'all? Back to fishing for us. Why no explore? I just got my fishing stuff. Don't you want me to have fun fishing? I just started fishing. Don't you want me to have a good time fishing? After ten and a half hours of stream stream, we're gonna have wait, does this mean there's different fish in the in the um mushroom biome as well? Let's wait till we have five crates and then open them. Yeah, that's us right now. We're fishing. Oh. What was that sound? Something disconnected. Uh, oh, an iron crate. Gotcha, gotcha. Those emotes make me so happy. 
little little Momo and and people fishing. Right, I should probably keep the uh the fish, huh? I got a few gold crates before this. Got a few gold crates before this, so I definitely did get a few. Definitely got a few. But now we're waiting for five crates and then we're opening them. When do y'all usually pull? At the first one or the second one? Like it goes thun thun and then I pull. Oh, I pulled on the third by accident. Like when it goes boom boom and then I pull. Pull. See, one, two, pull. I love it. Yeah, this is going to be our loot boxes. Our gacha. Opening crates in Terraria. So, um... You come around here often, Momos? I have to say, I feel like the drops are less good here than they were back in my little sand fishing place. I feel like the loot here suck. And I lost the bait. Right? Reaver shark? It's a pickaxe? It seems insane. It seems twice as good as my platinum pickaxe. So far today, we found the, the little sparkling rod. We found the summoning rod with the slime. We found reaver shark. We're having pretty good luck. I could cheese the game with this pickaxe? How so? One more crate and we open. Yeah, I got the little rod that summons the slime, but I prefer Abigail because she flies. And I'm a noob. I'm new, so I don't even... It doesn't even matter to me. Oh, oops. I like it because I don't even have to look at the game. I can just look at chat while fishing. Good morning, Jub Jub. I'm the luckiest streamer. What can I say? I am pretty lucky. Streamer luck is insane. But genuinely, I get really good drops in video games. I don't know why. When I first played in, um, in Enter the Gungeon, I got a rainbow chest in my second ever run. My friend who's played the game so much has never... Like, my friend, I think, played 40 hours and had never seen a rainbow chest. And then five or eight hours later, I had another rainbow chest. Which is insane. This is cozy. You don't think you've gotten a rainbow chest with I've gotten two rainbow chests and I uh, let me check my time on into enter the gungeon. I keep wanting to say into the breach. 42 hours total. But I've got my first two chests in my first two hour, uh, 10 hours of playing for sure. And my second ever run. And then obviously because I still just started playing the game. I, you know, you waste everything. Because you, you don't understand how the enemies work. Ocean crate. Okay, so I've gotten gold and ocean crate. Alright, everybody. Are you ready? We got five crates. Okay, okay, okay. Money and this. Bam. Okay, iron ore. Okay, bam. Emits an aura of light. Not bad. Iron crate. Heart reach ocean. 50 shell pile. And a fleeting flipper. Grants the ability to swim. 
Interesting. Is that also one of those equipable items? I don't know if that's really giving me the ability to swim swim, though. Hmm. Let me quick bat my heart for a little bit. Oh, sorry, my, uh... Can't swim without it? Am I not swimming now, though? I wasn't really swimming before. We'll do it in the in the morning, because I don't wanna I don't wanna look at the shark. Hey, that did seem kinda rare, so good for us. Another wooden crate? Another wooden crate? Shibuya! Sorry for calling you out. Hi, darling. Sorry, I don't usually call out lurkers. <laughs> Go menne. Oh no. I usually, you know when you're lurking in a stream and somebody's like, Hi, thanks for following. You're like, oh god damn, please no. I wasn't trying to draw attention to myself. But I have my, uh, my, my alerts up so that I can see if people gift. And since I'm fishing, I can actually take a look at it. Go menne. Oh no, that's so embarrassing. I just got so excited. I think she's so lovely. Dormant. I I swear. Normally, I would not call you call people out for lurking. I just got excited. Oh no. Oh no. All right. Remember when I said I was gonna fix my. Streaming and sleeping schedule, everybody. Do you remember that? It's 4.30. I saw two shark. Where is it? She lied. People died. Wait, where is it? I don't see it. Ah. Oh, it's another. So I have this pickaxe. Oh. Oh, that scared me. Is it actually a crazy pickaxe or is it like just okay? It looks insane. Oh, it's an axe! So I can have both! I thought it was a pickaxe. It's an axe, so I can actually have both! I love it. I love it. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Thank you for the bits. <laughs> cute. Cute, 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 cute. Are you kidding me? I love it. I love it so much. Are you kidding me? It is very bloody groovy. Uh, no, Abayas, don't do the bedtime. Please, no, I want to stay. I want to stay. I don't want to go to bed. Please, Momos, I promise I'll be good. I don't want to go to bed. Please, Momos, please. I don't want to go to bed. I want to stay up. I want to have fun. Please. Look, look, look. I'm, I'm getting all the items. We're having so much fun. Please. Momos, please, please. I don't want to go to bed. Please, 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 please. I don't want to go to bed. Please, 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 please. Please, I don't want to go to bed. Please. I'm having so much fun. Please. Wait. Oh my god. Remember what I told you all. Quitters quit. 
winners stay up and stream and get two chain uh, get two shark tools winners get a golden kappa train in the middle of the night winners get that cr really crazy 100 gifted from anonymous earlier that was insane turbo thank you for the prime surly thank you for the five gifted tommy thank you for the gifted havel thank you for the gifted you know what i know my gifted do not matter for the hype train it's a gift but this is for you all. Thank you so much for lurking and watching the stream. Aza, thank you for the five gifted. I'm basically in a whole new time zone now. It's a gift sub. Whole new time zone. With whole new everything. Octo, I'm still going and now we got a golden <laughs> cap. I can't go now. I can't leave now. Matarakan, my beautiful oiler. Thank you so much for the 20 gifted. Azatot, thank you for the five gifted. Havel, thank you for the five gifted. Color, thank you for the bits. I'm telling y'all. Next time you want to give up, next time someone tells you, go to bed. Restrict, re respect your, your sleeping schedule. Do not go to bed. Stay up. Get the golden kappa train. Stay up. Get the crazy fishing tools. Don't go to bed. Thank you for the raid. Welcome up. raiders. You guys came in at a perfect time. We're getting a golden golden kappa raid. I just fished out two crazy items. It's I'm new to Terraria, but I'm having a ton of fun. Thank you. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um Quentin, thank you for the bits. Road spikes, thank you for the bits. Bang, thank you for the community gifted as well. Um, Matt, thank you for the gifted. Vengeful, thank you for subscribing. Geary, thank you for the gifted. The gift Abayas, thank you so much. I'm having so much fun, as you can see. I, I'll be honest with you. The reason I don't want to go to bed is because I know that next time I'm not streaming this immediately. Like, next time I know that instead of streaming this game, I will... Oh, hold on. Is he going to die? Yes. I will be signing posters and then I'm going to have other games and other things. So I might not play this anytime soon. Denny, thank you for the six months. Sabo, thank you for the for the bits, Cap Attacks. I honestly feel the same. I play games I like, so I totally understand. Thank you, Hashira, for the bits. It's just addictive. Thank you for the golden Kappa. You're welcome. Right, Melly? I'm having a lot of fun. What were you streaming today? Thank you for the raid. The Golden Kappa tax for Matha. Thank you, darling. <gasps> Oxai, where'd you get your Golden Kappa from today? You know that guy. Thank you so much for the gifted. And Shinku, thank you for the bits. Ow. Thank you, everybody. What the heck? Another one? I'm just gonna keep swimming. I'm just gonna keep swimming. I'm just gonna keep swimming. I'm just gonna keep going. I'm just gonna not think about it and swim. I'm just gonna keep swimming and keep swimming and not think about it, okay? I'm just going to keep swimming. Thank you, Leaping, for the bits. I've never finished Mass Effect Andromeda, actually. I have never done that. I hope you have fun with it. Ooh. Ow. Ooh. Just thank you so much for the gifted. No, nope. still the same quest. Let's go fish a little bit more and then go back to him. You aren't missing much. Yeah, I know. I know. It's... I know. I know. Oh. Sand castle bucket. Places sand castle. Shark bait. Uh-oh. Sharp breeding reed. Increases breath time and allows breathing in water. Nice. Oh. Wait a second. Oh, God. I'm going to die. I'm going to drown. 
Hold on, let me wear... I don't even have my flippers on. Sorry, hold on. I gotta go get my stuff back. I gotta go get my stuff back. I think the day reset. Thank you. Thank you for the raid again. I really do appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you, and welcome everybody. Sorry, everybody. I'm so... You know what? You've streamed all day. And then your brain, all you can really focus on is more stream things. My brain is only, only on the stream things. Anything that isn't a stream thing, my brain is, is not focusing on it. So I'm just absolutely in the stream. That's it. Thank you for the prime, Cynthia. All these quests are not what I wish for. Okay, so now, infinite jumping. Perfect. We're looting it. We're looting it. We're doing it. Another one. Godly trident. Ooh. Hold on, let's go back up to the surface. Oh wait, oopsies. I thought I was- I forgot, like, even though I can swim forever, that I can't actually breathe underwater. Increases mobility in water when held. Whose voice is it? M mine? Mine? Oh yeah, Mappy, we just set up my, um... We just set up my, um... My fishing pond in the desert because I had a desert quest. But then I let it let it go. I let it float away. Oh, I see it's slower. Okay. Look at me go. Alright, only two underwater chests. Is that good? Is that bad? How do we feel about that? Is that okay? Good? Trident? Worth it? Not worth it? Mid? Mm. Thank you, Repo, for the 500. Thank you. Will Mata blow herself up with the bombs? So far, it's average. Mm. Well, you know what? I think these chests were big, plump, pleasant. I enjoyed them very much. They might not have been the size that you wanted them to be, but I thought they were a really nice size. I thought their size was nice. All right. I had no complaints about their size. I was pleasantly surprised. So shark bait is another pet. Oh! Cutie! Look at him! I like him so much more than the chicken. Is it, But I wonder if he's gonna fight or if he's gonna be useless like the chicken. I guess if he's useless like the chicken, at least he's cute. Repo, thank you so much for the gifted. Oh my goodness. Thank you everybody for the, for the golden Kappa train. Thank you for all the bits. Thank you for all the um, gifted. Alright, I'm going to bed. No, I'm kidding. Imagine. I knew it. Oh, not bad. I knew I should have went to bed after those 100 gifted. But then I stayed, and now this. And then next time I'm going to want to go to bed, something else is going to happen, isn't it? Oh, oh, ah, ah. Thank you for spoiling me. And Yariko, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome. We just had a golden Kappa train. The chicken was not useless. It was just a little cock running around. It was useless. I love your new toy. It's beautiful. Didn't we have a golden Kappa, I think, three days ago or something? It wasn't that many days ago. My god, what a lucky day today in Terraria. Now I'm obsessed. I want to make underground ponds everywhere. Well, Ampelion, 
I got three reaver sharks and a sawtooth shark, and I just started fishing. And I just learned about fishing, so I think I'm doing okay. I think I'm doing all right. Ooh. Question. Is there going to be a nice underground area under the beach? Because if so, I can make an underground beach um, fishing area as well. Right? If I dig in the caverns... If I dig down to the caverns... Right? Not really. There's no caves under here. Won't be a different biome. Alright. It's time to put... Oh, annoying Falcon Blade. Aw. It's weak. Hmm. Where was my little chisel? There it is. I'm gonna get rid of my little flippers. The other beach might have it. Thank you, Repo, for more bits. Thank you. Oh, my God. Repo, darling. It's over. The Golden Kappa train's already passed. You have to wake up. The accident is over. It's done. Oh, yeah. The radar doesn't need to be on the equipment slot. Perfect. Let's get rid of the radar. Or do you mean it just has to be in the inventory? Because frankly, I don't know if I really care about knowing how many enemies I'm up against. Do I even need to know how many enemies I'm up against? It doesn't matter to me. Does it matter? All right, we're going to wait till nighttime for him to get another quest. Yeah, I've been streaming for uh for a little bit now. Oh, radar merges with items. All right, that's why everybody's been telling me to keep items. I see. I've noticed a lot of you were telling me to keep items, and I didn't understand why. With the glow stick, I'll be able to see if there's a cave. Guys, I think I'm addicted to this video game. I know I'm supposed to save my sleeping schedule, and I've been doing pretty good. I've been actually pretty doing pretty okay to save my sleeping schedule, but... I think I'm addicted. Oh, there we go. I think I'm addicted. I don't know. I don't know how to put it any other way. I took the day off for meetings, but I'm going to be going to bed at like 7 in the morning again. All right. Okay, see, this looks different. This looks like the beach, but underground. This is a different biome. Look, look, look. So I'm correct. If I build an underground lake in here... If I build a lake here... It will work. Sleep? I don't want to sleep. I'm not even sleepy or anything. Thank you, Depo, for the vids. What the heck? Boop. I feel so spoiled. Of course I'm still here. I've discovered how addictive this game can be. Right, Yomo, the longer I stream, the more the more I lose my mom powers. It's how it works. Oh, I see, Abba. 
So this would work if this was in any other place. Mm. I wonder why. I wonder why it's this way. In any other place, it would work except here. Rip. Oh well. Yeah, I think that's what it is. It was exactly the same thing with the... Um, with the... Uh, what was it called? Boop. It was exactly the same thing with the store simulator, right? Ripo, thank you for the bits. Also, how can I stop when Ripo's giving me so many bits? I can't stop until Ripo stops. I'm sorry. It's their fault. Blame Ripo. Okay. Don't put that pressure on me. Ah. 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 Ooh. Ah. Thank you for the bits. <laughs> Damn it. You can find more ocean chests. Perfect. That's why we're there. We're looking for the ocean chest. Take me by the hand, ocean chest. I'm gonna... I guess I could keep both sharp breeding rod and the other thing for if we find ocean chest. Let's go! Yeah, it's a little shark. Do you like him? He's cute. I found him underwater. I see a little something. A little silhouette of a man. Ocean chests? Okay. Real question now. Would the ocean chests be at this... Like, this deep or would they be deeper? Thank you for the bits, Repo. <laughs> oh my goodness. He keeps me going better than a coffee. You know what, everybody? It's Joel's fault. I know, sweet Joel has nothing to watch at 7 in the morning. Poor sweet Joel, all alone. This is why I stream. I stream so poor sweet Joel can have something to watch. He's not the only one. Same for all of you, my loves. It is how it is. It is what it is. Thanks, Matara. You're welcome, Joel. I'm here for you. But realistically, has your sleeping schedule always been this bad or did I help ruin it? Okay, it's this way. It's no longer my fault. It's Joel's fault. It's both your faults. You can share the blame. I think it's really nice to share the burden. I think it's the mark of a good Momo when you're able to divide the work. I think it's the mark of a really good Momo when you can divide the work. So I think you both should share the blame. How many traveling merchants has she missed? A million. Whatever they have in their inventory is nothing compared to what these caves carry for me. Think of the children I can find in the mines. Think about all the treasures we can find. The chests. Ooh, a little bit of water. And a little bit of Monica in my life. Hmm. This is long, not that I'm complaining. You heard that? And they say length doesn't matter. And they say things at times, sometimes. Thank you, Ripo. Thank you for the bits, darling. Again, sharing the burden with Joel of today's stream. Thank you. Thank you for sharing the burden. 
both your faults. It's also Zero's fault. If it wasn't Zero's birthday, I wouldn't be streaming for so long. But because it's Zero's birthday, I feel that I have to stream, right? I have to stream for Zero's birthday. How could I not? You know one day, it's for real going to be Zero's birthday. And then what are we going to do, y'all? What are we going to do when it's for real one day going to be Zero's birthday? Are we even going to believe, believe Zero on the one true day of his birthday? Thank you. Oh my god, Ripo. <laughs> Ripo's like, you know what? It's always been my fault. You take the full blame there, Ripo. I see you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the bits. What the heck? I really, really appreciate it. Oh. I like how I'm just doing my best in mining. And meanwhile, Ripo is like, hmm. I don't think this stream has enough action. Excitement. Adventure. I think it needs more. I knew it. I knew this was going to lead to another water. We are. Is that a rock? That's a trap door. Meaning, very large chance of treasure. If there is a trap, should there not be a treasure? People, thank you for the bits. What the heck is going on? I appreciate it. Hold on, everybody. Where there's a, where there's traps, there's treasure, correct? Or did the game just decide to give me a random little trap for funsies? With no treasure. It's not cool if it didn't give me... Hmm. The treasures are the traps. Hmm. You miss 100% of the treasures you don't steal, right? Is that what it is, Nina? Am I in a different cave now? Because it looks like it. The background is different. Underground lake. <laughs> I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with the underground lake. Question. Can somebody live in the cavern lair? Or that's not really where they want to live. And we found gotcha. Yes! Alright, you know what this means, everybody? We're building a home. Ripo, thank you for the bits! Boop. I appreciate it, darling. Look at all this gotcha we're going to get to do when we're home. All right. How deep is this cave? You already have a house in the underground? But that house is in the Mushroom Kingdom. This is a different house. With potentially different people living there. A home for wayward momos that have lost their way. Oh my goodness. Where are we? There's a railroad. Wow. Think about it. Is there wheelchair access? Well, there's a railroad. We can put you in a wagon. We can put you in a wagon, baby. Press R to ride. I don't have a mine card. Oh. I also accidentally broke the railroad. You don't need one? Oh! <gasps> this is the best game I've ever played. Excuse me? 
What? Can I fish there? I'm so lucky. Rifo, thank you for the bits. Don't jump in. The hell is this? Have you never seen this? Don't fall into the water. Jump in. 500 bits and I jump in. No, I'm kidding. Luckily, I have the mirror. I can go back home. So I'm fine. I can go back home. Oh. I can go back. What the heck happened here? Can somebody explain what just happened to me as well, please? That's my mama. First instinct fish. Look at your map. Yes. So I fell down, but why? So why is that shimmer such a rare spot? Just because it uncrafts your items? Oh. Did her game bug? Wait, was I supposed to die or? Only one pool appears per world? Well then how is it lucky if you're kind of guaranteed to find a pool? It's not that lucky. Oh, I see. I guess, yeah, it is like finding a needle in a haystack. I get it. All right, so what I could do, I could uh, go home with my mirror and then go back to, um, and then go back to, uh, Fishing Man. What a crazy adventure we've had. Crazy time to be alive. Skeleton merchant? Oh. It's a good thing he's there. I could actually go find him again because I can just go down. Right? I know where he is technically. Man, I love fishing. Boop. I love that acronym. Thank you for the bits. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to put a, a house near the Shimmer so I can always get there. Cool. You missed him. He's gone. It's okay. Let me get some water and then let's go fishing again. I can throw the Mana Star in the Shimmer. The blue one or the or the yellow one? Man, what a crazy time. The blue one? Thank you. All right. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to just throw all my... First of all... I think I'm just going to throw all my items in a chest. And I will worry about picking them up later. Okay? I think that's what I got to do. Boop. Throw hard crystal for buff meme. Brubby. I don't know if it's an AO, AO friendly stream because I am... I am sleeping real soon. I am sleeping real soon, my love. Don't Don't get too excited about this. Don't get too excited about this, my love. I'm sorry. How the heck have you been? No, please don't remind me about the time. I don't want to go to bed. I don't want to go to bed. I'm having such a fun time with you. 
You don't really want me to go to bed, do you? You want me to hang out. I can't go. Oh, oh. Sorry for my language. Beepo, thank you for the vids. Oh my god. I'm so spoiled. Oh, what the heck? Matara Khan. She is so spoiled. All right. It's time for Kakikurui Maestro. That's me. I did that all the time. I think I really ruined my eyesight doing that, actually. But I did that all the time. Hello, Peron. Was it a good work ship? I'm on my 11th hour of stream. Hi, Clover. Good morning. I know. I'm, I'm very... I'm very... I'm very... Hmm, when I'm sleepy. When I'm eepy sleepy. Kinda. Hmm. 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 I'm mm. No, no eat, no talk. I'm eepy. Hmm. Listen, I know right now my things are not organized well. I am aware. But I do not have time. I do not have time. I must. I must go fish. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, I think you guys did it. I think all this talk... I think all this talk of me being sleepy... Uh-uh. I think y'all finally... Okay, one shop. Stopwatch. Sake. Fancy dishes. Exotic chew toy. Cute. Oh, one platinum. Baby red panda. Hmm. I don't have money. Eripo, thank you for the bits. Oh, oopsies. Has been a nice short 11 hour stream. Yesterday was 13 hours, right? What about, um... 5% movement speed? Don't mind if I do? I wonder what my streams look like this week. What is that sound? Is it that bird? Aha! Got you, nerd! Got him! I heard you. You may not escape me, little bird. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, I'm getting sleepy. Caught in the desert. Caught in the desert. Caught I actually missed what fish he needed. Scarab fish. Let's go. Let's go. It's time. All right. Heart of the cards. Boop. Scarab fish. Huh. Let's go. To wake you up. Thank you for the bits. Boop. It's time. Come on, everybody. I believe. Do you believe in the scare fish? I need your energy, please. I need your I need your little your little fishing emotes and your energy, please. Oh no. I have to fight sleep. I have to get the fish. He needs the fish. I have to fight the sleep and get the fish. Hydration check. Durden, thank you for the six months. Oh, God. Maybe. 
Maybe I should consider starting to stream a little early. Ripo, thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. Because listen, if I had started streaming at... Oh, no. You know what time it is. It's revenge time. It's rematch time. It's rematch time. I have to do this. I'm sorry, everybody. I know he needs his fish. But I need my revenge. I need my revenge. For anybody that missed it previously, my internet cut out. My internet had cut out. And I died to the slime boss because my internet cut out. Yep. My internet had cut out. Yep. Yep. But now... It will not. All right, let's kill some slimes. Thank you, Depo, for the bits. You are insane, Depo. What the heck? Did you rob a bit bank today? What happened? What happened? Give me the bits. Give me the bits, Lebowski. Give me the bits, Lebowski. It's time. 100 slimes. Two, three. That's three slimes. Four. It's time to gamba. Zero, I'm sorry that you're just locked in these long streams with me. Five. Six. I know I've killed more before, but this is just for... Give me the slimes. Give me the slimes. They're coming. Come on. More slimes. We must hurry. Thank you for the bits! Man, you must really love Terraria. Once I kill the slime boss, will this mean that more villagers will move in? Because I want that. I want more teleportation. I want more villagers to move in. Nope. This boss sucks. Why am I fighting him? What is the point? Why do I live only to suffer? There's only one tied to killing a boss? So why are more villagers not moving in? I have so much room. He gives a mount. Does it increase movement speed? You're almost always awake at this hour. Shaking my head. When do you sleep? All right. Everybody. It's slime time. Slime time, baby. It's because right now, I don't have enough NPCs to populate all my, all my travel pylons. Sleep is for the weak. I, um... I don't want to freak anybody out, but an 11-hour stream is... is fairly normal for me when I'm... when I'm in my... when I'm in my... in my good mood. An 11 hour stream is, uh, fairly easy. I'm sorry for all the VOD watchers. I'm, that, I, I apologize to you. Every day you wake up and just stop. Another 13 hour Batara Khan stream. Whoopee! Oh, yeah. As a mouse watcher, mm -hmm. anything under 18 streams is baby times. True. That is the best part about watching VOD. You watch them at 1.5 or 1.25. Mm. Speaking of VODs, exclamation mark VODs, my VOD channel is recently under new management. Zenti's been taking care of it, and it is doing great. Lots of things on it. Games separated, games updated. Example, the other day, I played Terraria. 
I played Hell Divers, and then I played Death Must Die. Probably gonna be three different VODs. Right, Zenti? <laughs> Zenti? Zenti? Mm hmm. I wonder what it sounds like with all the gift subs when it's just, uh, it's a gift sub. It's a gift sub. It's a gift sub. All right. It's time. Come here, slime. Soon. You've been woken up by mouses going live alert. That's cute. I like that. I like that. I know, obviously, she streams when she streams, but I love when she does day streams. I love, love, love it. Because then I can wake up and I can have her and Zen, and then Giga goes live. Sometimes Fruit is live. All right, everybody, I got to focus. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I all tapped from the game. Okay. I am not where I need to be. Okay, this is already going better than the last time I did this. The music is great. Ah! Oopsies, oopsies. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Too bad my bow is slow. Can I just... Oh, I have to keep pressing the bow. I can't just spam the bow. Ah, 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 ah. Get out. Hold on. Oh man. I feel like he's getting harder. Okay, hold on. I just gotta aim at him. Ignore the little slimes. Just ah, aim at him. Eldon? Your stuff can wait. Your stuff can wait, Eldon. Your stuff can wait, baby. Stop falling from the sky, you stupid slimes! Thank God my PC didn't disconnect at the most important time twice. That would have been so incredibly unfair if that happened, right? Thank God my whole neighborhood didn't lose power. Thank God there wasn't a random snowstorm. Beautiful. I did it. I finally did it. Victory is mine! We did it, everybody. That felt good. Solidifier. Used to craft objects. Yippee! The victory belongs to us all. Okay, let's think about it. You were cute. You gave me moral support. Yeah, I guess I could share the victory with you. Thank you, Moron, for the tier three for six months, my dear. Thank you. Next boss is at the left side. We'll go there. Oh, wait, what? Who are you? Kaplunk! Hmm, <laughs> bleb. <laughs> Little guy! He's so cute. Okay. I'm not gonna lie. This is kind of the perfect time to end stream. Am I right? I know some of you might say, Matara, don't go. The night is young. Do not go, Matara. So many adventures await us. But I do not want to ruin my sleep schedule again. I just stopped going to bed at 10 a.m. Please let me go. Bismillah. God, what a great time. I really want to play this game again. I really want to play this game again. What time do you sleep now? Hopefully I'll be asleep by 7 a.m. 
Yeah, Zenti, enjoy the 13-hour VOD. How are you going to cut them? I'm sorry. Oh, no, wait. It's 11 hours and 22 minutes. Never mind. It's perfect. You can just one VOD it on Twitch. You know what? Sorry, everybody. It's either going to be a 16-hour stream or a less than 12-hour stream. One or the other. It's one or the other. I had so much fun. Hold on. Big Momo. Into the garbage can you go. My loves. I've had such a fun time. I had such a great stream. I'm sorry that I will be leaving you. I am getting a bit tired. Thanks for the comfy stream. Thank you for the huge generosity repo. It is so appreciated. Thank you so much for the bits. Um, thank you everybody for sticking around. So the plan is tomorrow, unfortunately taking the day off. Like I said, I have right now four meetings booked for tomorrow. Most of them in voice uh, for projects and things like that. One of them is for my PC. Friday, I will try to go live at 3 p.m. Eastern uh, to sign Streamily posters. I still have a lot of Streamily posters left to sign. I think I still have another 100 on sale for signing. Um, but that's going to be all on Friday. Saturday, Sunday, unfortunately taking the days off because I am going to a Sonic concert in another city. I'm going to be traveling with some friends. We're going to have a good time. Monday, I'm back. And uh, by tomorrow, I think you mean today. No, I mean tomorrow. Tomorrow doesn't start until I go to bed. I don't care if it's 7 in the morning. Tomorrow starts when I wake up. So. Tonight. I go to bed. Monday, I will be live. I will do I'll, I will start doing schedules again. I know it's been the last few weeks, no schedule since I came back from Japan and Thailand, but I will be doing schedules again. Mm, I will be doing schedules again starting this Monday. Next week, either a little bit of Terraria. Honestly, I kind of wouldn't mind doing a whole week of Terraria. And then once I'm done with Terraria in April, we do three days of Mechanicus so I can finish it. And then Vampire the Masquerade, maybe like three, four days in a row so I can finish it. That could be really nice. I really need to finish some games. I really need to finish some games. I just need to figure something out with the chest management. Because I have way too many items in that. I think I'm going to need to have a whole... I'm going to need to make my house bigger. I'm telling y'all. Something's going to have to change. Absolutely something's going to have to change. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hanging out. I had such a phenomenal day today with everybody. Thank you for spoiling me. Thank you for the gifted. Thank you for the rates. Thank you for everything. It's been wonderful. It's been great. It's been wonderful. Hmm. I want to talk to you a little bit before I go to bed, but... Even my lips are starting to chap a little bit. <laughs> Even my lips are starting to chap a little bit. I gotta, I gotta take a shower and go to sleep. But I will be in the Discord tomorrow. So if you haven't already, please join our Discord. Even if you're not subscribed, you'll be able to see some um, of the alerts and all the new stuff. But then if you are subscribed, you'll be able to chat. We have a really nice community there. I hang out in Discord all the time. And uh, I might do one of those co-working streams again like I did before where I just kind of sit in Discord and work on things. Because I have a lot of that to do tomorrow. I basically... April 1st cannot come soon enough. I know I've talked about this so many times, but I mean it. I think you're all going to be blown away April 1st. I think so. I think you're all going to be blown away. I think so. I hope so. I think so. It's not an April Fool's. It's like one of the... It is the opposite of an April Fool's. It is an April gift. It is an April win. You know? 
Yeah, it's an April Smarts. Exactly. There will be no fools, only smarts. All right. I am going to raid a streamer that I've not raided before, but I think they are wonderful. And uh, please remember when we raid somebody, you are a little bit responsible for, uh, you know, you represent me and this community. So I am going to be raiding Diariku. I think she's wonderful. I absolutely love her model. I absolutely love the rigging she did for Shy Lily's model. I love her art. I think she's great. I love foxes. She's currently in Japan. Let's give her a big, big, big raid. And uh, let's have a really cute raid message for her. Mm, what can it be? Thank you, Nina. Thank you for hanging out. I really appreciate it, darling. Let's give her a nice raid message. Sleepy Momo raid, maybe? Time to mobilize. That is so cute. I just imagine you rolling into battle. I just imagine. All right, everybody. Time to mobilize. Thank you again for watching. Thank you again for hanging out. We're above 7,000 sub points again. We were almost at 7,000. Now we're at 7,193. This is crazy. You know what? My oiler Matara will take care of this. My oiler Matara will take care of this. That's wild. Just earlier today, I was saying, oh, we're so close to getting back to, you know, 7,000 sub points. And now, 7,200. Thank you, Matara Khan, my oiler. I appreciate you. All right, Keep Momos. Up. Good night. Oyasu mama. Oyasu mama. Good night, my loves. I will see you tomorrow. Oh, Friday. I will see you Friday. I hope you have a great sleep. I hope you enjoyed Diariku's stream. Please give her a nice raid. If you like your stream, stick around. If you have a prime or if you have a little gifted, consider dropping it there. And uh, I will see you soon, okay? Get out. Mobilize on out of here. Roll out. Momo bots. Roll out. Deceptimomos. Roll out. To make it gross.